All right, everyone, we're live. Good afternoon or morning, based upon oh. where you are. We're here. We're live. Oh. Say, say bonanza that. in the chat if you can hear us. Ooh, I'm hearing I'm, someone. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm hearing someone listening to the stream. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, it was. Yes, it was only Ben. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I I certainly didn't have Twitch and YouTube open and and on at the same time. Uh, Hi YouTube, I, you I love you. I'm not gonna be noticing everybody, but I will notice ordinary Daniel. <laughs> Bonanza, yes, Johnny, and not Senpai. Thank you very much. That's not even <laughs> it's oh, Bonanza. B O N A N Z A. Wow, this is, this is starting off really. Whoa, who pulled out the Gwen Stefani? What? <laughs> Leave it to Clark. How's everybody doing and this morning? Oh, no, it's not, I can't say morning now because it's technically Oh, well, it depends where you are. Hmm. Oh, All my West Coast watchers. Well, Good everybody, morning. for everybody who matters, uh, afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad I'm someone who matters. Oh, that's, that's, that's sweet. That's really sweet. Uh, we always do these every year to raise money for uh, CHOP, the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, benefiting the Children's Miracle Network. And uh, normally we have these uh, centered around a specific theme or specific character. And this year we decided to give Pac-Man all the love because mm -hmm. this dude is celebrating his 40th anniversary mm -hmm. this year. 40 years old. 40 is like, he's almost this, zero. This is it. I mean, that after this is the midlife crisis, right? Oh, yes. As a as someone who's two years past yeah. that, yes. He's old enough to drink. <laughs> that, that, is, that is what's next. Oh, he's I, old I, enough to really drink. <laughs> here's here's what I expect. Here's what I expect out of you, chat, over the course of today. I expect midlife crisis Pac-Man artwork. I expect <laughs> Pac-Man in a red sports car, uh, growing his hair out long, uh, <laughs> which I am guilty of. Uh, uh, I I I want I want Pac-Man with a younger, thinner Pac lady. So we need because he's an idiot i was gonna say we he, already have um we we have the image of a uh, pac-man smoking a cigar so that's kind of midlife crisis <laughs> a little bit yeah you know uh drink it drinking a couple of white claws oh, do you have it on the <laughs> pac-man pac chugging down yeah, some white claws well actually pac-man's pac yeah there we go pac-man's yellow so it would be pac-man drinks yellow claws <laughs> he doesn't drink white claws <laughs> Don't ask where the white claw came from, or the yellow claw came from. <laughs> Just be grateful. They, yeah. they, they, they started out as white claws, but he drank a lot of them. It's a self-filtration uh, system. Uh, ulti, uh -oh. ulti in the chat, smoking his pack of cigars. <laughs> Gotta smoke it. Waka, 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 waka. Well, I'm gonna he needs to, he needs to help out his vocal cords. And, and you know what you know what's crazy is I, I it occurs to me looking at this image, I have never seen Pac feet. Because he, he's not because he's not wearing his shoes. Yeah, he's, he's just not wearing socks. his shoes. Who, he's just who, wearing socks. Who lounges on a chair going in their socks looking at something? I don't hey, excuse me, sir. Sometimes it's cold in my house. And I, you know, I wear my socks and I put a little uh, blanket over uh, my legs. Uh, so we're gonna be playing through all of Pac-Man's arcade games. That includes Pac-Man, Miss Pac-Man, Junior Pac-Man, Pac-Man Arrangement, Pac-Mania, Pack Attack, which is not an arcade game, but we're still playing it. And Super Pac-Man. And I think Pac and Pal and all these other damn games. And <laughs> all these other damn games. Damn you, Pac-Man, and your it's, 40 years of in history. The format, we Sure, I'm glad I've never played most of these games. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, so I, I, if it makes you feel any games. better, this is like the first time I'm really playing Pac-Man competitively. So, yeah, that's all the right. thing. Uh, if we want to do introductions now, we can, because I'm sure there's some new voices here that list that uh, viewers may not be familiar with. Uh, sure, do we want to just uh, yeah. run out of John, go ahead, this? since... You know, yeah, sure. sure. Hey, everybody. Cool. It's, uh, I'm John, so I'm calling me Johnny. Uh, I guess you could say co-founder of these extra life events that we do uh, every year along with Ben. And, you know, I'm a YouTuber. I look at, I review games, very laid back, and uh, I'm known to yell at times when I get pissed. So let's have a good time. Yay. Hey, Ben. Our next, you're next. 
Yep, so I am uh, Ben Woodring, better known online now as Ben's on the radio. I was an intern with the Preston and Steve show for, I guess, a year at 93.3 WMR. So you're in Philadelphia, you probably know what that is. Otherwise, I'm just some jackass who let talk on a college radio station. So I've been card. teamed up with Johnny to do the stream now since 2015. <laughs> and, well, this is year six of doing it, so I guess that was a good movie made. Here's to another successful year. Uh, Pitch, go ahead. All right, yeah, I'm also some jackass that was on college radio, too, so we're, we're <laughs> brethren there. Um, but also, uh, yeah, I, I'm also, I was also an intern for Preston and Steve as well, and uh, I still work for them on occasion, and that's how I met Ben, and he invited me to do this uh, wonderful uh, marathon stream. Um, I figure this is also a good transition for me because one of my charity things that I do is uh, a, a thing called the 24-hour game show marathon. Um, so this is kind of uh, like a nice uh, rel uh, related event. Um, so uh, I'm very uh, pleased to be a part of it this year. Uh, and I also like Pac-Man, so this is hitting all the this is checking all the check boxes. So I'm excited to play uh, play some Pac-Man with everybody here, and uh, this is this is uh, going to be fun. I can't wait. Uh, real quick, uh, Pitch, uh, folks didn't catch your name. Do you want to go by Pituation, Pitch? Uh, you, you, yeah, at this point, I'm I, I recognize both. Uh, yeah, my my. My legal Christian name was Rich, um, <laughs> but uh, yeah. On hey! Preston Steve. Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> uh, on Preston and Steve, I did a, I did a sound clip that my voice cracked in the middle of it, and I went, "Hey!" And, that was and you broke your microphone. Oh. Yeah, Discord didn't like that. <laughs> uh -oh. Oops. Right, yeah, and my that. claim to fame from MMR is uh, this gem. So, <laughs> for the same reason. Just literally hear the breath being sucked out of his body. <laughs> As you can imagine. Very good, very good. So yeah, rich or pituation, whichever you want to call me, I'm fine. Pitches, right. man. Pitches. All right, sounds good. Uh, King. Hi, I'm King K. Uh, I make, I guess, video essays, and I call them retrospectives. <laughs> I'm not sure you're allowed to make individual videos called retrospectives, but I do it and people click on it. So you know what? There you go. That is all that matters. <laughs> well, uh, why don't you, uh, uh, we might as well pl uh, plug your YouTube channel while you're real quick, uh, like URL and all that sort of thing, youtube.com slash. Uh, I, d I don't know what, I think it's. I don't Did know you... what my URL is. <laughs> oh, hell, and... just look up King K. I'm probably the first one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, Uncle? Uh, everybody, uh, my name is uh, Uncle Silver, a.k.a. Silver Greg, a.k.a. Greg, whatever you're comfortable calling me. Uh, Greg is totally fine. Uh, I More stream Latino on Jesus, which I like Twitch. <laughs> yeah, right? Uh, I stream on uh, Twitch, and I have a YouTube channel that I sometimes remember that I have. Uh, but other than that, you know, we're here to raise some money and, you know, not too much focus. We're here to play some Pac-Man games and talk about the yellow circle for as long as possible. Not the sun. <laughs> yeah, no. That's a different yellow circle. Uh, is there anybody that uh, needs to oh, introduce uh, Clark, themselves? Give me... oh, okay. Uh, hey, guys, it's me, Chris Clark. Uh, you guys probably <laughs> remember me from last year and the year before, uh, two years before that with Mario Mania and the Air Horn. But uh, I, I'm also on P the PJ Campbell Network, and uh, every Wednesday I host Suddenly Soundtracks, where we judge a movie solely based on the soundtrack that it provides. And we recently did something for Extra Life this past week with Johnny and uh, and Ben, and uh, it was really fun. So uh, we were going through video game soundtracks, so... Oh uh, yeah, music is. I love music, so bada bing, bada boom. We're gonna rock this sucker, and, and let's let's dig it. Yeah, Gibby's the last one. Uh, I'm Gibby. I'm probably the least uh, least cool evil. person here. Yeah, but but I do an important <laughs> job. I bring it all together. Um, I'm managing mostly uh, where all the videos coming in and out of, uh, since we're all remote this year, and not in one place. So. Yeah, it, sh it should be it shouldn't be understated to be important for this role because he's uh, he's been our tech guy for like since we started doing this thing really. Yeah. 
and uh, yeah, without yeah, he him. He was a Wawa runner the first year we did this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, that, that, you know, that, that was against his will, though. So, uh, but without Gibby, we wouldn't be able to do this. I think he was born on a Saturday night in January. Without and Gibby, we wouldn't, we wouldn't be able to do this, or at least we wouldn't be able to do it as professionally, in quotes, as we could do it uh, throughout the last couple of years. So, uh, Gibby, don't sell yourself short, man. You are, like, the the soul of this event, so... I mean, I take him a round of applause, but I, I I don't have a applause ready for the oh, soundboard. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, you nice. are so <laughs> you are so. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Let me switch over to C. And everyone's feed work. went away. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> nice. There yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a link. It's in the it Discord. Under, under dis discussion. discussion? Yes. A discussion. Okay. I went to text that up. Don't act like I don't have 92 <laughs> channels here that I can't look into. <laughs> it's in the Discord. You're one of those people, aren't you? You're gonna be one of those one of those uh one of those boomers. Uh can I can I look that up on the Google? Someone in chat says my screen looks like a creepypasta. That's interesting. Yes. Yeah, I don't know I, what that means. Fun <laughs> for my phone. On which chat? Oh, God. And that should update the URL so Ben shouldn't have to do anything now. Hate that we call it URL and we don't just say Earl. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I don't <laughs> call it Earl. Because I'm going to update oh. Earl. I know someone named Earl. I'm going to update Earl. <laughs> I can't get that on my head. All right. I, 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 I just want to I just want to go ahead and uh, emphasize, like, we, we didn't even begin yet, and we're already over $1,000. I, yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that, that's uh, Oh, that's impressive. excellent. <laughs> yeah. That's great. Yo, I got 28 credits, man. I would be a baller right now. <laughs> 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 like All right, cents we are each. ready to go. Three, two, uh -oh. one. All right. I, I hit the credit button again. It's All right, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, the Bomby Brit is back, donating a dollar. Hey, y'all. Bomby here. I was the guy who, whose comment had been say, failed pilot of Bolo. Oh, that wasn't dolls. me. That, that was Clark. That was me. That was Clark. <laughs> that was me. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> yeah. uh, during during Mario Mania. Well, I am black. I am back. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wow. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> And flagged. Hey, I mean, go for that first. <laughs> All right, we're getting taken down. <laughs> I am back. Uh, oh. my my first go experience ahead. was the arcade mm -hmm. and the uh, Atari Twenty Six Hundred Pac Man, uh, oh, which God, was, sorry. which to me is uh the biggest symptom of the downfall of the video game world. Uh, everybody blames E. T. Uh, I do not blame E. T. I blame Pac Man. See, E.T. isn't to blame because he was put in... He, it was asked to make that game in five weeks. Well, my my problem with E.T. Uh, it's it, Sorry, this is going to derail everything. Uh, my problem with E.T. was that when people played E.T., if you if you liked it or you didn't like it, it, it was E.T. Like, that was it. It was, it, was, it was E.T. There was no other game before. So you played it and you said it was good or you said it was bad. Pac-Man, everybody had an expectation of what Pac-Man was supposed to look like. They'd been playing the arcade game for a while. They jammed this awful version of Pac-Man onto the Atari. So when everybody bought it, they got home and they played it and they said, wow, this is kind of awful. And that to me is a bigger problem. Like I was more put off of the Atari by Pac-Man than I ever was by E.T. Just, is it because because Pac-Man was such a beloved thing on the arcade? It, not not only was it a beloved thing, but there was an expectation. Yeah. When you played Atari Pac, when you played arcade Pac-Man, you bought the Atari Pac-Man and you said, "Oh, it's going to be kind of like that." And then it was as as badly not like that as possible. When you bought ET, it was like, "Okay, let's see what Oh god. Uh it was like, "Let's see what this is like." And it it sucked ass. Sorry. And ever, but ever, but there was nothing to compare it to. There was nothing to go and say, "Wow, this could have been better," just like the arcade version. There was no arcade version. There literally was only one Atari, one ET game ever. So there's no baseline to compare it to. Yeah. It, where, whereas with with Pac Man, you had a baseline, and there was a massive wave of disappointment when you played it. And because I liked Pac Man on Atari, and even I think 
I mean, I like it as its own thing, but ultimately, it's kind of terrible. <laughs> yeah. Snatch Rules donated $10, said it's time for a 24 uh, dot chomping, ghost avoiding Pac-Man thrill ride, ride for charity. Have fun, everybody, and go Johnny. Sounds too snessy. Uh, yes. oh, shut up. <laughs> what, what is that? What is that word? What does that even mean? <laughs> is, is, is it's, that the, the it's the SNES version of Genesis Twain. Yeah, okay. I, well, I thought it was that I thought it was that monster that lives in the lock. <laughs> what that means? <laughs> the lock SNES well, <laughs> uh, <laughs> monster. And it's a controller sticking out of the lake. 16 bits of terror. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, dude, Loch Ness Monster, I want it. Yeah, uh, yeah in Scotland. <laughs> Pumpkin Fox donated $53.75. So exactly. uh, says, hey yo, this is my first time joining one of these streams. Hey, oh. Johnny, uh, uh, Johnny, your channel has given me many years of enjoyment, even though by your standards, I really should, I really shouldn't have been watching. Oh. Uh, <laughs> wow! Yikes! No, Yikes! I think I know. I think I know what he's referencing. I think I know. What he's okay, referencing. I was yeah, gonna yeah. say. I was gonna uh, say. Uh, <laughs> you helped out the kids, but you just got roasted. <laughs> um, uh, Ouija uh, donated twenty five dollars. Uh, uh, Squeegee donated twenty five dollars. <laughs> <for sleep. laughs> First time. I'll let that go. First time donating uh, for for the kids. Love you guys. I almost donated 10k by accident. <laughs> no. Oh, but that oh, would have been the, the, oh, oh, why did I do that? Uh. <laughs> All right, so wait. Uh, David Scooter, uh, one 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 six eight eight. Uh, Matusek. Uh, if I uh, donated ten dollars, if it weren't for the pandemic. I would just kiss you after the four years of hell we have been through. Anyway, I am glad that Biden won. Here's to hoping for a brighter future. <sighs> David, you're right. Thank you very much. You want me to go? Oh, oh, God, that's not my Well, God. don't, because we're in the middle of a pandemic. You don't know where that ass has been. So. Oh. I mean, Pac-Man's Pac like half ass at this point, right? Uh, uh, Parik the Irish uh, donates $5 and says, You can freak me out. You can throw me in the lion pit. You can boil my hands and tell me I'm not here. I'm a mad Pac-Man living in a leveled world. Everywhere I go, I don't know where I am. Best of luck, everyone, on the donation train. I'm assuming those were probably like lyrics or something. Oh, probably you can Pac-Man freak favor. me out. You can throw me in the lion pit. You can boil hands. Oh, I don't know what the tune was, but I was. So <laughs> <laughs> you can he literally play some Pac-Man. <laughs> he literally just did all that, and it's like, oh yeah, that's not a song. Uh, <laughs> uh, no, no, uh, no, 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 Pac-Man. Uh, uh, <laughs> The letter H donates $10 and says, Hi, guys. After a hellish day at work, I can finally relax. And what better than to watch a charity stream? Good luck, everyone. Did you just say the letter H? Yeah. That's yeah. what it is. Yeah. It's yeah. The, the letter H. H. The letter I never H. Got... Wow. I can only think H. of that who's line bit where you talk about Sesame yeah. Street from where Oh, and it's a The letter thing. H. Yeah, I got it, yeah. Capital H. Uh, yeah. Jason. Uh, Jason Blaze donates $100. Woo! Hey, Jason. Uh, I'll try to join in a bit. I don't have a webcam, so I may need to use a second account for my phone. Uh, also sucks I got to use webcam because I hate getting dressed. Oh, you and because you were button. flagged before, I am black. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. I'm sorry. I'm so Jason. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Uh, I love you, Callum. Callum donates five dollars and says, "Got furloughed for a week on pay, so I thought I'd give a bit." Uh, what's Pac-Man's favorite kitchen utensil? A wok, a wok, a wok, a wok, a wok. <laughs> oh, <good. laughs> How that is appropriate. Oops, stop, 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 stop. Okay. Oop, there we go. Uh, General Godzilla donates thirty dollars and says. General. Uh, yeah, General Godzilla. Wow. wow. Stepping it up. <laughs> Stepping it up. <laughs> oh, my God. Just this, you know, uh, I would rather pay attention to General Godzilla than Godzilla's privates. It's kind of general. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hello, John and friends. I'm donating to chop the negativity in these children's lives into it. Wait, hold on. I'm donating to chop the negativity in these children's lives into nothing but a memory. 
Oh, oh okay. I think oh, I, I, okay. I Oh, okay. Hold on. Yeah. I'm donating to chop the negativity in these children's lives into another. Oh, oh my God. Jesus. Let's give them the chop. Yeah. Uh, also, <laughs> let, also <laughs> let the mispronunciation. <laughs> uh, let, let the mispronunciation storm commence. Put $25 to the switch, Rafael. <laughs> oh, wait. I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry. He said mispronunciation storm and threw me off. Put the wrong emphasis on the wrong syllable. Put this towards the switch raffle. I may not win, but you never know. You know what, bud? You, you could win. You, you have that. You, you did Some, win. <laughs> someone's got to win, right? I was yeah. just pulled. I wasn't allowed to make that call. Uh, that is gambling. <laughs> Somebody's got to win. Uh, yeah. Anonymous. Most of these donations are going through John's uh, donation yeah. thing. Some people got other donations. I had a $25 anonymous donation. Uh, so I just wanted to say thank you awesome. to that person, whoever that was. That's amazing. Thanks, you guys are all like warm hearted and amazing. <laughs> Uh, yeah, just like a, 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 a coffee cake fresh out of the oven. A, vis a vigilant <laughs> Mike donated $50. What a, what a weird grab. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, I like Pac-Man because my Chinese history professor used it to explain Buddhism. What? Uh, <laughs> right. Hold on. Hold on. I, I, have, I, have a, I have a question. I have a question, but I want you to finish reading that donation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If if you can uh, put my donation down towards the Pac-Man arcade raffle, that'd be great. Yeah, you got it. All right. So Ooh. so here's my question, Vigilant Mike, because I'm pretty sure you're watching. Thank you, by the way. Is this a professor of Chinese history, or is this your history professor who is Chinese? I, 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 I'm not sure, and I've, I don't know why I need clarification, but I kind of need clarification. <laughs> I want to take a class with this guy. Yeah, I, I don't know. Is, is he what? teaching Chinese history or is he teaching history and he is Chinese while he does it? <laughs> while he does it. Anyway, the okay. Wow, this next one. Oh, uh, that was so close. Uh, the the Bonnie. He's now calling himself the Bonnie Black. <laughs> you can't make this up we're, we're not even an hour in <laughs> by the way hold on a vigilant mike commented uh he's a chinese guy who teaches chinese history okay. thank awesome. you because that would have driven me crazy all day oh that's awesome <laughs> I, just, I just want one lesson what what how how does this relate to, to buddhism <laughs> What? I just want one of the teachings. You know, if you play Pac-Man for long enough, you'll it's ascend, I think. <laughs> yeah, Buddha's favorite diet is cherries, uh, bananas, strawberries. Uh, yeah. I think that's a villain. Buddhism involves a lot of dark rooms and taking a bunch of pills and possibly seeing ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> pill is it? Is it? Is it Buddhism? Is it a rave? I have no idea. <laughs> All right. So uh, uh, to continue what Barmy Black was saying, uh, th though if this th this ends up like the groin situation, I'm happy to, to suck for this. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> God. Clark, you realize this is why they're writing the long ones to you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do some screening on your, on your <laughs> messages. Oh, my God. <laughs> Well, at the end of that, when he says, uh, should ask a question, thoughts of Pac-Man and Smash. Um, I yeah, realistically, oh, yeah. realistically, Barmy, let's be honest here. Pac-Man's never going to make it into Smash. Come on. <laughs> that's just that's just great. You're more likely to see the guy from Minecraft in Smash Brothers than you will to see Pac-Man. Hold on. I'm getting a text message. <laughs> Smash 4 came out. Uh, Daniel, hold on. Hold on. Is that... Actually, Clark, why don't you Rezescu. read that name? Uh, yeah, yeah. Daniel Rezescu. Uh, Fucker. Uh, 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 I know. I know who that person. I know that person. Like, I know how. I know what okay. person you're talking about. It's like fuck you. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm just gonna call you Dan. He, uh, Daniel. Uh, <laughs> Daniel. Daniel. I'm sorry, but he joined. He did donate the three hundred dollars. He said, "Cheers and best Woo! of luck to oh. you guys in the event." I'm so glad I can watch this live. I've been working six days a week, six days a week, uh, for the last few weeks because a coworker had a COVID diagnosis in the family. Oh, um, oh, sorry to hear about that. Yeah, so sorry to hear that, but you, you're a rock star. Uh, she's fine, thankfully, as is her family. Okay. That's amazing. That's oh, I take it back then. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus. <laughs> Mick ben Yeager donates five dollars. Oh. It says you are going to. Well, oh, Clark, go ahead. 
Oh, give finish me one that second. Up. Go get, get, finish one. Okay, up. it says oh, you're um, going to Portugal. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, wait, yeah, Portugal. Oh, fuck. <laughs> wait, did you do it again? Oh, wait. Oh, it oh God, come on. I wasn't even thinking. It, that, that's, oh, God. You're great. Mick, Mick, uh, Mick, Mick. Mick, yeah, that's right. Mick, yeah. Mick, ja Mick Jagger. Yeah. Yeah. Mick Jagger. Um, it is Mick Jagger. Uh, Three, yeah. two, uh, J. Romy. one. Uh, J. Romy donates $25. Right, it end. says Pac-Man World for when? All right, uh, that's it. Yeah, the so, round. Uh, oh, wow, that's what Johnny it is said. over. It looks like. So is that is that pitch? Pitch, it is. I pitch can't see is Johnny's screen. Seventy-seven thousand six hundred and fifty points. Woo! Hey. I came in second, seventy thousand five hundred. Johnny third, sixty-nine five ninety, and King K at fifty-two two ten. Yeah, figures. That's <laughs> good. That's good. <laughs> awesome. Well, All right, that. And we could probably. That means uh, that means pitch along. is the loser. <laughs> All right. We're going by uh, golf yeah. rules, no. idiot. <laughs> Remember, oh, I didn't realize this is a pretty hot take, but uh, Pac Man's fun. I like Remember, uh, whoever comes in first loses. You should always come in second at least. Uh, what, what's your What's your earliest memory of Pac Man? Oh. Uh, oh, yeah. Not Not necessarily game. Oh yeah, I remember going to a diner at one point with my grandma, and I got chicken tenders, and um, I went outside into the arcade and I saw the Pac-Man machine and it was a Miss Pac-Man machine and yeah, that was my first okay. experience with it. They, by the way, there's something super wholesome about the fact that you had to mention you got chicken tenders. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. Like, I, I, I don't mean to point that out, but that it, it is kind of like, that's adorable. Like, because now, because you know what, you know what I'm picturing? Now I'm picturing Clark like yeah. as the, as like three or four foot high yeah. Clark, three, probably like three foot high, <laughs> but with the face that he has now, yeah. Uh, not like a kid version <laughs> face, but then he's walking out with these chicky nuggies. <laughs> yeah, chicken nuggies. Yeah, I love chicken nuggies. Uh, this is great conversation. Jit thought that was like the end of your story there at the chicken nuggets. <laughs> yeah. <it's> just... <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, well, what did I have to do with Pac Man? What the hell is a Pac Man? <laughs> oh, that was my first experience seeing a infiltrate. Did I load up the, the wrong Miss Pac Man? <laughs> Uh, yeah, you rolled it up the arcade version. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, uh, you go uh, ahead. Chris Fr Fratz uh, donates a dollar. Here's an extra dollar to tell you that I forgot to put my name in when I was talking about the double fun fact about Pac-Man World. Okay, so his name is Chris Fratz. Uh, okay, thank you for reading that, by the way, because I would have almost said Chris Farts. Uh, I'm, I'm really glad I didn't say that. My apologies. Uh, uh, Vul Vulture Dick. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Uh, Vulture Duck donates ten dollars. <laughs> hey, hey, Johnny. <laughs> here's here's. Okay. Here. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, hey, Johnny. Here's some money for the for the kids. I'm. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. I'm grateful that you are done. Uh, my, my, my friend Nathan is changing his name to uh, Vulture Dick now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, also, also so hey, Nathan. The moon Love you, man. Is a, is a better game than, than Harmony of Dissidents. Sorry if this was about Castlevania, not Pac Man. No, you're fine, uh, Vulture Duck. Talk uh, about yeah. whatever. Yeah, you can talk about whatever. There's pitch. I don't want to see Michael Keaton's dick. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, the Pac-Man donated $25, said waka waka waka, waka waka, waka 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 waka. He's, he's, he's singing a Bohemian Rhapsody. But <laughs> <laughs> that was that was actually read exactly as it's written too i love it uh which which leads very well into the yes. next donations five dollars from waka man uh waka says man. uh a chef boy uh chef kilo <laughs> oh i was oh hoping to say chef Boyardee. wow man no, i'm sad <laughs> yeah he just threw the second word out there completely chef Kilo, or as Matt calls me, Chef Chef Ke Pounds, because oh. we're in America. <laughs> chef Kilo, oh Kilo Neil, oh Chef Kilo Neil, donated twenty five dollars. Okay. Kilo Neil. Oh. Yeah, it actually. No, it's, it's says, Chef it says Kilo Neil. Chef Kilo oh, it's Chef Shaq. Kilo. I recognize the name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, Chef Kilo Neil. <laughs> That's a great name, bud. You're Chef um, Boyardee now, though. Yeah, uh, yeah. So. <laughs> it'd be a great restaurant. Uh, for, for basketball players, uh, uh, donated twenty five. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I speak? Why do I fucking speak? Uh, oh, yeah. Twenty-five dollars. Greetings from the UK. Just want to thank Johnny for all the years of great entertainment. 
I really hope I get to meet you in person one day, Johnny. Good luck and all the <sighs> Thank you, Garnet. I mean, I'd love to go. I'd like to travel abroad when America is open again. <laughs> uh, no, <laughs> America is open. Everyone else is closed yeah, to us. That's right. That's right. Juan donated $11.52. Hey, everybody. Today is a new Juan. day, Johnny. I have the full archive of a couple of your streams, such as S A G E O, oh, Sonic, uh, uh, S A G E yeah. 2019 and 2020. Can I ask for your permission to upload these to my personal YouTube channel? No, you All may right. not, because I still have them myself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, no, <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm making a highlights reel of that. I mean, I appreciate you asking, but that's also like, can I take your content and put it on my channel? <laughs> yeah, no, Juan also so... donates. Juan also donates negative eleven dollars and fifty two cents. <laughs> oh God. Uh, or, oh, oh my God. Otor Hinaliori Hijainanist. I will hopefully. I have uh, no idea what. The dark one is. comes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is that a, is that a donation? A spell. <laughs> it's, it's under my. It's under my. Man. You'll see it. Yeah. Um. Uh. Pumpkin. Oh, for, okay. Uh, Pumpkin Fox again. Five dollars. Said we love you, Clark. Always well. Thank you for that. Uh. And Andrew donated two dollars. Said. Da 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 Pac Man. Oh, da 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 Pac Man. That's me. Above all the lyrics to the old eighties Pac Man cartoon. Quick question, is menstrual Miss Pac Man on the table today? No. But what what is menstrual Miss Pac Man? I don't remember. I've never heard of that. Is that a ROM hack? It's a family guy reference. Possible. Oh, oh okay, yeah, okay, okay. yeah. I thought it was like okay. okay. Well, I didn't know it was a valid guy reference because oh, yeah. I was. That's a, that's a different. That's, for a second that's a there. different Pac-Man fever, y'all. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, it, I mean, depending on who you talk to, that's also that Super Princess Peach game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, uh, question for Johnny: Have you played Persona Five Five Royal? No. Uh, I'd die if you did a video. On it, well, I don't walk well, okay, I'll never I mean, do it. I don't want to kill anybody. Uh, it's one of my favorite <laughs> games ever. Yeah, right. I'm not gonna do it now. <laughs> now. Wait, much love from Montreal or Montreal. Yeah, <laughs> how you want to say it. That's how I used to read it a long time ago. It was like, it's Montreal. It's Montreal. Oh, Mark Casey uh, Marcusy. Yeah, Montreal. I don't know what that meant. Uh, I don't know. Let's talk about this version um, of Miss Pac Man. Uh, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Uh, I'll we'll go to the next step. So like, it's just cool. So we're yeah, playing uh, the strange. This right is now. the this is the Pac Man that I've had the most time in, like a time invested. Because again, I used to play this one all the time with my aunt. All right, so uh, John spent a lot of time in Miss Pac Man. Got it. Yes, exactly. <laughs> all right, got it. Can, it was with consent, Jesus back. Christ. <laughs> yeah. So what's cool about that's it is what like, she was saying. Did you pay for it? Yes. <laughs> yes, 25 cents. <laughs> <laughs> he had to pay 25 cents every time they wanted to start. Pactitution. That's a lot of credits. So Pactitution. <laughs> oh my god, King Kai has King Kai has She's like a Pactitude. <laughs> the Pactitude. She's a Pactitude on Twitter. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> no. Um we got a $10 donation from Ah! Real monster. That just says that just says I shat my pants. Wow. <laughs> well, I hope you wiped, bud. Well, yeah, it's like, well, uh, I mean, when you shit your pants, you're only wiping that process. Well, well, yeah, it's funny. Yeah, never it's mind. funny because never it's mind. funny because it would actually work better if the name was I shat my pants and the comment was ah. I think that's maybe what they they meant and they flipped it. Yeah, maybe. Okay, another one from the Blimey Black, but he said his name is now the Blimey Black Sucks. <laughs> yeah, that other guy sucks. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. $1. Okay, this is getting silly, but let's keep this going. I keep forgetting how much joy these bring to me in general. I am also doing fan art of the stream. Hopefully, Buddhist Pac Man will be up by the time this <laughs> comment is read. And I'm glad to have my meme art styles improved. Hi, Johnny. Uh, sorry hey. to make you feel old, but I've been watching your videos since I was 12. I just turned 19 last month. Holy shit, dude. Awesome. <laughs> Love your content, man. Keep it up. <laughs> I thought you said the C word. Wait, what? Oh. What did I? What? <laughs> Nothing. Oh, I didn't say yeah. it. I'm not gonna <laughs> it. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, Love your what? 
Uh, well, <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. Uh, SF5, I hope I didn't say anything. SF5, I, don't, I don't think you did. Okay, good. SF5 donated $3, and he did donate the C-word, charity. Okay, hey, hey, you know what, it, what I like? Charity. Are we planning the ZX Spectrum bootleg of Pac-Man? That's Pac ZX. <laughs> it's, um, it's British, so it's okay. I like to get that wrong. Oh, Z oh ZX. Ah, it's uh, a Z. That was like the England it's, version of the Commodore 64. That was like their oh, local company. But okay. it's called the ZX Spectrum. They just say Z over there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I thought it was like... Like the, like the Power okay. Rangers villain, Lord Z. Okay. <laughs> well, the, the Xanax spe Spectrum bootleg of Pac-Man, where Pac-Man screams, Oh, shite! As he dies. Right? It, would be, it would be shite since it's British, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, shite. Yeah, as he dies. Uh, yes, it's real. Look it I'll up. I'll be right and back. Right, hang on. Three, two, one. one. That's game. Oh, that's when I'm about to start this level. Perfect. I had to refresh because I. Uh, <laughs> what's my high score? Oh, here's my high score. Uh, I guess you gotta go back to the top. I <laughs> yeah, I gotta, I gotta scroll to the top. I gotta scroll. Seven to the top. six eight five zero oh, for me. Oh my God, that's close. Six six. I beat Johnny by like thirteen hundred points. God damn. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> And for those who have been keeping a score for the past few years, this is the first time since Sonic the Super Sonic Super Street might beat Johnny in the game. Want a cookie? Uh, that you sure. like, you actively played at the very least, yeah. <laughs> I tried. Like just giving up Pack halfway through. No, you won a couple of Sonic things. Yeah, that's exactly or it. Or cheat? Oh. Didn't cheat? No, Johnny cheat, gave yeah. up on the Sonic Advance <laughs> games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready, go. The oh. groin <laughs> donates twenty five dollars and says the groin has arrived, and as per usual, he has a request for the Johnny. <clears throat> Excuse yeah, me. It's a please say, at this point. please say, gentlemen, I am dropping the power pellets. Come at me, waka waka. Also, put the groin down for the switch wrap. Yeah, right, I'm gonna be it? honest, that chat. I'm playing the game and I still don't fully know what it is. So, gentlemen, <laughs> I am dropping my power. Gentlemen, <laughs> I'm dropping the power pellets. Yeah. Come at me, of the waka or something like that. Oh no, waka waka. So, waka. Yeah. Uh, EIP, uh, twenty-five dollars says on this joyous day, everyone deserves a. Tab Joy, EIP donates <laughs> one. That's awesome. Yes. Uh, Neptune. I love that statement. <laughs> yeah. On this joyous day, everyone deserves joy. Yes, <laughs> it's such a Fantastic. great pointed <laughs> statement. Uh, Neptune, <laughs> Neptune, right by uh, Saturn, donated two dollars. I need a refresh. And, and to be to be fair, Neptune is not right near Saturn. It's right near Uranus. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. tell me more. That means uh, okay. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was gonna make a butt joke, but I don't think that's good. No. Zach donated ten dollars. Said, "Hey Johnny, can I have your house?" No. All right, that's a no. I nice try. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, and you can't have your ten dollars back. <laughs> nice Game try, IRS. <laughs> yeah, Gamerbot donated. Uh, I need Amanda hug and kiss. <laughs> <laughs> I need a man to hug and kiss. Oh yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, oh uh, yeah. Uh, five dollars. You know <laughs> yeah, so it's from it's from it's from uh, it's hey, from, most it's from Simpsons. It was from Simpsons at Nose Tavern. Yeah. Why can't I find a man to hug and kiss? Man, that's Nose Tavern. Tavern. What do you want? <laughs> that's as hard to say as Ligma. <laughs> yeah. Uh, or Schmegma. Or Schmegma or Dick Cheese. <laughs> uh, Beast Gamer Five. <laughs> Question for all: What game has someone said? Was their favorite that you really hated? I think we had that question before, but no, um, we had it the other way around. What oh, was okay. what was reviewed badly that you liked? So what was reviewed well that you didn't like? Probably oh. Breath of the Wild. Oh, woo! It's too open ended. Spicy. Yeah, I know. Spicy. <laughs> Here's your chance to punch him in the face for his terrible opinions. Donate for fifty dollars. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, but Breath of the Wild. No, thank you. What, what was the indie game where? <laughs> what was the game where you were like a, a boy in the shadow? It was like an independent game. The Shadow Limbo. Uh, Limbo. Cup, Limbo. Cup I hated yeah. that. Limbo. Yeah. I hated that. I could not get behind it. I, I and I do a, I do a podcast. My coach loved it. He thought it was like the best thing ever. Uh, and, and I was like, this isn't really that good. Uh, what are you talking about? Hold on. Uh, for. for for my answer, I would like to turn to Twitch chat specifically, although YouTube mm. chat might know this one too. Chat, 
what's a game that everybody seems to love and that I have tried four separate times to play and for the life of me, just do not like it. Let's see. Let's see. I, I'm Zeppelin. curious to see. I'm curious to see if anybody. <laughs> somebody said Luigi's Mansion. That's a good one, but that's <laughs> not it. Luigi's Mansion isn't that good. Ryan gets it. Ryan gets it. Earthbound. Oh. oh okay. I, I. People tell me that it's a great RPG, and I've tried four separate times to play it, and every single time I'm like an hour in, and I just I I just sit there in a in a shocked state of mind thinking this is not it <laughs> i i don't i i, I just don't get it you know it's like uh, mother 3 actually does something that the other games don't do and it's actually make me care about the characters <laughs> mother 3 brought me to tears it yeah kinda... same and it yeah, was never mother 3 made me cry yeah uh secret... yeah, earth earthbound made me cry but for the wrong reason <laughs> uh, a secret boss sauce donated 25 dollars said here's some money now void those ghosts and gobble those balls for the children yeah, I mean, you're boss. gobbling balls. You're not gonna make a baby. You gotta gobble it somewhere else. <laughs> well, that, that, that's, why you, that's why there's Thanksgiving, Ben. Uh, Wait, what? Well, uh, gobbler. Uh, I, uh, well, oh, uh, gobbler. Uh, okay, uh, thank God. Say, uh, Thanksgiving that was, is the one I, holiday you do not have sex on. I, I was gonna <laughs> say I am not going to Clark for Thanksgiving. Uh, oh, I mean, it's very suggestive with the gobbler and everything, but is. Is Vulture Dick a really? Oh my God! Is Vulture <laughs> Dick a relative of Wonky Dick, uh, who uh, also who also lives in the states of Africa? Getting some deep lore here from. Oh, yeah, he's going deep. When was Wonky Dick? What's Wonky? That was one. Um, Wonky Dick is an SGB reference. Oh, okay. Uh, no, Wonky Dick is an SGB reference. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's heavily but, used uh, it during uh, but the state of Africa is a uh, Mario Mania. Reference. Yeah, that's 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 that was it. Yeah, I, I'm sorry, I don't remember that stuff. But well, yeah. during Mario Mania, we were doing uh, a yeah. Wonky Dick like a uh, pickle Rick. Oh yeah, yeah. Pickle Rick. Because someone else, and someone made reference to Wonky Dick in the comments in the uh, chat, and he just kind of transformed that into a different thing for Mario Mania. Yeah. I'm curious to know what is your personal favorite legendary duo trio quadruple etc. Um, across the generations, I'm I, I kind of am partial to the the Reggie threesome. They're great. Yeah, I, I had a threesome with a guy named Reggie one time. Oh, well, <laughs> I, I like the Reggies. Um, I, that I mean, that's I how he got like, Metroid Prime Four made. <laughs> I've always liked the uh, the Hoenn Weather Trio. Oh, I oh, like the Hoenn Weather Trio a lot. I, yeah. Oh, just legendaries in general. Just okay. legendary trios. Well, like trios. So like, yeah. Uh, what? Beasts. Nah, wait, what is the the, the weather? What was the weather tree? Oh, there was the uh, Tyranitar. Rayquaza? Not Tyranitar. No. The tor Tornadus. Uh, Tornadus. Groudon, and uh, um, Kyogre. Kyogre. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I really yeah. like the legendary dogs in general. Yeah, oh, yeah, they're cool. Like oh, yeah, they're yeah. great. Yeah. Uh, um, God, I don't even know if I. You know, I do. I will. I will give it to the Reggies because. They have a really unique way of finding them, even though it doesn't make much sense to me unless you had the manual growing up. Because I mentioned that in the review, it's like you, you have to you have to read Braille, like virtual Braille on the screen. And apparently the manual came with like a decoder that you had to use to uh, oh. interpret the language. And, you know, that, 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 I like that. I kind of admire that sort of interactivity. Mm -hmm. See, I like uh, it because so... it's like a, it sounds like something you would make up on the playground, but it's real. Yes. Yeah. Hold on. It, it was throwing me off because I'm seeing people pluralize it and they're saying R E G I S <laughs> and I keep seeing it as Regis. Regis? So all, oh, all from, I'm thinking is like throwing out a Pokeball. Like I'm throwing out a, I'm thinking like throwing out a Pokeball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give, no, give me give me the music. Give me the music. It's out of control. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Regis, go! <laughs> <laughs> what are you gonna do? And then you know how like the Pokemon always say their name Regis as he as he's doing moves. Regis, 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 Regis. Regis. Oh, and, this, and this is the Pokemon Regis. sound. Regis, <laughs> use payout. Super effective. <laughs> Regis, use payout. Regis. Uh, sh 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 Re <laughs> Regis. Sean McCarthy says uh, twenty five dollars. Uh, Oh, that's way too loud. <laughs> yeah, gentlemen, this is the second best thing to happen. Is it over? Uh, yeah, that's it. By the way, I was just trying uh, to kill myself at the end, and no ghost would come to me. Why now? <laughs> it's like Johnny's the winner at 69, 540. 
Yeah, cool. Nice. Oh, it. You're you're a, you're 120 points over. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. I really would like to spend more money. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Cool. I win the game that I don't care about. <laughs> so uh, it's not, uh, not too big it, it has its fans, it's but like it is. It's an interesting game. Edward Double D donates one dollar oh, and D. says, "Greetings and salutations to you." Uh, Mr. Ortiz and company, I apologize that I can only donate this much. My friends Ed and Eddie uh, have a request involving a tradition <laughs> you usually perform during these charities. However, to be different, I wish to twist the request a little. Would you act out the opening scene from game from the game Castlevania Symphony of the Night with you portraying oh, you know with Hold you on. portraying the hippopotamus right. from Sly Cooper named Murray as Dracula? And anyone else on hand as Richter Belmont? This is just a groin again. I'm pretty sure it's just a groin alternate account because he has a fetish for this shit. Yeah, <laughs> because double D and dick and groin that makes sense. Well, it I says anyone else is Richter, so I think I think he I think it's like whoever wants to be Richter. Uh, so uh, you you could be Richter then. Well, then hold on a second because I got a mouthful of cookies. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they're delicious. What kind of cookie? This is one of the only Christmas things I will buy. Before it's Christmas season, milk chocolates, the, the chocolate covered stars. Is anybody familiar with these cookies? They sound good. They're like, it's like a graham cracker cookie mm -hmm. covered in chocolate with those little white dots on them. Mm -hmm. Not what the hell are they called? Non Perels or something. They're so good. And it's the only Christmas thing I'll buy before Christmas time because I hate that Christmas comes early. <laughs> You know, I'm just imagining that you're talking with just like the whole packet of cookies stuffed in your cheeks. <laughs> that yeah. is not actually far from what just happened. <laughs> Hold on, I'm trying to think. Do I want to do a voice? Because I don't have any. I don't have any like Sly Cooper voices. So uh, I, I say just do whatever you want. Well, Nathan was suggesting Cookie Monster Richter. <laughs> <laughs> Since you're eating cookies. Uh, hold on. Uh, let me let me get into my. Let me. I'm doing like the actor. Like let me get into my into my my headspace. I don't. I I don't know. Uh, hold on. Uh, um. Die monster. You don't <laughs> belong in this world. It was not by my hand that I am once again given flesh. I was called here by humans who wish to pay me tribute. Tribute. <laughs> you steal souls. Don't give cookie. Perhaps the same could be said. <laughs> you guys are great. <laughs> Your words are at the edge. Good. Oh no! Wait, wasn't that? Wasn't yeah, there another one? Yeah, yeah. Just keep going. I thought, keep going. I thought you had another line. No, no, no. Your words are as empty as oatmeal raisin cookie. <laughs> Fuck you. It just cost four thousand dollars. Puppet, pup, muppet that? kind, what is muppet kind. No okay. need savior such as you. A pile of shitty cookie opinions. But enough talk, Mudge. <laughs> Okay. All right. Oh boy. We're good. We're good. We're, we're, right. We stalled we're, long enough. Words as empty as Cookie Monster cookie yeah. jar. <laughs> <laughs> He's fast as pack, boy. Yeah, no, like this, this this kid's really booking it. He also just ate a bicycle. That's a that's a Whoa. lot of sugar. <laughs> he, he had so much sugar he ate a bicycle. <laughs> uh, anonymous donated five dollars. Uh, I am. You got uh, any more of them dots? I am the Pac Man. That's where I am. I am the Pac Man. By the way, we passed 4K. Well, I yeah! Guess we have like Unbelievable, a... baby. We're not yeah. even halfway done this, and we're close to reaching our halfway point. Better call Saul. Donated $5. Put it in me, Johnny. I want it all. <laughs> Love Big <laughs> Cat. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that's, that's a big pussy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna read this last one. Uh, That's frightening. <laughs> oh my god. Splurge. Oh boy. Uh, um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, Otaku de Carnitas, aka Mixtape Man, uh, donates $50. And now I shall go satiate myself. Uh, with yeah. satiate my satiate my cheese addiction and okay. plug my mixtape. Satiate myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh God. Swiss <laughs> uh, <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it, man. It's uh, General better. General Godzilla donates five dollars and says Raycon sponsorship VPN for Netflix. Raycon sponsorship VPN for Netflix. John Ortiz, John Ortiz. Oh, it's one winged angel, if you're wondering. Oh, can I see that? <laughs> more because more donations, more smiles. Oh, he said, okay, hold on. Ray Con sponsorship VPN for Netflix. Ray Con sponsorship VPN for Netflix. John Ortiz. John Ortiz. <laughs> that's a drum. Yeah. Dun, dun, oh my God. That's, dun, a, John Ortiz. A, dun, dun, dun. that's a banger. That's a bang. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, Granite Holes uh, donated ten dollars. <laughs> oh wait, yeah, it is Granite. No, Granite. Grantles. 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 You're saying uh, Granitals. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and, I'm, and all I'm thinking is, all I'm thinking is, well, no, I'm thinking rock hard balls. Oh. <laughs> That's what you call honey made. That, uh, ten, that ten, guy's ten, got some granite yeah. on him. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, uh, Nathan you... granitals. That's what I was hearing. <laughs> yeah. okay. Vulture duck donates five dollars and said, "Hey, it's Vulture Dick again. Congratulations." <laughs> <laughs> but will John Lee, Johnny kindly reenact the final confrontation of Hector and Dracula from Castlevania: Curse of Darkness? God. With oh my god, oh. with Christopher Walken as Dracula, I don't and I don't know that line. You would have to you would have to pull a reference to it because I don't. Okay, uh, as Christopher Walken as Dracula and Barney Gumble as Hector, there were too many requests of Richter and Dracula's confrontations from previous streams, so I thought that I thought that I'd spice it up a bit. Yeah, yeah, that's definitely spicing it up, but I don't know what it is. I'll need to read, I'll, I'll need to read a script. Uh, Barney oh, Grumble, man. Grumble, not Rubble. Uh, Barney Grumble like, Barney, uh, Barney uh, Gumble yeah. Gumble from Simpsons. Yeah, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, it says Grumble here. It's Gumble. Yeah. yeah. Okay, it's yeah. Gumble. Yeah. Gumble and then Rubble. Yeah. Yeah. Someone can get me like a a manuscript. Yeah. <laughs> the, yeah uh, because I got I got to get the uh, the other request done too. Final confrontation. Uh, <laughs> Jay Patrick. Allison uh, New Newmar. Uh, Allison Newmark uh, donated fifteen dollars. Thank you, Allison. I was rewatching the Mario stream highlights yesterday with my boyfriend, laughing at the hilarious misreads. I can't wait to see what gets mispronounced this stream for the kids. Oh, Allison, I am so sorry. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I, I said a lot of things. Uh, um, Osmar, oh my fucking god. Uh, o Sep Sep uh, Osmar Sepulveda. Se Sepulveda. 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 That's right. what it looks like. It looks Sepulveda. like Sepulveda. 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 Nobody beats Sepulveda. <laughs> uh, Twenty-five dollars. Sepulveda. Sir! God bless a lot of you this day. Shout out to those a part of the stream who remember Code Lyoko, one of my favorite cartoons ever. Icky the Icky the Twitchy in the Twitch chat. Uh, yeah, that's how I remember the show. Cool. What? <laughs> it says uh, A the Forehead Show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, wow. their foreheads are humongous. Yeah, the bad. That is right. Yeah. A lot of I love that show. Yeah, lot, lot of... I, I want to read this next one. Uh, Marge Simpson yeah. donates one dollar that says, "Blinky needs braces." Pac Man. Blinky needs <laughs> braces. Pac Man. <laughs> <laughs> Blinky God. needs braces. Pac Man. Blinky needs braces. Pac Man. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm works. sorry, I just wanted that one. Mr. Mr. Director donates one dollar and says, "Hoyle, uh, with, more with the pack. What? what? More oh, with the pack? Like Lewis impersonation? Huh? Is that like a, supposed to be like a Jerry Lewis impersonation? Hoyle, uh, look at the pack. Oh yeah, hold on, yeah. maybe yeah. Hoyle, more with the packing. You were there, but here now, hundred forty dollars. That is how you do. Eighteen minutes, only that amount of hours." <laughs> <laughs> the nice streamers with the nice packy boy and eating a bicycle waving. <laughs> yeah, the, I had a bug, yeah, the bug one. But that's my favorite one. Yeah. Uh, oh, Nick. I had a bug. <laughs> that's the best one. Yeah. It's like just out of nowhere. Like, okay, OBS close, Discord close. It's because Pitch was going to win again. <laughs> uh, so the round is over, I guess. So who's, who's the winner? 
Uh, let me just try to check for it back <laughs> on. Joseph's right, Hospital in Philadelphia. So, what just happened okay. here? Where's, did Pitt just leave? Yeah, Pitt just yeah, left. Yeah, he left. Yeah. Is he, like, coming back, or? Uh, I'm going to assume not. Well, I mean, in the meantime, if uh, if we do not have a fourth player for the other uh, arcade games, we could just leave it blank. It's the really <laughs> not the end of the world. Yeah, that's, or that's, that's the easiest <laughs> thing to do. Yeah, yeah. His well, screen is pitch black. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> here's, here's what I... Oh, wait, did we? We skipped over Pack and Pal. Yeah, because we went into we went to Junior Pac Man. Wow, what? Uh, after yeah, I, I had Pac and Pal up, and I'm like, oh, everybody's playing yeah, Junior Pac Man. Oh, I was okay, like, I'm gonna switch to Junior, junior Pac Man. All right, so we're doing Pac. <laughs> all right, let's do Pac and Pal next. Oh, then. That who won that? Who, who actually ended up winning the high score? Because I wasn't uh, sure. Do any of you have any fun arcade memories? There used to be a pizzeria down the street from my house, and uh, they would have they had arcade machines, uh, Cruising USA, uh, Mortal Kombat Four, and Action vs. Street Fighter. Uh, and that is when I really fell in love with the game because I would just go there every time and uh, just just play it. And uh, I, I I guess I, I built some sort of a, a reputation as like like the best player on the block. Uh, and one of the um, uh, the usuals would hang around the front of the store. I don't know, he was probably a drug dealer, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> uh, uh, it, it's like, our neighborhood. Yes, it was. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he would uh he he would like announce me coming. Like here comes Ew. the champ. Here he comes. You know, uh, those were, you know, uh, you know, as a, like a, a 10, 11, so like a, like, like an 11 to 12 year old kid that's like going right to the ego. So, yeah, like that's that's the way I'm like, like, I, yeah, I <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, 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 I've garnered some sort of a reputation for being a pretty decent expert Street Fighter player, casually speaking, obviously, until, yeah. I, until I ran okay. into like a real dedicated competitive player who wiped my wipe the fuck up for me. So it was it was nice, it was a nice feeling. So yeah. that's what this is. This is a long fucking request. So I'm just gonna. Uh, Can you paraphrase? I don't. I have no idea what I'm reading. That's the thing. Actually, yeah, you know, I should be scrolling through because I want to make sure I'm not saying something racist. <laughs> uh, okay. Just to. Well, here, skim through it, and uh, I, I. Does anybody else have any fun arcade memories? Did anybody uh, has anybody ever seen an arcade? What's an arcade? Everybody, everybody, everybody froze. I wasn't getting a um, yes or a no. Uh, okay, uh, Slime Face, tell me I can start with Welcome to Nam. So let me see. Uh, it's AT as Bentley and TG as Luigi. All right. Uh, welcome to Nam. Now grab my hand and shimmy your soggy ass off that muddy bank before Charlie gets the fucking drop. Uh, who? Who's Charlie? He's the guy who's going to read our vows. I'm feeling pretty freaking matrimonial all of a sudden. Take a look down by your foot. See that little bottle? Stop on that shit like it's on fire. Noise and the ethnic dudes are flipping the fuck out and waving us sound like chairs until someone gets hurt. I'm your 300 pound matronly fright chain and my gaping furnace is hungry for coal, so get goddamn shoveling. Oh my God, bro, look at my eyes. That twinkle, that devotion you herniated pro wrestler sweaty purple taint, sparkling like a visit from your fairy fucking godmother. Should be pure and true. That's what you see. A kaleidoscopic supernova of all your hopes and dreams swishing together. Radially evanescing arms and more like boy peckers than boy you can imagine. Turning out insane corkscrew haymakers of a billion dancing Vienna sausages strong. This is how we do this. This shit more real than craft mayo. I have no idea <laughs> what the fuck I just read. Like, <laughs> if this is Homestuck, no thank you. <laughs> because I have no idea what the hell that is. Yeah, pretty much. A uh, 90s movie oh, yeah. that would make a good video game. The Super Mario <laughs> Brothers movie. <laughs> that doesn't count. It's my question. Yes. <laughs> hi, Dan. Hey, Dan. How's it going? Oh, hi, hey, what's hi, going on, Dan? Dan? Console Wars. Hello, hey, everybody. Guys. We're going here with on? Pat. What's going on, guys? What's going on? Hey, 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 hey Dan. Hey, Dan from Console Wars. I have a question for you, if I may. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. What movie from the 90s do you think would make an awesome modern game? <laughs> Easy. Showgirls. Showgirls. I don't think I ever watched it. Drinking some Philly beers. Or it's Philly beers. Philly it's beers. Give it Philly that. Philly. What, what is a Philly beer? It's called a John. It's called a John. Yeah, that's our word. Yeah, but Victory is Downing Town. Well, it's, it's in the area. Mm -hmm. J-A-W-N. Um, so his question was, what's your favorite reference to a classic video game in media? Um, uh, I'll go first. I liked uh, yeah. Futurama when they did the, uh, the Space Invaders thing. That oh, Futurama yeah. episode. Oh, God, yes. Remember what he keeps saying? Like, oh, 
alternate change direction change and direction. go faster. Go down faster. Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So that one, I think that one's my favorite. There was a sequence in Simpsons where like Koma was like going up against like Donkey Kong and he was throwing trash cans. I don't know if you guys remember that. That was. Uh, oh yeah. Hey, you no, still was got it. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, you know what? I'm gonna go with the the critic. It's similar to the Donkey Kong thing. Uh -huh. It was uh, his father. The, yeah, the when old he's driving man, a car. He's driving he's his car. You got Donkey Kong throwing <laughs> barrels at him. He's driving. He's She's like, slow him. down. He's like, how can I slow down? <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah. Uh, there was, I, I think it's a Futurama reference again, uh, with Tetris, where it's the construction guys and they're moving <laughs> one of the blocks. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so they, he's moving like the long piece and then he's like, all right, over to the left. No, oh, not that far. And when he dropped it, the oh, first yeah, four, the the, like part of it disappears. <laughs> <laughs> disappears. Fun fact, uh, with that, uh, Futurama for the, uh, Space Invader one, the general was, uh, Pac-Man. Yeah, Amy oh, had to oh, attend yeah. the. Yep. Amy had to attend the Widow Pac-Man. Yep. Ben, I love how Pitch is created just a smoking Pac-Man. That's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, he is. He's getting high. Um, okay. I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm okay. pretty sure it's a cigar. Yeah. Oh, cigar. Okay. Well, Humpty Dumpty. Did He's classy. Dream. Yeah. Is he oh. from New Jersey? Because it's legal now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you lucky bastards. <laughs> Uh, and then, oh God, guys, we got a, a donation from William Defoe for ten dollars. Uh, hi, Johnny. Uh, <laughs> uh, happy to. I don't know how to do his voice. Hey, Johnny. Happy to watch this. Happy, happy to watch <laughs> this. As I'm something of a some call me Johnny. <laughs> I like to watch you. Love the. There was a firefight. <laughs> For a great cause, especially when Pac-Man is involved. Hopefully, I can play oh, Pac-Man in a movie one day. Oh my oh. god, I would pay for that. So. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right. Big mouth. All right, King Kings. <laughs> I can see. Game's over. The game's over, thank God. I can <laughs> see the ghost running away from Dude, him. Did I win sure. one? Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. I only won one. Damn. Nice. Right, winner is King K. I need to break the 30,000. I don't even know what this game is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Up and at them. Up and at them. Happy birthday. <laughs> Mr. Oh, Smithers. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Uh, I'm ready to go when you guys are. Yeah, I'm good. Yep, ready to go. Uh, Clark, count us down. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. Splat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was expecting the air horn. Suave, uh, Suavo13, what's up, Suave? Uh, donates $5 and says, Hey, Greg, hopefully everything is going well. I have a tongue twister for Clark. Oh, uh, you go ahead and read that one. Hey, Greg, um, hopefully, okay. Uh, super duper stormtroopers, Rupert at Death Star, Gropers, a uh, helmet thrashing. Gropers. Hey. Wait, Gropers. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, shit. All right, let me do this again. Super duper stormtroop troopers. <laughs> <laughs> Super <laughs> duper stormtroopers whoop it with the Death Star hey, Gropers. Not again. One second. <laughs> Super <laughs> duper stormtroopers whoop it with the Death Star Gropers. It's it's Groopers. Gropers. Gropers. <laughs> <I know. laughs> it's Gropers. I know. I know. No, it's Gropers from now on. It's Gropers. Uh, what level are Damn. You? <laughs> Damn, second. Death Star, you Super thick. Duper stormtroopers <laughs> whoop it with the Death Star Gropers. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's Groopers. We're, we're all we're all down here. Stormtroopers <laughs> Rupert with the Death Star Groopers. Helmet thrashing, rebel bashing, laser blasting at party poopers. Good luck with the marathon. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Excellent. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. Damn, <laughs> Death Star, you thick! We will have Death Star, Star Groopers. Not as sorry as those Groopers are going to be. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Swabber. It's only four hours in. Swabber 13. Swabber 13 is the one that did the, the kitty cat. Wait, thing. that wasn't a power pellet. Uh, yeah. That wasn't a power pellet. That was no, Pitch's mouse. Uh, special items are. I think it's uh, just Pitch's <laughs> mouse cursor. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of things you like that you like that throw you like that throwback to throwback. two three and a half hours ago three and a half hours ago yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh somebody said return of the obra din that's the one that looks like i, I always think return of the obra din looks like a game boy game uh return it's got like the, the same din? coloring <laughs> the return of the oprah den 
<laughs> you get a den, you get a den, you get a den, you get a living that, room. That, yeah. that's, that's where Stedman and Gale live. <laughs> oh, Oprah. That's not where they live, that's where they're kept. Yeah, where they're kept. <laughs> that's also a great web browser. <laughs> oh, oh, uh, opera. Opera, not okay, opera. Okay, okay. Opera. Yeah. Oh, opera. <laughs> I was okay, gonna say fair, well, I, think I thought he meant like to say mistake. Stedman was a web browser. I love my favorite indie game, Opera Web Browser. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, All right. Uh, Zio Cobra donates one hundred dollars. Says I got a fever. I got a fever, and the only prescription is more Pac Man. Uh, keep up the good work for the kids. Well, that says for the kid. For so one, one specific so, one. So basically, here's a hundred dollar. One kid. I hope you get better. <laughs> no. We're hoping for all of them. Absolutely. This one kid better go do something great. <laughs> Earn this. Put a lot of money. In this shit. Well, kid, kid could be both parole and so, non parole. So yeah, <laughs> I. Clark don't over here with the English so. lessons. Yeah, I don't think that's true. <laughs> I don't think that's true. Uh, <laughs> but I was just trying to make a boo the fuck shit out of you Look at all those kid. I Remember. <laughs> I, I, learned, I learned a long time ago that the oh, plural damn, I didn't see the damn green goes by the number one. The plural for kid is moose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like Bambi. <laughs> <laughs> that's a deer, but yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> I know they about... said the same thing. Hmm, caribou. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who has moose? Can I just say these uh, jumping physics make no sense? Like, yeah, I can make a ninety degree turn in midair. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're also a yellow ball that munches on other. Yeah, balls. right. Yeah. right. Like, like, why, are being, why are you being picky now? <laughs> also, this is yeah. obviously a nod to his side smash. <laughs> I mean, the right smash is it's, yeah. it's funny because that, that brings up an interesting point. Like, people always talk about realism in video games. Like, there's always the joke about, oh, I don't really think that's the case. But when you play a game like this and you have, like, mid-air movement, people want that. Like, as unrealistic as that is, oh, I know. if you don't put that in, it will bother people. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And it's a, it's a Dude. game about a, a giant fat yellow ball. These ghosts balls that jump going up when you jump yeah. are really annoying. And, Eating and, his children yeah. or kid. Yeah, and running <laughs> running from the running from Eating the most cartoon kids. version of children yeah. of it's ghosts. A, I mean, yeah, it's literally the kid version of the Shining finale. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's fun to it's fun to not have realism in games. That's what I'm yeah. playing them for. If yeah. I want realism, I'll play Call of Duty. What? Well, a lot of my points are also like within like the logic of the world I'm playing. <laughs> oh, <laughs> wait, hold on. Call of Duty is still unrealistic because it makes you think you're good with a gun. Yeah, yeah. well, that's true too. It also makes you think you're. Good I could with do this life. in real I'm life. I'm not gonna complete that sentence. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it makes you think uh, the military is fun. How about put it that way? Yeah, yeah there you go. <laughs> Yeah. What'd you do in the military? Oh, I was the guy on the team who laid down in the corner. I was the guy with the uh, Xbox <laughs> controller. <laughs> yeah. Professional camper, sir! Like, how long have you been playing Call of Duty? For about two and a half months. I'm almost done with boot camp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you were a sniper. No, yeah. I just laid down a lot. <laughs> I'm tired. To everybody playing, who is your favorite ghost personality-wise? Ghost personality-wise. There's Blinky, who's red. He's rude. Pinky, who gets her color. She's sneaky. Inky, who's blue. He's uh, dim-witted and goofy. Clyde, who's orange. He's cowardly. And Sue, who is orange originally, Sue. but thanks to the Hanna-Barbera cartoon, is now purple. She's sly. Uh, Which goes God, I think one, one in... It's, it's also between uh, red and pink. Because those are the two that usually give me the most shit. Because red, I mean, I, you gotta, I gotta admire Red's aggressiveness. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very. Really but um, mm -hmm. the pink one, what was it? Is it Sue or uh? No, that's uh, pink, um. Pinky's the pink one. Pinky's the pink. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I wasn't sure. Glad to clear that up for you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, uh, uh, Blinky is the red one. 
Winky's the red one. And then uh, Ink Inky is the blue one, which is dim witted and goofy, which is yeah. that's my pick. Yeah, I'm going Inky. I go yeah, I, li I like the I like the goofy characters. Mm -hmm. I think King K is Kinky. <laughs> well, Kinky is in that we're gonna be playing. Oh, oh, Kinky's in Pac-Man. Oh. <laughs> which is like you know the best version of Pac-Man ever. Oh, really? You guys, that tastes pretty cool. <laughs> Uh, I don't like Mania. <laughs> it's just I don't know. Uh, Marvin the Martian donates one dollar and says, uh, "Hold on, I'm I'm I'm, I'm going to butcher this because I'm going to try and do my Marvin the Martian voice, which hurts my throat if I get it right. <laughs> it is uh, the earth. sort of yeah. Where's the soundboard? There was supposed to be a very hilarious and random soundboard." <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, since since Ben is playing a lot, he's not probably been able to do as many of it. I guess. It's hard to yeah. get to multi tax. Yeah, multi tax. Yeah, mo what did mm. I say? Multi tax. Yeah, okay. multi tax. When you get taxed more than once a year. Yeah, multi tax. They had it. Yeah, yeah. So they had that yeah. after filming. Multi tax. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I gotta go. Pee. So that'd be a great soundboard for the chat. Pull the Frank Drebin, just bring the mic with you. <laughs> <laughs> I know Clark hates slapstick, but they make it go so great. Uh, I got a few more minutes, but I gotta get going soon. You play first, man. Right. Is that King? No. Right. No, that's Pat. Oh, okay. yeah, I got. I have work. Oh, I'll get back for you. Tell them you have charity. Uh, <laughs> uh, tell, tell, them, okay. tell them you need all for charity. So if they say no, they sound like the jerks. All right, hold on. Uh, okay, uh, Bolter Bolter, Duck, thank you very Bolter much. Uh, yeah, Christopher Bolter Walken Duck. as Dracula and Barney as Hector. Okay, that was yeah. way off. I, okay. Uh, all right. Ready? Uh, yeah. <sighs> ah, the traitor, Hector. Lord Dracula, you are reborn. <laughs> Why? Good. Did you betray me? Oh, why did you unleash your hatred upon the humans? When you began slaughtering them indiscriminately, I had no choice but to disobey you. Side against me for the sake of humans. Humans are not worth the air they breathe. I simply cleansing the world. Uh, it's not your place to judge the worth of humans. The powerful always judge the weak. Humans made their judgment. Thus, I sentenced them to extinction. Sympathy is merely a form of weakness. You betrayed me, Hector. And for that, <laughs> the punishment is death. I Sin understand sinister, right. sinister grin. <laughs> I know. Oh, I was supposed to say that part out loud. <laughs> I stand ready. I will not flee as I did before. If it didn't die. <laughs> Hector enters the battle stance. Oh man, somebody's yeah, like, man, I love this for Castlevania. That. I know. You're not supposed to say that, bro. <laughs> All right, John, you want to start? You want to read that? You yeah, yeah, yeah. One? Sure. I, I uh, be I'll be, I'll be doing one. I don't, I'll do Bentley as dude one. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. I'm I'm gonna try and do it as it is in the video. Okay. Sure. 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 I need your help. Can you come here? I can't. I'm buying clothes. All right, well, hurry up and come over here. I can't find them. What do you mean you can't find them? I can't find them. There's only soup. Well, what do you mean there's only soup? It means there's only soup. Well, get out of the soup aisle. All right, you don't have to shout at me. What do you mean there's, there's no soup? There, what do you mean there's more soup? There's just more soup. Go into the next aisle. There's still soup. Where are you right now? I'm at soup. What do you mean you're at soup? I mean I'm at soup. What store are you in? I'm at the soup store. What are you buying clothes at a soup store? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can chat hear Ben's soundboard? I I was hearing it earlier. We can hear it, but can chat can you, can chat hear it? They should be able to hear it. Okay. I'll play a clip, uh, Ben. All right, did you guys just hear that? <laughs> oh no, my God. they didn't hear it. Yeah. Also, Ben's quiet. Well, I'm also like not at the microphone. Away from the mic, yeah. 
Oh, we laughed at all that Better Call Saul shit. They probably didn't hear that at all. <laughs> Why are these guys There's laughing? a lot of things they didn't hear. <laughs> okay, oh they heard that. Okay. Oh, well, at least we heard it. <laughs> oh, my God. Take our word for it, chat. It was funny. They probably thought we were those jackasses laughing at ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> Someone's playing Pac-Man. Ben's playing Rally X. <laughs> sort of like Pac-Man. <laughs> Rally X is a damn great game, not gonna lie. Um, Ch Chinea Blaze Henry One donated a hundred dollars. Cheyenne. Cheyenne? Not Cheyenne. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> Cheyenne Blaze Henry One, a hundred dollar donation. Keep on keeping on, please ban P Dan. Uh, Jason. Uh, what? Chine Chinea, right? What was it? Cheyenne. 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 <laughs> Said, don't put ketchup on French toast. No, who does that? <laughs> I mean, he put ketchup on your eggs. What's your like next year? I can see it happening, but like, but on French on toast purpose. specifically? No, that's weird. Yeah, uh, that's a that's a little weird for me. I mean, I don't know, Clark. You saw a lot of the French toast <laughs> from the college. Did you ever do that? Oh, <laughs> French toast? Yeah, um, a lot of the times. Oh, what I ketchup put... on it? No. no, he shoplifted from oh. the, from the college cafeteria. Oh. <laughs> Tons of times. Like, it's so easy here, to do that. Here you are, sir. Your French toast. Would you like me to put ketchup on it? <laughs> uh, uh, would you like to catch these hands? Uh oh. But I'm not the biggest fan of French toast. I would actually steal like fried chicken and stuff, which is cool. Sounds like a good breakfast. I like it. We're at five thousand two hundred and eighty dollars. Isn't that a mile? <laughs> Oh, right? For feet? <laughs> yeah, 5,280 no, feet. Mark. Oh. That's, a mile, yeah, that's a mile in feet. Thank you. Thank you, that fourth grade science really class. <laughs> it's also uh, a song. I, I would walk 5,000 miles. That's 525,000 <laughs> minutes, not oh. Oh. 5,280 minutes. 5,280 <laughs> minutes. Oh. minutes. <laughs> and I would walk 5,280 minutes more. <laughs> That's the song I was thinking. Not they're, fucking right. they're looking at him like, so what is that, like a month? <laughs> 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 yeah, we're just we're, we're like four hours in and uh, uh, combined with like, some technical difficulties we've been having uh, throughout the beginning of the stream, we still managed to reach our halfway point. Oh That's amazing. God. I mean, Absolutely amazing, guys. Thank you very much. Yeah. And that was without oh, the soundboard. A, that was that? Yeah, that was without the soundboard. Yeah. <laughs> without the soundboard. But they'll oh. never know. Yeah. <laughs> is that an actual fart or did somebody fart? Uh, no, that's I mean, soundboard. Both of those or is it? Yeah. Or is it? <laughs> or is it? Was that an actual fart or did someone fart? <laughs> <laughs> well, where's the one? Uh, Zach Skandanura King Zivon. Donated fifteen dollars. Warren Zevon. I. Werewolves of London. <laughs> Lawyers. Ow. Ow. <laughs> I've been watching Johnny since I was roughly six or seven months old. Uh, what? Six, six, six or seven, seven months, months old. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> so I do have a um, recording of an interview with an Egyptian leader. Destroy the moon! <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, Mr. Joe Taro, sir. I just. <laughs> <laughs> Destroy the moon. Thank God we've got no more four years of that. <laughs> so that was an Egyptian Woo. leader? That's, that's, so uh, <laughs> that's the Pharaoh from Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, I thought, yeah. I thought it was something from like Ten yeah, Commandments. Destroy the moon okay. is like the well, most no, I thought movie. it was from <laughs> Ten Commandments. <laughs> Destroy the moon. Oh, uh, I we summon these 12 a, uh... rules and face up attack position. Wow. All right, everyone, get your laser pointers out. If we all point at once, we can attack the moon. <laughs> That's not how science works. <laughs> <laughs> not yet. Yeah, right? Give it a week. Uh, what were the, who were the five Ds? It was uh, duck, Dick. dip, dive, dodge. Duck. No, dodge, oh. duck, dip, dive, and dodge. Oh. Wow, I actually got that right. Wait, Dick isn't one of them? <laughs> no, that's a different D altogether. <laughs> Only making me a little... Right, game over. Woo. All right, it looks like I won at 83,740. Johnny's second place, 5,980. 
King K at four five four seven four L. And Dan didn't get a high enough score for it to count. So yeah. <laughs> All righty, chat. Right. How did Ben cheat? Ben didn't cheat. Uh, so we're... what is up next? I believe. So next Pack up, it, we're done the arcade games for now, unless we get back to Pac-Man later. But yeah, we'll get we can get Pac-Man. Uh, I, I think I can get, working. get Pac-Man working, but we're gonna wait, we're gonna wait until later, just so we can get a move on. Uh, next up will be Pack Attack on the Super Nintendo with me and Dan. So Pack All Attack right. is like Pac-Man meets Tetris. It's actually a really cool game. All right, welcome back. Uh, Dan and I are gonna play Pack Attack, which you can probably see from the preview here is um a Pac-Man puzzle game like Tetris. So we can just get started whenever you want. Someone want to count this down? Five. Do oh, Johnny will do it. Right, go uh, ahead. Cinco, cuatro, tres, dos, one. <clears throat> and a cuckoo could shoot you. Cuckoo cuckoo. <laughs> <laughs> so I got to play my game with your music <laughs> in my ear. Is that? Is it coming through? Oh, man. Oh, wait, that was my music. <laughs> uh, shouldn't be coming through. I was like, oh, Christ. Like, oh, sweet Jesus. Damn, Jesus Christ. Or did it lock up? Yeah, sorry. Is it now working? Uh, uh, $10 from Rad Red Link. Uh, hey, John, after watching these events for years, I can finally donate to this wonderful cause. Watching you guys play Pac-Man made me uh, get up my GameCube and my copy of Nanko Museum for some Pac-Man arrangement. A game I love, but I haven't played in years. Keep up the excellent, keep up the excellent guys. Yeah, we are excellent guys. <laughs> yeah, keep up yeah. the excellent guys. Us, I have, us a-holes will prop up the excellent guys. I have not played any Namco Museum game past the PlayStation 1 collection. Uh, I was all over those games though when they were making the rounds. We made Keep it up because you know the, the the jewel cases were just the Namco <laughs> ones. like yeah A A uh, N A M C O Where? the original ones yeah the original the Namco Museum when they, games when they got re released huh. they shrunk down the letter part and it had like pictures of the games yeah uh, so we made it a thing it was like we got we got to collect the entire set but you know at the same time it was like besides collecting the games for the that, that sort of superficial reason was like, no, there's actual games inside these two. <laughs> so we ended up playing like the entire library of those and we ended up really liking them. My favorites, uh, my favorites are N because it has the original Pac-Man uh, and O, oh, no, uh, because that had uh, Dragon Spear, Pac-Mania and Legend of Valkyrie. Legend of Valkyrie okay. has to be one of my favorite games from Namco. Uh, we have $5 from sponsorship. Oh boy. <clears throat> uh, this stream is sponsored by Raycon Shadow Legends. I'm not used to manscaping, but with Raycon Shadow Legends Fantastic Prices, oh, wow. I couldn't say no. They are quick, easy to use, and have better luck for three minutes. <laughs> it was even endorsed by presidential <laughs> candidate Abraham Lincoln and other celebrities. Use the code, and it just stops right there. And you can save 15% off your next order by visiting the link in the description below. Buy RayconShadowLegends.com slash some call me Johnny, or you can use the special code Johnny to save yourself 99% off your next order. <laughs> Damn. It's a hell of a savings. I like it. That's real though. I'm pretty sure most of you guys just get the sponsors anyway. So. <laughs> I mean, you could never know. I never. I, I don't. I don't know, and I, I don't want to know. Honestly, I don't really care. <laughs> I'm getting paid anyway. <laughs> there there we go. One. But yeah, I, actually, just to uh, go into the brief history, of what exactly is Extra Life's game day? It is basically the day where we all agree to do these 24-hour gaming marathons at once to raise uh, as much awareness as possible for uh, Extra Life Charity. Is that Spongebob music? <laughs> okay. Uh, I figure it's like yeah. story music. Most of us play video games. It's just easier. It's, it's you know, it's what we do. Uh, but there are people who do D&D uh, &D, uh, for 24 hours or, or other tabletop games, card gaming. Uh, I, what was the one? Yeah, well, what? You know, hey, know hey, 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 hey good game, good game. Um, he programs. What was the game. I was, I was here the one story where the person they they did bowling for twenty four hours. Oh God, their their right arm must be ripped. Yeah, it's wee bowling. No, it's wee bowling. It's both people, but it's you know it's like that. But it was uh, the 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 tale that I had heard was that it was like in a bowling alley. And it was a group of people, and that's what they did, is that they got permission, and they bowled for 24 hours. Which, yeah, by the end of it, your arms are going to be ripped out of your mind. But... <laughs> or ripped off your body. 
You're an amazing content creator and person, even inspiring my final ma uh, major project for my media course to be a Sonic Rider Zero Gravity Review in the same structure as your videos and got high marks. Clark, you need to speak into the microphone. Yeah, I was going to say. You're oh. Right. There you go. Oh. oh. Okay. Can, can you reread that for us now? Okay, so you guys could have said something. Okay. <laughs> no, it was more fun uh, to watch you I embarrass could, yourself. I could uh, kind of hear you, so uh, I was like, okay, oh, yeah, he's just talking about... <laughs> Oh. He's shouting his. He's shouting this from the bathroom. Okay. No, it's all good. <laughs> I was going pee. No, everyone. Yeah. And, and I took up. your Sonic Riders your gravity review and just posted it as my own. I got high. <laughs> oh, that's great. You got me, you got me through a college. No, no, I'm kidding. Teaching a school thing. Like, have you had the one yeah, guy whose professor yeah. is a Pac-Man of Buddhism? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Pac-Man is Buddhism. I'm still confused we're, about. We're still waiting for uh. Yeah. Uh, wait for Contra to answer that. Yeah. Can we get that uh, one dollar explanation? Um. Oh. Uh. As much as I'm not, I'm not a biggest fan of these as everybody else is. Uh, I wouldn't mind to see a full blown remake of the Donkey Kong Country games. I would like to see that in the remake of DK64 and, and them to fix everything. You so you mean like make it good? <laughs> Um, I won't. I mean, less frustrating, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, Chet's disagreeing uh, with you, Clark. Wait, what? Oh, nothing, DK64 oh, is uh, nothing to fix. Oh, you guys are amazing. Yeah, DK64 is a perfect <laughs> game. It is. It's just a flawed in many aspects. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not so perfect now, is it? Uh, well, just must not Damn, wait. man, level 11. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, I beat level 10. It took me like half an hour, but did it. I believed in myself. It's better than me versus Mouser. That's that's right. Oh better yeah, than you and Mouser, you Crisis City. Like you were on that boss for a <laughs> while. Uh, like the most notorious example I think you ever get stuck on was like back a uh, Crisis City. I think was probably a really interesting example. Crisis and, City. Uh, um, Mouser. Uh, there was something on uh, the torch puzzle in Sonic Four. I got stuck on for a long time. Yeah, which I mean that would, that sucks though. So. Yeah, so uh, Pac-Man Fever was all Ben's uh, choice because uh, I wouldn't uh, ever think about holding an event solely focused on Pac-Man because again, my my Pac-Man experience is the original arcade game, Miss mm -hmm. Pac-Man on Genesis, Pac-Mania, and playing Pac-Man in Super Smash Brothers. I'm glad I'm not alone. That's it. You know, so uh, yeah. everything else was pre pretty much uh, Ben's idea to oh, host a marathon for it. Dr. Mario and Tetris. Yeah. It's a great way to discover the big, wide world of Pac-Man. Yeah, I, mean, I, I wondered for years. I, I did, <laughs> yeah, I didn't also, know did such a world existed. Did we introduce Matt Hatter? Because he just, he's just oh, here. I'm yeah. not sure if we introduced him. Yeah. Did we, the Matt, do you want to introduce yourself? Hey, Nick. Uh, hi everybody. I am the Mad Hatter Macy. Uh, at at one point in time, I was the uh, the general manager over at Radio Bucks after uh, Ben's tenure with such a brilliant community college oriented radio station, and and now I'm just like a, a freelance internet radio guy. I'm just kind of sailing around here. Awesome. You're like a bounty. It's a very silky smooth voice. I'm envious of you, radio disc jockeys, and your high quality mics. Hey, what about my <laughs> voice? I'm just saying, you know, I mean, <laughs> I mean, spare, the voice of an angel, Ben. Spare no expense. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so joking aside, I wouldn't mind that. Yeah, to have like to have a, a game where Big Boss is the villain and he's not like the sympathetic soldier from Snake Eater and uh, Peace Walker and Phantom Pain. Why not? I shouldn't say Phantom Pain. I guess there's a coin star machine in my living room now. Yeah, what's going on there? Uh, you know, vacuuming your floor? Yeah, uh, we're doing coin separation right now. I wish Ben had like webcam on right now to see just how much of a slouched oh. motherfucker he is right now. My like, webcam is on. Yeah, your webcam. <laughs> oh, you didn't know. Cool. I'm glad you didn't start masturbating or anything like that because that would be very embarrassing. I mean, my webcam is on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm behind my I mean, microphone right here. Looking at my game. Like my, yeah, my... But he is masturbating too. <laughs> it's, it's the first thing you got to do that, when like, you start. <laughs> <laughs> when you start the Zoom call, you got to real quick check I and make sure your pants are still on. I don't like your... God damn it, am I masturbating again? I hate it when I forget about that. <laughs> damn it, I masturbated again. <laughs> Why do I keep doing that? <laughs> All right, here you go. 
Wait, that little light means the camera's <laughs> off? <laughs> All just go no not November for the record. <laughs> Oh, God has works in mysterious ways. Uh, Chef. I'll be right back. Yeah. Oh, I'll see this one. So, so, the weather. Outside is frightful, and the fire is so delightful. And there's no place to go. It's not fucking snowing. It's 70 degrees outside. It better not be. I know. God damn it. I hate it when it starts <laughs> randomly snowing. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everybody, by the way. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, man. 2020 has oh. been such a crazy year that right after <laughs> Halloween was over for the first time ever, I was like, you know what? I'm not going for a Christmas song right about now. <laughs> yeah, for, for, Christmas, Seriously. Yeah, Christmas starts with me November 1st and ends in March somewhere. Oh, what the hell? Like, oh, for, for me, normally Christmas doesn't start until like December, December 15th. <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. You know I am guys... so late to the party every year. You know what we forgot? It's no not November. Uh, well, I guess someone's dog agrees. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I guess that's what uh, that uh, someone, someone just pulled up in front of the house. He went nuts. All right. Hold on. Oh, we got $25 sweet. from, hey, Sabrina, Zelda Link Lover 13. Hi, uh, everyone. Hope everyone's doing good today and enjoying the game day. Sadly, I'm still pretty ill. Hopefully, I can join if in, in well enough. Have a good day. Uh, P.S. Mm -hmm. uh, Elliot is telling me to walk down the aisle with the John Cena thing. Please help. Yeah, tell Elliot, don't do that, don't please. <laughs> Yeah, but the, but no one's gonna be able to see her. <laughs> no one, no one be able to see Elliot. <laughs> the groom has ditched the bride. Yeah, Elliot would fucking run down the aisle with John Cena music playing, and then the, and then somebody randomly comes out, and like instead of Elliot, it's somebody else. It's like, oh my god, it's Randy Orton. Oh, <laughs> From out Sabrina. of nowhere. Oh my god, it's not nuts. Is this is this what's Elliot is doing it, in the impact zone? Is this Elliot Sabrina <laughs> like Elliot Sabrina? Probably I mean, it's all it, it, they do whatever yeah. the hell they yeah. want. I'm not gonna because you know I know it's like saying no memes at a wedding, but it's like compared oh. to who? Like that that like that's who these two are. Like they're they're shit posts. <laughs> they're 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 oh. they're shit lords. So if they go to shit lord their wedding, yeah. it's their wedding. Yeah, the piece <laughs> you know, shit. like obviously it's like don't do that, but it's also like uh, who the fuck am I to say no? Yeah, listen, you do what makes you happy. Exactly. Um, you came and down the, like uh, uh, what was it? My uh, uh we did um, wing uh, uh, chariots of fire. Chariots of fire. Yeah, chariots of fire. And da, you ran da, in da, slow da, motion. Da, <laughs> da, da, da. <laughs> well, that was the that was the reception. That wasn't the ceremony. Okay. Yeah, the ceremony we didn't have any music. Uh, but for the reception, yeah, we did chariots of fire. Uh, and while we, cause that's uh, um. Everybody got introduced, you know, oh, the father of the bride and blah, 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 blah and they do that. And then, so we did Chariots of Fire for the whole thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then cool. our, our, yeah. <laughs> uh, and then our wedding songs. I, I do have my uh, wedding song ready to go. <laughs> King Ramses. <laughs> 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 The man and gods. That whole Egypt thing going on here. Do you hear that or this? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, and uh, uh, Delta Foxtrot uh, says, Greg, you're the kind of teacher who, when I ask, can I go to the bathroom, you ask, I don't know, can you? <laughs> <laughs> Pop quiz dipshit. Oh, only if you can find it. <laughs> Uh, Oscar Kakakasha, uh, one dollar donation. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Do huh. you want to pet the kitty? Yes, I want to pet the kitty. Pet, pet, pet. He. Look, everybody, kitty, kitty, I'm petting kitty. the kitty. Um, that's from uh, Hey Arnold, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, we I, all remember when we first learned to pet the kitty. <laughs> yeah, pet it, pet it like like a carpet. Um, <laughs> what? <but> what? <laughs> what? Hold on. <laughs> that came out really bad. That came out really bad. Move. 
Move shifter. Move shifter to R. Back that up. What? Like a what? Yeah, Clark, turn up that I, carpet. I I thought I heard carpet, but I wasn't entirely sure. Not that carpet makes a lot more sense. Okay, I go away from my mic one second to chew on the burger and I miss something. What happened? <laughs> why are we um, talking about carpet? Why is people talking about carpet? I, Clark wants to pet the carpet. Why would we want to pet a carpet? Uh, I hope we would do you don't pet, pet carpets, you munch carpets. Uh, oh. Yeah, that's where I <laughs> wasn't. <laughs> yeah. Damn it, people, this is a charity event. <laughs> Sponsored by Empire today. <laughs> Eight hundred five eighty two three hundred Empire today. Empire. Today. They were just munching on the carpet. They knew what they were doing. <laughs> we're the best with carpet. <laughs> <laughs> This is a oh, mess. That, those, are, those are one of my favorite mini tunes. Uh, Stanley, yeah, the bug man. Fascinating. Wasn't he the original version of Luigi? Or am I, am I thinking something different? No, I don't no, know. No, I, I think uh, Donkey Kong so. 3 was like way after Mario Brothers, so I think it was just supposed to be I think so, yeah. a separate character, yeah. But, now then, but then the question is, was he Luigi in Mario Brothers? Yeah, um, I would say so. Oh, uh, yeah. was he? I, I don't remember if they. My I don't only even frame of re hold on. my only frame of reference. As, yes, as strange as it, as, only, as strange as it sounds, my only frame of reference for that is the Atari Twenty Six Hundred commercial for Mario Brothers, because <laughs> that was a terrified Luigi looking for his brother Mario. It's kind of like a sing along song. Okay. Yeah, I feel like. They but he was called Luigi. Yeah, but they they are saying yeah. that yeah he was he was he was, called he Luigi. was Luigi in Mario Brothers. Yeah, uh, I think, yeah, I think he, they came up with both names at the same time. Okay. Yeah, in in Mario Brothers, they were both yeah. given names. Okay. Okay. Although he, although people were right that Jumpman was named Mario in Donkey Kong Junior. Mm. Okay. Interesting trivia. I love it. Thank you. I, I like. I see. Yeah, I'm I'm the nerd that likes this stuff. Like, oh, so I, well, I, that is me awesome. eating something. I'm yeah. trying to keep my mic away from the burger, but because I'm really <laughs> hungry, I told you. Borgor. Hey, it's Nick Murphy. Hey, Nick. Hey, Nick. Hey, gang. Nick Murphy. Hey. Hello, How's everybody. Uh, you know, playing Pac-Man games, yep. going crazy, talking about Mario lore. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're doing, That's we're doing the, one. we're doing the nerdiest, geekiest deep dive ever. Oh, the deep, deep Mario lore. Uh huh. Yep. <laughs> when when was he called Mario? Mario's origin stories. Oh, someone, what, oh, no, what 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 happened between him and Pauline? We <laughs> don't know. <laughs> what part He's, of his body created Wario? <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! The Adam and Eve situation. <laughs> the gluteus. <laughs> it's the gluteus. Uh, Merch, want to introduce yourself? Uh, hey everybody. Uh, my name is Nick Murphy. Um, I'm part of the show Continue on YouTube. That's it. <laughs> there you go. Yay. Yay. Well, some of you. I was waiting. <laughs> I was. It's very much not about the video games. It's just, it's just us goofing around is really like the whole premise of the whole show. Uh, Carlos uh, donated fifty bucks. Just pooping. Bye. Uh, <laughs> just pooping. Bye. Just popping by. Man. Wow. I was taking this shit and I thought of you guys. Oh <laughs> so, uh, this cream okay. is the shit. Oh, God. Carlos, go ahead, go ahead, I'm so online. sorry, Carlos. Uh, you donated $50 and you're amazing. Uh, he said he's just popping by to wish you guys the best <laughs> on this stream. Hope this donation helps in some way. Each of you guys keep up the great work. Also, I suggest Roman noodles uh, music as wedding music. Okay, that said Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns. Oh, Roman. <laughs> <laughs> the big dog is here. Roman uh, noodles. Roman, Roman, Rain, noodles. Roman Reigns music as wedding music. Oh, this was a bad decision. Okay. Uh, you, you're the best. Um, $5 from Together. It's all like in a... Oh. <laughs> oh. Right. I get it. All right. <laughs> Together we... <laughs> Are celebrating our three-year anniversary today. <laughs> Aww. How long, I wonder how long they were married. Uh, no, it's it's a Sonic Forces reference. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. I was, I, I was about to say, oh my god, I am so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I wish Jason was here. Because uh, he has the sound clip that I'm referring to. Oh god.
<laughs> oh, we got three dollars from Boo Bort. Hi guys, I recently got my scholarship thanks to the book club. However, I did not read The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants, and I don't think it's long before King Boo finds me and kills me again. I might as well donate the money I got from my scholarship for all the kids, all three dollars worth. All right, Boo Board. Uh, Boo Board. We, is that an SGB reference? Did we? Yes, no, sir. no. That, okay, that, yeah. That's, oh, okay. Boo Board is one of the because uh, yeah, because I know we gave I know we gave nicknames to all of them. Yeah. Well, uh, no, we didn't like the nicknames. We gave them a backstory. That's right. That's right. All right. So it's, yeah, it's, it's a oh, cool. captain. Like, so Boo is on um, Mario World. Mario World. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Uh, oh, yeah, had a little book club about that, and then they were, we were making names. One of them ended up being Boo Board, who was the dumbass that failed the reading class assignment. That's right. And he oh, got three dollars. But he, but he, he took that money from his scholarship and gave it to kids instead. So that's great. Good on you, Boo Board. That yeah, but next time do the fucking reading. Yeah. <laughs> that's a really good name. Bort Simpson? Yeah, Bort. <laughs> no, That's my boo is also named Bort. <laughs> <laughs> we need a restock on the Bort license plates for yeah. I repeat. <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh, See, ten... everybody remembers Bort, but for me, it was definitely, we've also arrested your older, balder, fatter son. <laughs> <laughs> That's always the line that gets me. <laughs> No this way! Nah. Uh, this game reminds me of Doctor Robot and it's uh, Mad Mad Mean Mean Machine. Yeah. I never played that one. Yeah. yeah I always it saw was, it. Really it's just that one of Puyo 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 you played. Yeah, there there was a spinoff series after called Puyo Puyo. Oh. Wait. No. No. Wait. Isn't that what Mario Two is based on too? Thank God. No, no, man, fuck this. No, he's a fucking level twenty-four for half an hour. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> fuck these bees. I don't know why I agreed to come right. here the first place. <laughs> rage, 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 quick counter one. <laughs> there you got a long way to go before you reach Ben's and Mario Mania. Yeah, people didn't know that. Uh, Mario 2 was actually based on a Japanese game called yes. Puyo Puyo Panic. Yeah. <laughs> it is called Puyo Puyo, right? No, it's no, not. it's not Puyo Puyo. No, no. <laughs> uh, Five dollars from is this uh, Iki? Like Iki the rib, uh, rib, oh, rib, um, uh, the rib, rib job? I, I don't know. Iki the rim job. Donate five dollars. <laughs> hey, the rim glad for to see the pleasure. Oh yeah, there's one from Captain Kohai again with the one dollar donation. Random fun fact: Did you know that California once had the most Jim Crow laws? Ben plays the more you know. Jungle. Pokemon. Is Jim Crow oh. some sort of Pokemon that I'm not aware of? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the, I think it's the evolution of Farfetch. So uh, what did they talk about after the Pokemon conversation? Oh, uh, Jim Crow laws. Yeah, <laughs> those are really hard shit. Well, they... Unexpected, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> really kind of go all over the place. Read the yeah, room, seriously. guys. Jesus Christ! You never know what you'll get on our stream. Our crows, our crows, you have been formed, Jim Crow. <laughs> oh my God! Sometimes Can't wait, them, wait to bring that up at a cocktail party. Figure it out. I have to confess though, that a dark ass joke, if, we, if I ever do a Gen 4 run, a Gen 4 run, that's what I'm naming the Merc from. <laughs> Jim. Oh, Jim. 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 Oh, oh God. No, just Jim. Just uh, Jim, yeah. <laughs> okay, so you have to think about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Also, bad news, Ben. We're out of quarter rolls. Oh, no. You need to find the box with the rolls. I found the bag with the rolls. And there should be a box with them, too. Oh. Uh, yeah. Get back in there and buy that box of rolls. <laughs> There's some right there by the kitchen table. <laughs> oh, I'm playing, so I can't go. Oh. I heard there's some by the kitchen I'm gonna, I'll get him. I think I'm gonna do. Clark's tapping in. He's going in. He's walking through the door. He's by the table. He's opening the bag. <laughs> <laughs> What happened? Rolls, not yeah, rolls. He got he got <laughs> rolls. Wait, what? bread, <laughs> bread. Okay, rolls. so I, I was I was I was keeping up with other things that I'm paying attention to, and I heard rolls. I thought he meant bread too. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I'm not gonna no, give Clark I... that much shit. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, so so hold on. Oh, oh, I'm done. I guess. Hold okay, on. So, um, yeah. It's uh, so we don't have uh, the folks can't see the cam. We we have uh, we have cams on the Discord, so we can just keep right. in touch. Like, for, like I'm sorry. Uh, contact. <laughs> no. It's uh, okay. Clark got it's up and got right. rolls. What what happened? Hold what? Okay. So so what? what 
Would you guys are rolling change, I guess? Yes. 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 You're rolling up change. They were out of the rolls for quarters. Okay. Because I heard them say we're out of quarter rolls. Okay. So I thought change also, but at the same time, I was kind of like, ooh, bread? <laughs> Apparently, and I watched it on camera. Okay, so we, we have a camera. We have a, a stream where we can see video of each other, uh, the, which is not being pumped into the stream. So chat, uh, you can't see this. I watched as Clark got up, the walked to the kitchen, up. grabbed a bag of rolls, <laughs> bread rolls, and bread, <laughs> and showed them. And <laughs> hey, so, to be fair, I thought they meant bread too. I was only half paying attention. I thought they meant bread oh, too. Oh man, I, w I was a little curious because you said quarter rolls, and I'm like, oh, maybe that's what they call like club rolls, like junior rolls. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it would make sense, like. Because like that was like one quarter the size of like a hoagie roll, but oh, yeah. yeah, so that's why I was like, oh, quarter rolls. Okay, so that's that's just something that somebody else calls them, They're like shorties. So yeah, that's pack attack. So, oh man, <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> pack attack. Yo, <laughs> shit. Don't <laughs> forgive me for thinking about bread. I'm just loafing around. <laughs> Pac Man pack fever, the search for bread. Pac-Man Fever, the defeat of Jim Crow loss. Pac-Man <laughs> Fever, a doodly-doo, it's a job in me, a crazy day. Okay, so Johnny, what are we doing here? Are you playing Pac-Land, or are we moving on to Pac-Man 2? Uh, let's go to Pac-Man 2, because I already have it loaded up. All right, well, that was awesome, guys. I'm going to take off, because I got to oh, no. go out. Yeah, but How dare you. Wear a mask. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so, good luck. Marijuana. Thank you very yeah, much, man, for joining us. Man. Appreciate it. Always welcome your yeah. company. Yep, you're welcome yeah, back. Always you find yourself uh, here later. I have a good one. Yeah, take it, you guys. Later, Bye, guys. This game is like has creepy pasta written all over it. Damn. So it's. I... All right, so I um. Wait, what the oh, fuck? Who's this person? Who is this? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, Pac-Man, Inky, Blinky, Clyde, Sue, and then Destructor, Lord of the Wolves. <laughs> Looks like something from Dragon Ball Z. This is a game Johnny and I have like agreed we're just we're just gonna both go in blind and see what happens. Yeah. I guess uh, we'll just play till nine. I guess. I don't yeah, know. it's not really, it's not really a race. It's just more of a demonstration. Hi, I'm Pac-Man. Hi. There are hot a... singles. In we are room. out of milk, and Pac Baby is still hungry. Can you go get Miss some Pac more Man milk, is please? filing for Miss Pac Man is filing a divorce. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Why can't I just use the D pad to move him? Why do I got to be point and click? Yeah, I, I, I have a good question. Pac Man, don't know either, Ben. <laughs> um, like, I don't even know if I'm making influence here. You literally told me to aim at your fucking chimney, and you're getting pissed at me that I did that. Anyway, have you ever tried Sonic's Chili Dog uh, from the first Archie issue? Oh, I broke the mailbox. Uh, I have had uh, well, I've had food from Sonic. I don't remember if it was a Chili Dog specifically, mm -hmm. but uh, Sonic's food's not bad. They got good shakes too. Oh, cool! I thought yeah, he was talking about the, the. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I've eaten Hedgehog before. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you have if you've had if you've had southern delicacies you actually probably did <laughs> look at switch chat this this may as well be called canned bread the video game <laughs> <laughs> he's got a dog and it kind of looks not, like him does he know the apple does he want the he apple? he is going through a divorce I don't like you Don't be afraid of the no. bird. I have a slingshot. I can shoot the bird away from you. What the fuck are you screaming oh, about? God, get away from me, Jim. It's gone. It can't hurt you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so you're saying it's Jim. You're, you, I think he just died. Okay, Did I so. Just die? Yeah. Well, hold on a second. Then why didn't that work? Oh. Dude, Pac Man is doing some crap falls. This is interesting. <laughs> like, this yeah. is just, like, let's torture Pac Man, the game. Uh, no, but uh, it is not. What the hell am I supposed to? Nothing I do is making it, uh, is influencing it. All right, so use. Trap yourself to... in, people. We're here for three hours. That's <laughs> <laughs> really great. But how did you get the power pellets? Do you know? There's a tree next to Pac-Man's house, so you can shoot him down from there. Oh, right there. Hold on. I think Ben just passed that tree. It looked I like it had lemons anything. on it. Oh, you're wait. You're not. 
I not touching the controller. He is just doing this on his own. Did you press start? Uh, yeah, oh, I'm, I, I moved around. Around. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta get milk for Junior game. Pac Man. <laughs> yeah, he moves on his own. You just influence him, like. But like, it's not influencing. I'm all the way to the left, but he's still going to the right. So, uh, I used to make a joke, and I think you're actually. I think this is actually it. The controls are not even controls; they're just suggestions. <laughs> Did. Oh god! Oh god! This is horrible. You're pushing left and right, and you're hitting buttons, and it's like, ah, if I feel like going that way, I'll, I'll let you think you chose it. The hubris of everyone on the stream thinking they can control Pac-Man. It's, it's incredible. <laughs> you know, guys, it's, uh... I think Ben just made Pac-Man too depressed. Um. Yeah. The, uh, Ryan says he he can explain it. Does Ryan want to play it? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, he said he can explain it, not that he wanted he, to play he's, it. Well, yeah. He's in the he can, Twitch he can, chat. He says, yes, this game is awful. I had this game as a kid. Want me to call in and explain this? He can explain it, but ahead, he, he says, it. play it. No, so F no. Uh, it's not quite single oh, pixels, but it can get that bad. Yeah. I crushed Sorry, the guy. Go ahead. What do you want? I... I crushed a guy and, and I liked I it, it. Yeah. but I couldn't <laughs> figure awesome. out how it awesome. did it. <laughs> also, <laughs> what you need to be aware of, also, what you need to unfortunately be aware of, this game can lock you out of win conditions if you do something wrong. Do you know any offhand, like examples offhand? Uh, the mission you're on right now, the first one has one. Oh, God. Wow. <laughs> this is one of the best things you guys have ever streamed. Don't piss off the dog. I know this is probably entertaining as hell, but it come is. on! It's it's awesome, dude. I it, love it, it is. It's, it's, it's great for us. Yeah. I know. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I'm more confused than I am like frustrated because I, I oh, don't. Oh no! I got stung by a bee. But let, let me 50, put it this way: when I had this game, six thousand. Oh no! Not the bee! Nice. <laughs> All right, John, it's do you want the week. solution to this one? Look at the fucking bottle! <laughs> 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 oh my god! I don't think we're beating this game, John. No, you're not. I want to at least get past the first fucking mission. <laughs> I know. Again, it took me about seven years to figure out how to beat. Look at the bottom! Why would you walk was, on a skateboard? What are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck was your Pac-Man doing with that bait before he goes up the glass like that, dude? I have no idea. Oh, and then Pac-Man got an idea. <laughs> we had <laughs> awful, terrible, awful, awful, awful terrible idea. idea. <laughs> we we call that one milking the cow. Wait. Go back! You literally got the bottle of milk for the kid and you just walked past the fucking house. This, this Dude, is the do thing, I have to go home that now? plays when you guys say a whole bunch of balls in the trailer. So it's kind of cool. Yeah, um, so... I don't know how we got that footage. I, how could someone get that far? <laughs> all right, um, so no more back, no more back seating. John has to figure out the rest on his own. Yeah. Uh, like we all did as a kid. This... I like video games. You know, maybe I'll just capture a tool assistant oh. speed run and just stream that. <laughs> just <laughs> just <fun. laughs> oh my god, Ben got so good. <laughs> uh, can you take some time to talk about how terrified Pac-Man looks on the box art? Uh, what does it look like on the box art? On the oh, box whatever, art, he, whatever. The box I guess he, he is, looks terrified. Yeah, no, he is on a <laughs> hang glider jumping off of a cliff, and his face is a giant, I am going to die. Oh, <laughs> that answers Matt's thing about the hand glider. This is the game with the hand glider. Yeah, yeah that's, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. That, I, has a hand glider. That, I have, <laughs> that I have played this game before, and I fucking hated it too. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yo, I, yo, honest to God, yo, I'm having a revelation here. Like, it's like... I feel like Jaden after he got electrocuted to forget you fell. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm feeling here. <laughs> Pac Man. Pa pa oh. What the hell oh, did you no. have Pac Man eat? What is happening? Uh, what you know what? Eat? You know what I get from this game? This I what? get the idea that uh, Pac Man has lived his whole life in the maze. So when he, he finally got do. out, he doesn't know how to live life out here. He found a slingshot and he thinks he's supposed to shoot things with it, but now he's shooting waterfalls and skateboards. No, he's and... not the one shooting. He's not the one shooting the slingshot. Oh, it's somebody else is shooting at. Oh my god! So this is more like a horrible version of Truman Show. Kinda. So yeah. they, they've they've let him off the island, and now they're shooting at him with a slingshot. This Do is I... beautiful. No, it's awesome. I like this lore. This is good lore. 
We should, we should. I guess you just this is more. With the rope. This is more. Oh, you know what this is? Remember those Looney Tunes cartoons where there was the some? It was somebody drawing. Yeah, Zuckamuck. Yeah, one of the one of the, the, one of the, yeah, the, one of the single death cartoons revealed. ever made. Yeah, there you go. The, like like Duck Duckamuck was the one with uh, uh Bugs and well, it, Duckamuck was the one with Daff with Daffy. Daffy, yes. Like, and then he wanted to find Bugs, out that Bugs was fucking with him the entire time. And then Bugs time was by. drawing it. There's another yeah. one with Bugs where I think Elmer is the one doing the artwork. What? Interesting. Well, I think they did that one in the fifties. Yeah. I Maybe thought he just like, took a shit. I thought he was about to take a shit too. Like, <laughs> and well, what is this face? Oh, he turned into Mr. Yuck. This is, <laughs> this is this is so riveting, guys. I'm sorry, I'm just not getting. This. Do I just? No, we none of us are Clark. That's why it's like entertaining. Oh my god. What am I doing? So who opened their mouth? Oh, I have to wait for him to. Come on, jump. Come on, Mario, jump. Jump. Come on, Pac-Man. Die! Die! <laughs> oh <my God>. Fuck! <laughs> like, so you want Pac-Man to die? That sounds like ghost talk to me. <laughs> oh so you can't have your phone until you complete level one. Oh, I'm, gonna, I'm looking at. <clears throat> okay. Uh, so Pumpkin Fox once more uh, donated a dollar and says Pac-Man Two is the sequel to Pac-Man One. Uh, Pac-Man One is about a man in his prime enjoying his days eating food and busting ghosts. After a while, he fell in love with Miss Pac-Man, and they had a child. Pac-Man, because he got committed before he was ready, uh, oh, committed as in married. Uh, I'm thinking okay. he was thrown <laughs> it was like the, yeah. sent to the asylum. <laughs> uh, starts having a midlife crisis. That's when Pac-Man Two takes place. This is a lie. Which uh, he says this is a lie. Uh, it kind of works, right? Because as he goes from his <laughs> as he goes from his youthful days of raving in the dark clubs eating pills. Oh he goes to a suburban lifestyle and he cannot figure it out. <laughs> you just <laughs> pack it. It's like pack in the mar pack and the marriage, pack and the marriage. I uh, got together. Like and then after, got after, after, after his, after his, after his, uh, John, uh, John guy, uh, says, uh, uh, $5 and says, God, I love this game growing up. I kind of forgot it existed. I was never good at it, but I'm glad to actually see it again. Are you sure you actually liked yeah, it? Are you yeah. sure you liked it? Because right the last three sentences of that, right? <laughs> Shows that uh, maybe you didn't really like it. Hey, John Guy, you had us in the first half. Not yeah. going to lie. <laughs> uh, please make your name enjoyable to look at. <laughs> Forever. And, and read the room. Are you uh, fucking kidding me? Oh, God. That would oh. be a good name. That, yeah, that's a great name. That's the good name. Right oh, there. Oh, yeah. there, you go. there you go. Hey, gang, I'm going to take off. It was cool <laughs> hanging with you guys, though. This is awesome. Yeah, man. Oh, man Much, good to have thank you. you for your company, man. I yeah. appreciate oh, it. Sorry, sorry if we uh, blew your mind with all this uh, <laughs> Mario and Pac-Man deep lore. I, dude, I want more of it. I'm going to try and jump back on later and try and, <laughs> try and uh, do like a deep dive into all of it. Here, here's what I recommend. Do the deep dive at like three in the morning when we are out of our minds, and the theories are all over the place. I'm gonna I'm gonna make them uh, really interesting, and I think we're gonna start a new thing. It might be like a like a packathon kind of thing. It's gonna it's gonna take off the internet. Oh, I I have already got like I just thought of like four theories right now, so we're gonna get it. <laughs> I love it. Awesome guys, have a great one. You have a good one. Man. Thank you. Hey everyone, I'm here for the Galaga. Yeah. <laughs> it does nothing of it. No, you piece of shit! <laughs> wow. What, what, what a welcome. Some... What a welcome. Hi there, you piece of shit. Wow, damn. <sighs> you got packing the roasted. Spider ears, nothing but fucking gotchas. Like, it's all it is. Yeah, that's, that's this game in a nutshell. This is this is uh, Trap Dungeon Zero. Well, I mean, it's almost like a mix of Hey You Pikachu and I Want to Be the Guy. Are you having fun, John? I want to be the pack. I want to be the man. I, basically, <laughs> looking man. looking at this game, I don't want to be the guy. I'm, like, hypnotized by it. And at the same time, I will never play it. This is the last time I'm playing this game. <laughs> <laughs> don't fucking touch this game again. Johnny, Johnny versus Win. Oh. Uh, <laughs> no, you're sorry. What am I doing again? <laughs> yeah, You're trying to get ra power. Raising money for children. <laughs> Focus well, on that. Well, the, the, the goal of the mission is to get flowers for Miss Pac-Man because she asked for something. Why am I in a mine? If you focus on children, on the children, you'll be fine. Hey, kids of Children's Hospital, here's your money. 
you better fucking enjoy it because I because <laughs> I went through hell for this. You want your money? Uh, you have to uh, play Pac-Man too. Me. This is Pac-Man trying to adjust to. This is what. This is how he sees it, right? Like, it, oh, I want flowers, yeah, so he goes out to get flowers. But but he's the idea of social interaction is so much for him that this is what he thinks it looks like. It's funny because I can't really, I can see the game, but since there's a delay, I have to go on what I'm hearing. It's kind of like, uh, what's that game with the briefcase? Keep talking or, or and nobody explodes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and, and it kind of sounds like he's trying to defuse a bomb, right? Okay, don't go, don't go too slow. All right, go fast. Oh God, All right, hold on. I hit the rock. Okay, I made it. We're alive. Red wire. <laughs> <laughs> Try shooting at everything. I am shooting at everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, uh, somebody said I played Digimon and was confused why I wasn't supposed to catch them all. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have a limited hard drive, of course. They're digital. <laughs> and this is like late 90s, early 2000s hard drive. Yeah. You're whopping like 12 megabytes on that thing. Me remember when we when, when PS2 memory cards came out and it said 8 megabytes and we were all amazed? Hot damn. <laughs> and I think I did the math on like what it would cost to get like a terabyte worth of that, like at the original pricing. And I think it was like three million dollars. <laughs> well, no, I, I've seen like pics of like a megabyte hard drive in like 1916 is like bigger than the person is. Oh, I love that. I love that I stuff. Remember, remember in the old days when they thought computers were going to get bigger and they got significantly smaller <laughs> yeah. and everybody was confused. Remember in the old days and everyone oh, thought is. computers would get bigger and then the transistor was born. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, I, I have the uh, stats here for the memory cards. To buy one terabyte worth of PS2 memory cards at their original price, that would have cost $4,375,000. <laughs> consisting of 125,000 memory cards. At what, 20 a piece? A steel. I <laughs> guess that's what that what would be. I, I think they were 20 or 25 a piece. Something like that. Uh, when they first came out. God, I was there. <laughs> All right. I uh, I think I'm going to be, be uh, heading out for a bit now. Uh, yeah, so, uh, that's no fine. problem. Thank you Playing for the game, time. But thanks Appreciate for having the, me the retrospect. Look at the fucking rope. <laughs> All right. So, <laughs> so, John, right, right, John, 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 look, at, look at the rope. Yeah. Look at the rope. Yeah. Now realize that you're at the end of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at the end of my rope. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, the rope? It's like Doodle Bob. Oh, no. no. Not the Sonic oh, King Glider is there a again. Hand it's the Glider. Why? I don't know how this works. He, he is going through a midlife crisis. He's doing all sorts of things that he thinks Very will make him younger. Recreational activities. Yeah, he's like, oh, this will make me feel young. Yeah, die, you piece. Oh my God, are you serious? Because I didn't fucking shoot the rock again. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. Hey, pizza's here. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, because I didn't have the hindsight to know the tree was there before. Mm. I'm just going to fucking die unless there's a uh, way I can just drop immediately can i shoot back no. okay okay you shouldn't make him go down all right what? you know charlie brown had a tree that ate kites <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that one eats hand gliders oh, 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 oh. yes wow that was literally pixels away yes. from death man remember pac-man famous what? for hang gliding <laughs> how am i supposed to safely land it's like so uh, uh it's like top gun <laughs> oh no! I'm you never gotta, winning this now. You, you got to be at roughly 200 miles an hour. <laughs> so when I I bought both of these games, I bought the Super Nintendo one and the Genesis one on eBay. So John has the uh, SNES cart, but that yeah. one came with a handwritten note from the seller that says, "Sure, you'll enjoy this game." I'm sorry, it's one of the most unique games at the time I found uh, for the Super Nintendo, like a point-and-click game but with Pac-Man themes. I hope you enjoy it, and if you have any issue, please contact me. I think I contact the seller and be like, "This game uh, sucks." It's it's funny, I Ben. You were suck. you were talking about the note, uh, the note with the games, and I was honestly expecting you to say that the note just said, "This is your problem now." <laughs> <laughs> you have until midnight to remove the curse. All right, all right. All right. Came with a copy of Jumanji. Land, you piece of shit! <laughs> 
I don't think it's over. Oh, tree! Oh no! Oh, oh no! We got the jar. Yes. We got the oh, jar. Oh my god! How did I fucking do that? Oh man, this is terrific. Did he finish? One. Oh my god! Finish level one. <laughs> <laughs> it only took an can hour we, and ten minutes with three can, players. Can we get P in both chat for <laughs> for uh, completing the first Pac-Man two level? Can we get some P's in there? <laughs> Someone's like, can we move on now? <laughs> All right, so this is this is the Pac-Man cartoon. Uh, I'm on the wiki page now. Uh, Pac-Man is a 30-minute Saturday morning American animated series, blah, 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 Hannah Barbera. Uh, 80, a 44 episodes uh, over two seasons from 82 to 83. Uh, the plot is uh, the show follows the adventures of the title character Pac-Man and his wife, his wife, Pepper Pac-Man. Her, na- her first name was Pepper. What? Um, like Pepper Potts? <laughs> yeah, so, so Pac-Man is, so I think I said this earlier that I think Pac-Man is his last name, but, but we just don't know his first name. Um, My name so, is yeah. Pac- so, Pac-Man. So yeah, so so Pac-Man and, and Pepper Pac-Man, their child Pac-Baby, which okay, uh, and their dog Chomp Chomp, and their cat Sourpuss. The family lives in Pac-Land, a place in which the geography and architecture seems to revolve primarily around sphere-like shapes. <laughs> uh, ima- imagine living in a city where all the buildings were shaped like people. It sounds like Rolling Stones. <laughs> that, that's what, that's what like it really- is. God yes, it damn it! Like <laughs> uh, ink, uh, Blinky, Inky, Pinky, Clyde, and Sue. They were all five ghosts in the show. I do remember that. What about Kinky? Um, uh, yeah, where's Kinky? <laughs> and the rest! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they, uh, they work They work for men. <laughs> oh, I don't know why they made me laugh. I don't know. <laughs> um, they work for Mesmeron whose sole mission is to locate and control the source of power pellets, which serve as the primary food and power source for the city, and also is the deus ex machina in virtually every episode. Uh, the second and final season later introduces Super Pac and Pac's ma- Pac-Man's teenage cousin PJ. Blah. Pac-Man's teenage cousin PJ. I, I mean, were the, the ghosts, <laughs> were the ghosts really his enemy, or were these guys just trying to stage whoa, an intervention? Whoa, what the- <laughs> I, I no, I I think that the ghosts were the enemy based up. on Mesmeron, but they were probably duped the into fuck? thinking they were fighting a different war. <laughs> they were led to believe that the packs were the enemies of the ghosts when really they didn't care. Wait, uh, how do you not uh, die from that tree? I don't know. Just <laughs> fucking weird. I'm still laughing at yeah. human shaped buildings. <laughs> <laughs> so it is. You know what it's like? It's it's like um it's like the gingerbread thing. The 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 gingerbread gag. You know you know the gingerbread one? No. Uh a gingerbread man lives in a gingerbread house. Uh or, is is he made of walls or are the walls made of flesh? He screamed, <laughs> for he it's does like not that, know. It's like that Pokemon <laughs> Soul Silver meme that goes around where, because you know the Pokemon follow you in that game, and you talk to Regice in the ice path, and it's like Regice is surprised <laughs> to be walking on ice. It's like, but you're made of ice. But then the next comments like, like, well, yeah, well, you are going through a cave made of skin that make you uncomfortable too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the chat knows it. Is is the man made of house or is the house I'm made of flesh? Bad. He screams, for he does not know. <laughs> Why am I looking at the bunny? Yeah, that bunny's got red eyes. Yeah, like this bunny's <laughs> looking at me. I like I'm waiting for it to lunge at me. No, don't pull the ivy. It's a ferocious gun. monster. The bunny is made by the witch of envy. Well, sorry. This the piece witch of shit. I knew it. <laughs> wait. Wait. Hold on. Wait. No way. Oh, I, I, <laughs> Hold wait. on. Oh my god. He no. fucking sent me to all the way to the back, you piece of fucking shit! That's fucking awesome. Wait a second. The demon bunny strikes. I recognize that area, Johnny. Hang on. That was amazing. <laughs> oh, wow. This game is great. Uh, yeah. John, you okay? No! <laughs> People are saying, is there a rewind feature? <laughs> no, but there's a power button. <laughs> yeah, his, and then he that, like his, has his, Batman hooked up to a dick. machine. What the fuck 
are you doing? Why did he suddenly just walk off the cliff now? Oh, that's City of Bane. That's a kick-ass story. Oh, 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 no, no, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn this it. Is, this is, <laughs> this is painful. That's yeah, one word like for it. Sounds like a shell of the Hedgehog game now. Oh, he stops boy. now. Why did he not do that before? <laughs> Guess I'll die. <laughs> How whoa, 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 bad whoa, whoa. is it? Credit. Yeah, don't give me credit for that. It's okay, I'm okay. sorry. Uh, yeah. Gibby's on Genesis. How bad is it that that Ben's game was locked on the first level forever? John advanced past that early, and now they're at the same point again. Did they? Did, uh, did he do the minecart <laughs> section yet? No. No. I, okay, so I, I, he no, still has a second. So they're in different order. He's still, oh my yeah, God. He, he's doing something different. Yeah, yeah, he's doing a different order. The one thing I do like uh, because of the way that the Genesis handles its sprite limitations and uh, color palettes is that he does get way more room on the Genesis version to actually see what's coming. Yeah. You know, you know how you can tell a bad Genesis game. You want to know how you can tell a bad Genesis game? Oh, the crunch. Because when you look at it, you start talking about the technical aspects of it instead of the game itself. At no point, at no point in that did he say, oh, the game is kind of good. He needed to talk about how they handle sprite limitations. <laughs> That's it. Oh, it actually, if you, now that it's kind of quiet, you can hear them talking. You can hear them asking for help. <laughs> help! Hi, help! <laughs> Hi. Hi. It's, like, it's like, listen, listen, you can hear them. You can hear them talking. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Ooh, we said too much. <laughs> the only reason I'm laughing and enjoying this is because I am not playing it. Uh, weirdly enough, I am kind of enjoying it. Because it's satisfying to kind of figure it out. This isn't Dark Souls. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I mean, it's probably Dark Souls hard. For all the wrong reasons. For, for the wrongest reasons possible. Oh, yeah. Uh, all right. So what did I do beforehand that had the rabbit cuck me? <laughs> um, you didn't kill the rabbit. That's I... what... Kill, kill the rabbit! Kill, kill the rabbit! Rabbit season. <laughs> Do I shoot? Like, Maybe just don't summon the rabbit. The key to this game. <laughs> hey, are you still? Tr are you still trying to get the flower? Yes. Is that what I all of this mission know. is? <laughs> Johnny's Pac-Man looks so I, sad. I guess somebody was saying, like, I think it was DYL. I was like, why don't you just go to the store? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, and there's a balloon here. Is the balloon a trap? The balloon's a trap. a trap. I I assume everything that is. Oh, it's like if I grab it, it'll carry you grab me away. You're gonna fly away. Right. If you yeah. grab it, you're gonna fly away. You're gonna fly away. Bloomer, you're gonna actually. fly away. <laughs> look at the flowers. It says go left. It says look down. Yeah. Like, it, can you look? Yeah. yeah so go to, go left. Right, 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 I'm trying to get. Yeah, yeah, I'm trying to get him uh, to look down. One second. One second. He won't stop at the flowers. I just can't get over like the at the flowers. <laughs> the painful look oh, of depression. Flowers. Don't you love your wife? No. No. We're not I, married. I, I, She's not here. Mrs. <laughs> Why is he so depressed? Like seriously, the mean. flowers are Should... right here. I'm concerned for him. He looks super depressed and he's standing at the Why? edge of a cliff. Go yeah, back, dude, you piece of shit. Go! Oh, fucker! <laughs> but oh, was it... <laughs> <laughs> wasn't this a scene in Family Guy? You gotta shoot the Oh my god, don't you fucking shoot do it. Them. Don't you, do it. Do it. Don't you fucking do it. Don't you fucking do it. Don't you fucking piece of fucking he's shit. Sprinted. This is so fucking great. He sprinted for the cliff, it looked like. Wait, you got it. You got the flower. You didn't press anything. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're supposed to not press anything because this game is oh, depressing. Oh, so just don't play the game. <laughs> yeah, see, the game is depressing. So you're pressing, that's wrong. That you're, you're playing the whole thing wrong. You're not supposed to be pressing. You're supposed to be depressing. Yeah, all right, we got it. Wait. We got it. So now I have to, now I have to int intentionally provoke the rabbit because there's no way to get back home unless I grab the Yeah, board. because you got to use the, the train now, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> the, the, or do you use the, the balloon? Oh, do you use the balloon to get home? Does the balloon take you away back to the house? Oh my God, this is the greatest train logic. Up and away. 
does whatever a Wait. spider pig does. Oh, Johnny, I, I just gotta take the tram back. Web. The hole in the tree isn't anything, by the way. That's where the rabbit comes out of. But you have okay. to pull the vine. It's not you, you don't shoot inside the hole. You just pull the vine. Oh my God. You don't shoot inside well, the hole. Then can you shoot you the vine pull and the then vine. look up? I've been trying that for the last five minutes. <laughs> hey, hey, you're the one that sucks at this game. We'll take it out on us. <laughs> <laughs> you are ruining my birthday party. <laughs> Give it, right. you gotta you gotta now, pick up the flower. Oh not my the flower. god. Okay. <laughs> Pull the vine. It's random! <laughs> Do you need more vines? <laughs> Pac Man! Are there any more vine vines? Whip. Alright, that's an apple. I do core. miss my vines. Alright. It's, 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 it's just that's an apple. It's just an apple. Try apple core. again. Yeah, yeah. I think well, I think I just I lowered this one. Does He's gonna go to go to it. The got fuck are you looking at? <laughs> Just go. Core empty. <laughs> Yeet. Co <laughs> Calm. Why are you ignoring it? <laughs> He's too angry. Yeah, why wouldn't he? He you is know what? I don't make him happy. Have a pillow. Oh my god. That'll make you happy. This is angry. Is that what it is? I really think that's what it <gasps> is. Oh. Shoot him until he's happy. Uh oh. Oh, what did you do? I think Wait, I'm locked. I me and Johnny, I think, are at a lock seat. Because you don't have any more power pellets and you need a power pellet to finish this. Yes. Is that what's going I wanna, on? I just need to trigger the rabbit. No, because, no Johnny, it, well, yeah, you might be able to do it that way. But um, if you do this uh, fly state, what you can do is um, you, you can get up on that top ledge. I just had it happen. He was on the ledge right next to where the glider was. But he wasn't happy, but I'm not happy enough. Oh, just fuck off and die, Pac-Man. Like, seriously, because I'm not getting any. All right. I got the flower, <laughs> but I still think we're screwed. <laughs> Did wow. I get the flower? I this got the is... flower. <laughs> it's simple. We uh kill the Pac-Man. <laughs> <laughs> go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Look at the moon. Uh, uh, Colonel Campbell's are. Colonel Campbell's chicken noodle soup. Campbell's! Uh, Colonel oh, Campbell's God. chicken noodle soup <laughs> donated a dollar and said, Johnny, something happened to me last Thursday when I was driving home. Oh, God. <laughs> I had a couple of miles to go. I looked up and saw a glowing yellow object in the sky to the east. It was moving very irregularly. Suddenly, there was an intense light all around me. And when I came to, I was in Pac-Man 2 getting the milk for the <laughs> missus. What do you think happened to me? <laughs> I, I think you were hit by a car and <laughs> ended in hell. It's a Metal Gear Solid you, reference. You might be in hell. Pull the vines to open a hidden passage. I pull the... He doesn't go to the vines! <laughs> <laughs> like, I literally shoot the vines. They lower down and he just walks past them. I get it. I try to get him the look. you're the same look. problem I'm having. Yeah. So, he's, someone, he's someone literally in Twitch too chat, depressed to do anything. Yeah, someone in Twitch chat just posted a strategy walkthrough for this. So uh, that's up to you if you want to quit. go wait, at wait, it. Is that the answer? You, oh, wait. Suave donates a dollar and says, you think Pac-Man is your ally, but you merely adopted the pac I was born right. in it, molded by it. I didn't see Pac-Man in Smash until I 100 percent in Pac-Man 2, and by then it was nothing to me but blinding. <laughs> if you shoot the third curled up vine in the fifth tree and make it uncurl and Pac-Man pulls it, it will cause a rabbit to jump out of the hole in the fifth tree, which you already did, who will make Pac the rabbit makes Pac-Man happier? So you need do, so you need to make the rabbit reappear. That will make him happy. But he if he's not already happy, he won't pull the vine. That's you know, the thing. Yeah, Pac-Man is really needy. Also, if he's happy when he walks into the flower patch before the edge, he will pick up a pink flower and do his victory dance for a third time while holding it up in the air. You will now have to use Y or the C button in conjunction with the D-pad to try to make Pac-Man look back. The fact that it just said to try to make Pac-Man look back to the left is bothering the hell out of me. Wow. Seventh tree or maybe the ninth gateway to hell. Yeah, really <laughs> like, read that walkthrough that was, that was linked and it's, it's amazing. It, it, it just... Yeah, if you pop the balloon, uh, it makes the birds fly out, and that either makes him angrier or sadder. Wait, so you're telling wait, oh me? My wait, God. what the wait, fuck? Stop. Wait, jo Johnny got. Oh, you. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. Holy shit. He's happy. All right, go to the vine. 
Come on. Be happy. Be happy. <laughs> Don't right. worry. Yeah. Be happy. All right. All right. So, <laughs> now, all right, so that, the, that unleashed that, the whole. Oh, oh, the, oh, the rabbit shows up anyway. Now, I think you're supposed to. Oh. Okay, yeah, you went into the hole. No. So, so, so the thing that happened by there. accident a long time ago was the thing you wanted that to have happen. The thing you were supposed to be doing. Now, hold on, let me go back to the walkthrough here. I, I think me and Johnny got it from here. This is the ultimate animal. You got did, it? Did you guys make progress or did yes. you? Yes, we just made progress. At the same time? Well, Johnny found nope. the birds in the first tree, which makes him happy. Yeah. That was the problem. First oh my God, I think you're like. Minutes. You thought it was about the birds and the bees, but it was actually about the birds in the trees. What are you sad about? <laughs> <laughs> you failed again. Oh You're my god! You were supposed to be depressed on that cliff forever. Then he found the birds. You're supposed to eat the birds. <laughs> this is wow. This is this is the pinnacle of gaming right here. This is it. This is the top. Everything else is second place. Pac-Man Two Game of the Year. 2020. Oh, shit. oh, the girl had an allergic reaction to that flower. Now you need to go and get the medicine. Oh boy. Are you going to continue? No. I'm out of here. <laughs> this game is terrible. This is terrible. Such oh my god. All right. Turn. Yeah. I I I I just want to I, I just want to move on. Yeah, there we go. Uh Ben and Dan had more fun in their games and they were kidnapped by a Nazi dino dinosaur <laughs> and traveled through a cow's oh ass. Uh... <laughs> It's so him? simple. Yeah, he's under <laughs> I love the artwork that somebody did of of Bane of Pac Bane breaking uh Johnny's back. <laughs> How we're ranking so far? It looks like we are number four for Chop. Yeah. Really? All right. Woo! Screen to beat. It's off about this game. I can't see for the team, but that's how we're doing. And... Suck it, losers. <laughs> I mean, it's for the team. <laughs> And okay. Dan Palumbo, that name sounds familiar. That, that, that is number three really at six thousand six hundred eighty dollars. Okay, we gotta be at least Palumbo. Not Dan. It's not Dan from Com Console Wars, is it? No. It's, <laughs> that's Palumbo. Um, that's Dan Palumbo. Uh, I, I, I feel like. Uh, <laughs> but, 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 <laughs> Lord <Yikes>. of Man. <laughs> is Nathan here? I stopped playing the game for the record. <laughs> I know. I see. All right. Uh, all right, hang on, quiet for a second. 8.01 p.m. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone's back in the normal spot. We are going to Ooh. take a break. Met Hold on, right before we do that, Metachoke says full playthrough should be an incentive. Oh, God, that'd be great. Yeah, so we, no, not 20,000, no. Uh, 15K. 15K? Yeah. Okay. I'll if do it. If we get if 15K, we break 15k, I will resume this playthrough. Like when? start from the beginning. To, oh. <laughs> okay, you know what? Sure. However much okay. money he does drop is how much it will be for. 15k, I will refresh from the beginning and do the entire thing. Uh, Ehelig, uh, donated 25 dollars. Uh, glad I finally caught one of these while it's still going on. Fun. A topic for you guys which game franchise would you choose to parody batman universe that's an interesting question i guess because we made the pac-man batman sort yeah. of connection um i don't know um i mean castlevania works well as would. a sort of batman like aesthetically it's yeah, very like similar. art deco is already kind of yeah bad. definitely so grand theft got... auto oh grand theft auto yeah, yeah. Um, also, uh, Among Us, kind of, uh, that could be like an Arkham Asylum with the villains, I don't know. Um, I don't know, Killer Croc's no, looking kind of sus. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it works well because Among Us doesn't really have a storyline yeah, per right. se. You're right, you're right. But I think the premise of Among Us using Batman characters stuck in Arkham would actually be kind of funny. And Kirby's Epic Yarn could be cool if that was Clayface. All right, uh, you <laughs> oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hold on, because I, I just thought of that too. Uh, one of the tasks can be you have to go up to the roof with another player, and mm -hmm. one of you has to shine the flashlight to the get across, and the other one has to walk across <laughs> it. Yeah. What are you, I'm crazy? <laughs> You think I am crazy? You just turn it off when I'm halfway over there. 
among yeah, all guys. Batman villains stuck in Arkham. Yeah, that'd be great. Oh, but the imp oh, but the imposter is actually Bruce Wayne or Batman in disguise, and you're trying to figure yeah. out which one of yeah. them is actually Batman. Like when he's disguised as Killer Croc and almost got him in the Batman animated episode. <laughs> great. Yeah, I threw a rock at him. I could go on about Batman the animated series. Yeah. That could be one of the deaths. When you get the death animation, it's just you throw a rock at them and they just die. All right, game's ready to go. All right, so the way this game works, it's called Pac-Man Versus. We are playing on, I'm just going to say two GameCubes because I'm not going to be pedantic. One has a Game Boy player, which is what is you're seeing on the right. On the left is the console game. So this is... Imagine this like an asymmetric Wii U game before the Wii U. So what happens on the GameCube, you are playing as the ghost. And on the Game Boy Advantage, you are Pac-Man. Oh, God. I'm fucked. So this is, it's asymmetrical uh, versus uh, Friday the 13th. Uh, seven dollar and sixty eight cent donation from Super Nintendo Game right, Boy. I'm the Green Ghost. Oh God, I'm the I'm Pac Man. Oh, oh crap! Okay, but... This is not good. No, this good. I'll get to this question us. when everyone's set up. Oh yeah, that's right. So, yeah. I the pink I... Yes. Yeah, they don't make it clear like which thing you are. Pac Man moves oh. like he's on molasses. Wow. Yeah, yeah, what the hell? Slow. Holy fuck! Uh, is it like Fourteen. Wow. Oh, damn. here come that boy. They re released like it. Oh, oh, no. No, no, no. You bastard. How did you do that? Do I win? Uh, the way it is, because the, the limited view of the ghost is what fuckers. makes me. You're going to fucking die. There we go. Good. Good. Yeah, Go. I feel like, I feel like <laughs> that. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, no. okay. And I got the credit did, for it. How did you should have so died close. there? That is killer. Because yes. it's best. <laughs> this is. Wow, okay. Guys, I need you to let me fucking win. Because <laughs> you don't let me hey. fucking win, I'm going to fucking I said that, pass. Clark, it didn't work for Pac-Man 2. It's not going to work for Versus. I had a warning about that. You fucking, you fucking thing. You, you, you get, get, get away from me. Get away. You guys are both stupid. <laughs> <laughs> get the fuck away from me. Oh, wow, I never heard no. Clark get this. This is the loudest I've ever heard Clark. I, I did not know Clark could get that loud. Holy shit. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, you, but you guys are dead God. to me. You're not, you're not, you're not oh doing this. You're not doing this. Okay. Can you stop? <laughs> Just stop, please. You go get away from me. Andrew Clark is kind of frightening. <laughs> leave. Leave. Oh, my God. You fuck her. Wait. What? How did he go? No. no. You're not doing this to me. You're not doing this to me. No. No. Okay. Great. Okay. We're going to figure right, uh, this out. Ben, can you do me a favor? I like how the chat's saying this is Clark's true form coming out. <laughs> okay, you, okay. I'm trying my best here, but there's red motherfucker. <laughs> I never thought I'd be playing this for Clark. I'm really going to be honest. Oh, no. uh, okay. $25 from John. It's great to see everyone coming together to again play games. Oh, for come on. Keep up the great uh, oh. It's just $25 from John. Jesus. Thanks so much, John, for your support. Five dollars from you. Amiibro Central. <laughs> I'm so sorry, John. No, 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 I'm talking to the fan fucking ghost. Hi, Johnny. Unfortunately, I can't stick around for long, but I wanted to make a small donation together, so just want to say thank oh you for all the hard work. Thank you very much. No. no. So no you want that put this towards the fair. arcade raffle? Well, I mean, you don't have to clarify, but, you know. Oh, uh, you got the score so you needed. Nice. Yeah, there Mark you go. One. Uh, Oops, uh, sorry, sorry, we're talking over that, Johnny. Yeah, that continues. No, no, it's no, that was the last donation, so I'm, I'm caught up. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Yeah. Wait, no, I'm not caught up. Got five dollars donation from Ghost. Oh. I wanted to <laughs> five dollars donation from Ghost. I wanted to be friends with Clark, but he is really apprehensive about it. What can I do to make him open up to me? <laughs> oh no! Didn't Ghost get shot at the end of the show? <laughs> It terrifies me when you guys clarify how young you guys were when you were watching my channel for the first time, for the record. Yeah, I would imagine. I don't need, like, to feel the hairline on my scalp recede any further back. Oh. So if you can just, like, you know, oh, seven grand. Oh, this is not, this is, this is, oh my god, okay, wait. One second. Oh, I got this, guys. Look at me. I got it. I got oh my this. God. Oh, 
Why did you go down? Don't make me do stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I? Fill me up, Chandler. Put it in me. <laughs> I hate you, <laughs> This is so addictive. I cannot. Stop oh, those are the ghosts talking to Pac-Man. Oh yeah, that's the way. I'm sorry, I'm overly aggressive. I just get confused. I sell propane and propane accessories. Gosh, you're big. You're so big. My goodness. This is horrible. Oh. Man, I hope everybody watches Better Call Saul to get where these go from. And hopefully, and hopefully, you can actually hear the sounds now. Yeah, it is. My God, I love every fucking <laughs> You're a third-rate duelist with a fourth-rate deck. Oh man. Gosh, you're big. I, I must sound like an asshole. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> oh, you sound like an asshole. What the fuck? What does that make us? <laughs> what an asshole! Tonight. Sorry, they have been very small donations, but I'm hoping to do these in the future and I can donate some more now. Hey, dude, every little bit helps. I don't really give a shit how big or small they are. Uh, had lots of fun listening to all the usual shenanigans and wish you guys good blessings and hope you reach your donations, guys. Question for question for thought: What is a vid <laughs> what is a video game franchise that you know you wish had more recognition and attention? Dude, it's always I going really to be enjoyed uh, Super Mario. Fuck. Um, su <laughs> Super uh, Mario. Fuck. Super, um, I sell propane and propane accessories. No, the Super Mario, the like the land games and the war. The, what, what was this question? A <laughs> uh, five dollar donation from Tommy. Hey John, I know you said not to do this, but I've been watching since my middle school days, and I'm now in college. Fucking hell. What? Five dollars from Big the Cat. Legendary gods in John's basement, <laughs> please hear my call. In the name of every gamer that came before, uh -huh. I now beseech ye, awaken mighty Clark and rid the sacred place of this darkness. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I've uh, never uh, seen you get that heated before, Clark. That's a great uh, I like that side of you. I, wow, well, that's the best round yet. Oh, uh, what did I fucking do? I oh already my God. got you. Oh, you that, didn't move. That's so fucking bullshit. Oh, uh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I sound like a dick. What happened? You didn't move. Yeah. Bullshit. <laughs> This is <laughs> This game sucks. I love it. <laughs> Suck! The handhelds don't get enough attention. Suck! This game sucks! Smoking marijuana, eating Cheetos, and masturbating. Okay, masturbating Cheetos. That's white cheddar. We got, uh... Oh, we got a $3.84 cent though that I did. I was kind of... I, I, I heard that too. And another dollar from Chris Fratz. Shit, I meant to put this for John. You're old. Uh, oh, okay, it's your old. Uh, Grown like a geek. Oh, uh, I, I, okay, so this is that. I'm assuming these are the lyrics for the Your Old song uh, from SpongeBob. I never really listened to the whole thing besides the first like few phrases, like You're old. You're old. Do you know the song, Ben? Groaning like a geezer. I'm only gonna play like the first few seconds of this because this will get flagged. Yeah, this will. Groaning like a geezer. <laughs> Being yourself a cracker like an old has been. Yeah, this is from SpongeBob. Yeah, it stops. Yeah, 29 that's seconds, enough. we're fine. 29 seconds, yeah, yeah. Okay, so, are you, so you go for like the full length of. Uh, uh, free use thing because I, I don't go I don't go past ten because I'm much of that paranoid oh, fuck. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm back by the way, so. Okay. Okay. Who's Who was Joe Biden playing back? Ha, ha, ha. No, he finally uh, woke up because he found out that uh, Willie got the ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he was all he was all sick in bed until Willie walk, <laughs> until uh, uh, Charlie walked him with the ticket. Oh, Clark's gonna love this stage. Oh, I'm just I'm just all of a sudden Grandpa Wonka. Joe's fine. We've definitely streamed more than uh, uh, ten hours at a time for YouTube because um, uh, one of the archives that we do not have available, and I know for a fact someone has it. I'm not sure if they emailed me because my emails are a mess. Like they've been a mess for the whole year. Is that the Mega uh, Man? For a, for a multi yeah, Mega Maniac. So we did a few years ago is the only one that we don't have a highlights reel of because uh, because of a uh, uh, 
streaming setup snafu, there was no local recording of it. Oh, okay. uh, and we only, we we had to rely on the Twitch archive, which I did not download on time because I, I just didn't get to it. And uh, the YouTube uh, post upload was stuck in processing hell, and it never processed. Uh, but someone had the archive. I think someone still does have the archive. You want it? Um, I got it right here. You do? I'm yeah. Just, I'm that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 you know, Bush, I'd wow, rather cool. give it to I'd rather give it to Isao and pay him to make a highlights reel. There you uh, go. It's in the chat. Again, I don't know if someone has it or has it in their in their backlog. If they do, uh, I just posted. Send it. me a DM on Twitter at some call me John because my DMs uh, are open. Why aren't you listening to me, yeah, Johnny? Johnny, can yeah, you hear me? He just sent legit. Cool. Yeah. Oh shit! What? It's all, oh, <laughs> Discord. Un under discussion. Oh. Yeah, I've had this for like two months. What the fuck? Yeah, someone <laughs> gave it to me to give it to you. You just never listened to me. What the fuck? <laughs> just like you. We've been doing streams tonight. for how long? You don't mention. It? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, how many streams, you Jason? Just never listened to how me. How many streams? <laughs> <laughs> I, thought, I thought Jason was just fucking. I want suck her. I'm gonna. Hey, I'm, I'm Jason Henry. I'm gonna share this porn like a Wizard of Oz, but I'm gonna not gonna do the Mega Maniacs clip because I don't think John's be really interested in that. Yeah, that that may. Yeah, I, I sent it to you in yeah. August, August 9th. <laughs> in your DMs. That that marathon happened August. Like, uh, what was it? Two years ago when Halloween came out. I couldn't get out of work. Yeah, I want to see what that was now. Like. Yeah, Mega Maniacs was November 11th. I want to see what it was gigs. like because I missed it all. The only thing I immediately oh, remember God. about Mega Maniacs is me breaking down by the end. Did someone say 200 gigs? No, 20. it's 21 gigs. Oh. It's 21 gigs. Okay. Spectre Salmon in the chat. Uh, PS2 memory cards are 8 megabytes, and it's about 1,020 megabytes to 1 gigabyte. So 21 gigabytes would be 21,588 megabytes, which would be 2,698.5 PS2 memory cards. <laughs> I, I love that they took the time. This could be worth talking about that. <laughs> That's a lot of memory. All right, card. now, now convert that down to uh, Saturn internal memory. Oh dear God! <laughs> oh, how many Saturns would I need? Well, um, <laughs> any, any, anything to not <laughs> use the metric system. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! All right, so these fun facts are gonna be a little fucking weird. Uh, did you know uh -oh. that the 20th U.S. president? Uh, did you know that the 20th U.S. president James A. Garfield wasn't killed by his assassin's bullet, but the poor treatment by the doctors at the time? P.S. Jason had a copy of the stream that he didn't remember that he had it until now. No, it's more like he he did remember. He sent it to me, but I just didn't pay attention. No, Garfield was killed by the man who shot him because uh, he, he bled, bled to death. Uh, but also, he was succeeded by William McKinley, who also got shot and was succeeded by uh, Theodore Roosevelt. Um, wait, wait, and, wait, and, wait. Hold on. And right? was the guy that shot Garfield Charles Gatell? Yeah. I don't think was so. Was it John Arbuckle? I don't know, but yeah. I do think that, um, <laughs> yeah. Wow, wait, are there was like, is that is that a fast food reference? Uh, no, that's Garfield. Oh, Garfield, okay. His owner, yeah. John. Oh, okay, I thought you were talking about like Colonel Sanders and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I, I need to, I really need to stop yes, saying what I say on my head. Yeah, seriously. Garfield was shot by Nermal. <laughs> I think it looking good. Also, fuck that cat. <laughs> Hey, John, I found yes. it. I'm dead. What, did you? I think yeah, it was sitting in the box of hopes and dreams. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Can so you please get that up to reset it to be ASAP? Here you so go. How long, how long is it? Okay, yeah. It's multiple files. It's multiple files. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my god, holy shit. 18 name that plus. starts with the letter K. Kentucky Fried Chicken. Oh. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, all right, clock oh one more round and we'll yeah. probably be done. Oh my play, god, man. oh, I, just sucks I feel I validated. Play. I'm pretty happy. Mega Maniacs is 220 gigs. Yeah, that's how more appropriate. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, so you got you got the full you got the full show? Why is, that, why is it called Box of Hopes? <laughs> all right, I, don't know. I'm, I'm, I just I'm, thought it was a good name. Right. So also, can... hey, we hit seven thousand. Seven thousand dollars for Pac-Man favor. So yeah, remember our our original goal is ten thousand dollars, and we're 
again, we're we're not even halfway at the the completion point of this event, and you guys are doing phenomenal. And if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna pat myself on the back here. I was correct. Charles Gateau shot President James Garfield on July second, nineteen eighty one. By the way, July second, my birthday, birthday yeah. worst birthday ever. <laughs> I I remember that day in eighteen eighty one. It was very sad. I don't know why I know that. That was my point. Yeah, Arbiter John, this I was able to find it. <laughs> I just completely forgot that I had that folder Sorry. named Box of Hopes and Dreams. Oh yeah, uh, Arbiter John Dice is in the chat right oh. now. Uh, Arbiter, yeah, I finally found the fucking message. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, Arbiter John Dice is in the chat right now, with the uh, using the piss stain, the piss colored uh, text for his name. Uh, so thank you for managing to hold on to those archives for as long as I like it, by the way. Sorry, his name is Jondis and his yeah. color is yellow. Is that is that supposed to be like, is that a reference to something? Uh, it's a medical condition. Uh, it, it's I think it relates to like a liver problem. Okay. Uh, your body, your, your liver's not working or it's shutting down. Right. So your skin turns yellow. It's called cool. jaundice. Cool. I feel like an uh, asshole. Now. Uh, I think. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, and, and you said you're playing the N64 version? No, uh, Clark is playing the GBA version as punishment. Yep. Yeah. For what? I don't what are know, you? But, uh, just as yeah. Just, what? I, 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 <laughs> uh, it says congratulations on the seven K. Now let's keep goblin balls for the kids. All right. Um, who wants to count us down? <laughs> just make sure the kids aren't watching. You know. Yeah. I mean, it's super appropriate. It's super appropriate for all the kids. I'm dipping out of here. I'm gonna eat, and then I'll just be watched for the rest of this. <laughs> no, that's fine. Thank you for the company, Jason. You're welcome to come back in anytime you want. See you, Jason. Uh, yeah. So, Uncle. I'll just make sure to remember. Yeah. It. Uh, remind you of those um, files. I my think I'm ready to go. Uh... <laughs> Alright, count down. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> P.S. It's good to see Chris Clark on here again. He's become a staple for these extra live streams. Chris Clark is the best. Oh, God, Clark. Oh, yeah. Fuck <laughs> 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 I'm just going through this, and if something happens, I'm probably just going to get pissed. Or it is pretty linear. It, it looks like it is, but so. I mean, if if I could play it at eleven, I feel like <laughs> you guys can probably play it. I, I'm just She's either boosting your confidence or roasting you badly. <laughs> I mean, I was quite a gamer when I was a child, but you know, Normal the cat says. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if we can swear on this stream, so... Absolutely, you could, yeah. Oh, well, fuck, I've been caught. Yeah, I shot him, I shot Garfield. And I'll do it again! <laughs> fuck the orange. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> oh, is that the Garfield guy? Yeah. For the longest time as a little kid, I thought Nerma was a girl cat. Me too! It's I... not? It's not? It is not. No, Nermal's, Nermal's a boy. This it was like, like the... when I learned... Uh, that Pete from Mickey Mouse was a cat. This is my mind is not accepting. Oh, this. I knew, I knew. I, I, I was in between him being a cat or a bulldog. Is I would know? have thought bulldog before I would have thought cat. Ooh, he's a cat. Yeah. I looked uh, it up on the here on the Disney Wikipedia. Yeah, it makes <laughs> sense because he was Mickey's first. Uh, Lover. Yeah. Sexual experience. Well, uh, in, sexual experience. in Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, <laughs> yeah. they they say he's a cat, and I literally had to pause and rewind, and my toddler was like, what the heck are you doing? Yeah, to pause. 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 Because yeah, pause. Pause. <laughs> uh, he's a cat. Yeah. <laughs> I love these yeah, Egyptian-looking Kool-Aid men. They're really cool. Kool-Aid men? Cool. <laughs> <laughs> They look like Kool-Aid <laughs> men. See? No, look they don't. They look good. I, uh, they I don't total. follow you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hi, Tony. Oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, see this? How's it going? That is totally Mr. Kool-Aid. With, with, with an Egyptian pharaoh hat. <laughs> uh, that's Mr. Kool-Aid to you. I need to stop. Because <laughs> 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 the Mega Maniacs happened during Halloween, and I looked at the movie. Uh, yeah, it was like 11 one to 11 two, I think. Yeah, it was an early one. Movie theaters, what are those things? Is that the, it was that the uh, year we went to see Thor Ragnarok? No, or was that, that Mario Mania? Mania? That was Mario Mania? Okay. Yep. 
Are uh, movie theaters those like ancient tombs that you see? Yeah, they show yeah. you visual images mm -hmm. of people doing yeah. strange and mystical stuff. Which means since I worked at one, did that make me a crypt keeper? Oh my god. <laughs> ancient scrolls reveal uh, a most exuberant practice of people paying premium prices for simple popcorn and soda. Yeah, I, uh, I would, fact, I would uh, pay to see actually... Chris being a crypt keeper. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, I would love to be with the dead bodies like that, but, um, um, yeah, the, uh, we need to clip that one. Uh, All right, so we're getting to the good part with Clark. Okay, oh, <laughs> wait a second, guys, hold up, but yeah, um, get that one on the soundboard. Okay, <laughs> don't make me jump scare in front of everybody again. Leave the guy alone, would you? Ooh, yeah, fruit salad, you got a pretzel? Man, he was full of, of shit. Of I have a pretzel tree in my yard. <laughs> well, you know what Clark has in his yard? Duck what? tree. Oh, oh my god. I, that, that, yeah, I don't even remember the context of that. I don't either. We've got a couple more donations. I'll read those out real quick. Uh, we have $50 from Cap and Kohai. Uh, I don't know how weirdly the random fact, fun facts are going. I tend to type haphazardly. Clark, you said that Garfield died from bleeding out from his assassination. Well, I guess he did. There was a good chance he would have survived, but we can't say for sure, though. That's the point. It's just the doctors were supposed to save him sucked at it. Anyway, random fun fact. Did you know that Abraham Lincoln's son, Robert Todd Lincoln, was not only present for his father's assassination, but for both Garfields and McKinley's? Oh, mm. why do you get rehired? He, this is, this He's is a harbinger, harbinger of death. Yeah, yeah I know. This is like get him out of here. Hey, what's the guest of honor? Uh, Robert Todd Lincoln. Oh no. Yeah, I'm not going to that party. <laughs> you back? Wait a minute. There was nothing fun about that fact at all. <laughs> <laughs> this We've is, been I, duped. This is just like that time I bought that bag of fun size Snickers, and they were smaller than the regular ones. <laughs> <laughs> there was That's nothing not fun, fun sized. Come on. You know what fun size is? The big one. <laughs> it's like when they told me Pac-Man 2 would be fun. <laughs> well, they're so small, though, the calories yeah. don't count. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's like mini cupcakes. Like, th those don't count as food, right? You can just eat a bunch of them. Absolutely. Mini cupcakes. Is that how you calories mean, like, work? You mean like the small version of regular cupcakes, <laughs> which is like the small version of cake? Honestly, where does it end with you people? <laughs> And then, that's, and then someone just the wants to, Kevin line. and then someone wants to offer you smaller sections of the mini cupcakes as free samples. Yeah. You're like, it's a mini cupcake. Come on, let's not be cheap. Just give me the whole damn cupcake. Yeah, I really like Antimans though. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, man? Oh my god. That wasn't Isn't even loud on my end though. But that I, scream I, I was. I cranked up his headphones. Oh wow! Oh, oh my ears! Oh my that God. wasn't even loud on our end. Yeah. Uh, someone get Chris a pillow. Uh, I give you my the headphones. Uh, and my ears are ringing like really <laughs> bad. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, <laughs> got you though. <laughs> uh, sorry if I hurt your ears, guys. I think I hurt yours more than you. We you hurt out. Yeah, right. Uh, I, <laughs> <laughs> oh I mean, I think at this point, Chris, if I was going to have a uh, hearing loss from you getting jump scares, it would have happened by now. Oh. <laughs> how are you doing, Tony, by the way? How am I doing? Yeah, how are you doing? How how, how things been since uh, the Donkey Kong stuff from last year? Oh, things have been things have been good, actually. I don't even know if I introduced myself when I got onto the uh, stream. I'm actually I'm a, I'm a friend of Ben's. Uh, we worked on the uh, on the radio in the past. Um, yeah, since last year, I've been doing corporate communications, which is <laughs> actually something I've enjoyed more, uh, more than you might think from that, like, stodgy sounding. Yeah, I mean, it sounds <laughs> exciting. <laughs> title. Yeah. I mean, but yeah, no, that's what's been uh, going on in my life. How, how are y'all? Oh, you know, playing Pac-Man. It's 2020. Living the dream. <laughs> it's just yeah, right. 2020. Playing Pac-Man for actual Dream, <laughs> nightmare, whatever. That is totally... Cool. It's been kind of a nice thing about this shared, awful experience we're all having, is that anytime I talk to somebody, it's it's like such an easy answer. Be like, oh, yeah, you know, it's, it's an immediate... Feel like it, it makes you immediately relatable in the conversation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You yep. know. Well, Tony, as way I'll explain it, my grades in right now, I, I my grades range from an A to an F, but I'm only in two classes, so. 
I have to ask, been. like, what for anyone in the chat right now, or you guys specifically, if you guys are still in classes, I mean, what has the environment been like in a yeah. COVID world? Because you know, I I, I stopped. I graduated from high school in 2005, and the last time I was in any sort of facility or faculty was in 2011. So I, I have no idea what the climate is like in this in this world like uh, how are you guys adjusting it's interesting because like i've kind of become bitter with like just people in college because like, i don't really do the whole like college culture thing you're right so you know like i don't like doing the partying or anything like that so it's like kind of been nice where i like don't feel like i'm being lame because like everyone asks me lame now but like i don't know it's just like there's just a general sense of like do it's like Oh yeah, we're all doing this work, but there's gonna be no jobs on the way out because of the COVID world. Yeah, I mean, if it wasn't obvious before, because I mean that you kind of get that feeling even before, like in a pre-COVID world, is like you know, this, the jobs probably the job market's probably gonna be absolute ass. There's gonna be too much competition. We, we, we figure, do I even bother at this point, or do I pursue something That's else? That's gonna happen with the concert industry. And the, yeah, uh, the, uh, but now it's kind of like it's like in your face. It's like, cool, I'm going to get this degree, or at least I'm going to get this diploma that I've been working my ass off. But it's also like, what the hell am I going to do with it after it's done? Because the pandemic's still <laughs> happening. You know, and it's like, not, not, these places aren't hiring, or they're very limited in capacity, or it's just more of the same shit that I'm doing now. <laughs> yeah, it really stinks. I've got a buddy who has a, uh, a degree in, I believe it's engineering and management, and he's been looking for like a year. Um, it was a rough market before the pandemic, and it's only it's only gotten sketchier since, unfortunately. JTP man, so it's way easier to cheat. Yeah, JTP. you know what? Because cheat to win. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't. I, I. I don't see how the hell they would monitor you not using a phone to like look up answers or to like. You get your uh, Apple well, Watch now, man. Yeah. Too, where, like, a lot of your watch. Are open book. But I've heard like horror stories from other schools where like your professors like, okay, buy a 360 cam put, and put it like, on your lap and have like a webcam pointed at you and behind you. And I, I wish I was exaggerating, but like, that, that's what I've heard. That's, that's kind of gross. That's super that's invasive. A, that's a lot of work to get a job at Starbucks after college. <laughs> <laughs> I think in some cases, it's necessary to have a little bit more set up. Like, my sister's a professor. Um, uh, she teaches French horn at a university. Um, and so you have to have a, a fairly decent setup to do music lessons of course. for a webcam. Uh, so there are specific things where you, you kind of need, you know, like you have to buy a better microphone, you have to buy, you know, certain things. Uh, but for just a general class, it's kind of ridiculous to ask students to like, oh my God, get goodness. 17 cameras. We I need can't a imagine how view yeah. of your room. I can't imagine how difficult it is right now to get um to teach like drum lessons online because of how harsh drums are to a microphone yeah hold on uh chris frats in the chat is saying uh, basically they have uh, synch uh synchronous like synchronous, synchronous online classes and asynchronous thank you online classes synchronous is when we all meet at a specific time like a regular class asynchronous is the one they just give us a video lecture that we watch and then we do the work that goes along with the video you know that reminds me of uh when i'm doing this sponsorship for, uh, this uh, no, no, uh, it reminds me of, um, so I, the, one of these, uh, one of the, uh, software, or not software, but one of the, uh, applications that I've been promoting over the last couple of months is Skillshare, and, uh, Skillshare is basically, yeah. they, they're just video lectures that you just watch, and you, they, they, they give you, like, assignments to do at your leisure, but it, it's basically that, uh, yeah. so it, it, that, that sounds like what school is now everywhere. Well, Imagine I mean, paying you, thousands you can... of dollars for college, and that's what you get. Yeah, I was gonna like, say you could just go to Skillshare and save a ton of money. Yeah, yeah, I know, and it's like that is the thing that I know this is like an entirely different conversation, but this is the, that's the thing that ultimately pisses me off so much about pursuing a college education uh, is that the stuff I've learned I could have easily learned online. That is, like, granted, I don't. You don't get the hands-on yeah. experience, which I feel is does have a, 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 a does have merit to it. I'm not going to deny that, but so, it's not twenty thousand dollars worth. It's yeah, not exactly. Thirty thousand dollars worth. Hundred percent agree. Yeah, uh, like the the, 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 the skill stuff again. Eventually, I think it's like like ten bucks a month for some other shit. It's like that is infinitely more for like yeah. It's like, like college, especially in America, is a huge fucking scam. Like it is just. A, it, a really big scam. It used to be 
a necessary thing because you had to think about all right not everybody has access to uh teaching institutions learning institutions mm -hmm. large libraries you know the, the so it made sense like okay I, I am unable to get a college level education in where i live so i have to go and get it and that made sense now it's not you you, mm -hmm. you don't need that i mean half the time jobs will teach you what you need to learn while you're doing it you know it, it's just it's not just necessary anymore not in this way that it used to be well you know yeah. an education can give you the ability to read and i'll do that too. Yeah. <laughs> good segue, go. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> but, but, segue. a quick clarification on that one so yeah when you hit the donate button on the extra life page one of the first things that'll probably immediately pop up is the ten thousand dollars <laughs> like that it, that we thought when we put that in, that was just informing you guys that if we managed to hit our goal of 10K, uh, we will close the event off with a local player obsession with Pac Man Fever, you know, based off of the, the game's, of the event's namesake. However, uh, well, what actually. Uh, no, because it wouldn't, let, it wouldn't let me put. My, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't let me put a milestone, though. That's the thing. Go like, mile, uh, it wouldn't it, let me put a milestone for that. Uh, so I put incentive down. The thing is that they didn't really clear was clear on or maybe i just misinterpreted it was that incentive also made it a separate donate button so someone could if they had the funds click on that incentive button and donate ten thousand dollars directly to the stream and that gives you a link to johnny's only fate only fans yeah, only fans yeah, yeah. <laughs> only uh, only fan uh singular <laughs> yeah it's only the one person that that clicks it hey y'all one of you old sonic three cd and oh, knuckles and knuckles, knuckles, and knuckles. Turned 10 oh, back in August. It's Wait, what? Wait, hold on a second. Let me read that again. Sonic 3 CD and Knuckles and Knuckles turned 10 back, 10 back in. Oh my god, that is 10 years old. Yeah. Oh, the thing you did? Yeah, the, the, the animation that I, uh, right. Ryan and I uh, uh, wrote. That was 10 years ago? <laughs> wow. Oh my that god. That animation is now in uh, elementary school yeah uh, you know, oh well, i hope not no i hope it's back at home because i don't want to get covid so yeah, that's true. Uh, <laughs> no it's at school just nobody else is there uh all right so i found it uh was there a particular way you wanted me to read this or you just wanted me to cite it i left I, right I, left <laughs> backwards bitch <laughs> preferably left to right you know i'll, I'll, I'll read it as barney gumble <laughs> All right, sure. Uh. <clears throat> uh, welcome to Astaria, gentlemen. I will not lie. The chances of your survival are small. Some may even turn against your friends as living corpses. But you have my word that I will use my arcane gifts to ensure your bodies are given into Moore's garden. This is the greatest reward, more than even gold, for the fate of your soul is an internal concern. Now come, follow me. Strike down the undead that rise against us. Allow me to find this Eldridge amulet. I will not ask for my own selfish studies, but for the good of the Empire. I I, I lost that like halfway through, and I was like, yes. <laughs> oh my god. That was beautiful. I was moving. <laughs> it's I won't cry for I'm you. Done. You're already dead. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's not good. Which Pac-Man character is best in bed, and why is it Blinky? Well... Uh, I would say, uh... You know what? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna... I, I think, yeah, um... Mm, I'm thinking about this vividly. <laughs> vividly, I, mean, I like there, it. Yeah, vividly. There, uh, there are only a few characters in this game that constantly found balls, so my answer would probably be one of them. You know what? I would say Pinky because you, you tend to bang your pinky toe on every piece of furniture in the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So when you bang your right? pinky, you don't like it. Well, some people might. Well, yeah, I, that's a weird don't kink. kink shame. That is a, that's a weird kink. Yeah, I, can you imagine like the person who like bangs their pinky into something and just goes, Oh yes! Oh, oh, yes. Right. oh my god, stop my little pinky. Stop oh, my little yes. pinky. Oh, who's your little pinky? Oh. Who's your little piggy? Oh. I mean no no one thinks Clyde is like oh, The song This Little Piggy that? Went to Market, that's all sexualizing. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. 
I don't this know is... where we're going. They <laughs> stub, <laughs> they come. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, you're going to make me stub. Oh, <laughs> God. Oh, my God. Pop a oh, stub. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pop a stub. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm wearing sandals. I'm rocking a quarter stub. Oh, my God. I I'm wearing flip flops. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. I'm like low key ashamed of how good I am at this game because, like. Oh, yeah, you're. you're. That's why, like, I, I wasn't why, joking. Like, you're, why, I'm not. Why ashamed? It, you know, yeah. it's like, I, it's just funny seeing all the games I struggled through over the years of doing these streams. Oh, yeah, this random Miss Pac Man game? It kicks ass. It just ever. means you played this game, you didn't yeah, play those that's games. All. That, that's all. I, know. Yeah. I don't just... care what the subject matter is. If I was ashamed of all the games that I was good at, I'd be ashamed of like two games. It's two more games than me, so you're doing fine. <laughs> I think my right. mic, I think my mic's uh, microphone level automatically just to get a little higher. I don't know why it does that. Yeah, especially if you got a really bad mic with that, it is the worst. Like you might as well be making a YouTube video in 2006. Yeah. Like it's, it's so I'm not gonna lie, when I'm <laughs> when I'm playing games, uh, like uh, multiplayer games online, sometimes I actually will crank up all my levels yeah just to make it sound obnoxious when i'm playing with friends oh my God. <laughs> destroy dick you. december is every month for some of us no you can't because december is only one december just just january just just january <laughs> sorry <laughs> that, like, the i was like i'm not familiar with that game <laughs> the first thing i saw in the chat whoa Look, did you see my dissipated? tactic good oh, start wild. No uh, Nightcap says we should stop with the masturbation jokes. That means more masturbation jokes. Right. Uh, shout out to Fuck Furiously uh, February. The thing uh, you need to understand about <laughs> masturbation jokes is they can't be beat. Uh, shout out to <laughs> Just Jacket July. Absolute abstinence April. <laughs> That's just like absolute abstinence April. Or anal April. Will yeah. come October? <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? Oh, no, no, no. I don't think Paul McCartney approves of that. <laughs> you mean Paul jokes McCartney. keep on coming. <laughs> Jawbreaker June. <laughs> and the jokes keep coming. And they don't keep stop coming. coming and and they don't stop coming. coming and they don't stop coming. And they don't stop coming. You should probably see a doctor if your erection lasts more than four hours. Uh, meat mash or March. <laughs> I like that, Cam McCrock. Thank you. Whoa. Uh, good God! If I have Nor one last like, four normally. hours. I'm going to enjoy it. <laughs> if you the have an erection, is last more than four hours. Nice. Oh, a friend. The blood's not circulating though. That's a problem. <laughs> that's, a thing. that's a that's a big problem. <laughs> uh, Fifty dollars from Christopher I mean, Wiley. It can be uh, a big problem. Waka waka for <laughs> eventually it'll fall off. For us. Us. <laughs> Stay strong, guys. <laughs> an average size. I don't know what the hell happy dirt Come on, noises are. your powder on the fuse. Thank yeah. you. Do that. Five dollars from Lucius. Hey John, I've been a long time fan, but never been able to donate until now. Love the work you guys do in Brain Scratch and SGB. Here's five dollars for the calls. Thank you very much, Lucius. This makes also, what the hell is happy dirt noises? Uh, what you, it? Don't, happy, you don't know what those are? Happy jerk noises? Ha no, happy dirt, dirt noises. Dirt oh my God. noises. Yeah. Happy jerk is that a reference like... to something? I'm I'm lost. I, I don't know. Oh okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I, was, I was just trying to be an asshole. Oh okay, okay. You know, yeah. I thought you said happy dirt, dirt anime, noises, yeah. and I'm like, that's very relative to what we're talking about here. Well happy dirt noises would just be like if you're at a park and you just like yeah. But, mm, that's really nice dirt there. <laughs> it's like a motorboat dirt. Yeah, motorboat. That's what I. Yeah. Mean. I I'm yeah. Glad you guys knew what I was. I, I guess about. that's what it is. Oh, I didn't know. He was it's like the noise uh, that's made, like when your dog is like sniffing into some like loose soil, like oh, oh, like, oh, <laughs> like that. Like that. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> What kind of dogs are you listening to? What kind of dogs are you listening to? What is that, like the beginning of the immigrant song? <laughs> <laughs> this dirt sounds happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's bad. Come from the land of the dirt. I come from the dirt of the ice and snow. <laughs> oh, I love life. Come. Come put your nose in the dirt and smell. Da -da. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, Fapping on the Where floor. is my goddamn soup? Super Tuesday. I think I'll take the soup. No offense, Tuesday. <sighs> What's your favorite kind of soup? Baked potato. Even though the one I made today apparently sucks. 
Oh, I don't know why it's so bad this time. It just is. Oh. Chicken noodle, baby. Yeah, chicken I'm noodle fine. soup is broccoli cheddar is also great. Turkey uh, chili and chicken milky. That's good too. What? Oh, that's oh, good. Chicken. What was that? And cinnamon toast here. crunch. Chicken and yaki. Oh that's my god, yeah. That's what is? What? No, hold on. What is that? I'm, I'm legitimately it's, curious. Um, they're like little. Delicious it's potato, uh, pasta. potato pasta. It's potato They're like pasta little fluffy like, potato yeah. goodness. Yeah, and Alfredo cheese, and it's great. Oh my god! I so don't good. think that's an accurate description of gnocchi. Uh, gnocchi? Gnocchi is like little like dough dumpling things with yeah, chicken. The, it's not potato. It's, it's, no, they're, they're yes, potato. It's potato. It's, 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 I mean, you're yeah. Italian. Yes. So I guess I shouldn't be yeah, arguing. It is, it is potato, but yeah. I've made uh, it before, so I yeah. hope I would know. But sometimes they are made with chicken, but they're not chicken dumplings. They're just flavored No, no, not about the dumpling. I'm talking about the, the little Yeah, yeah, the, the, yeah. yeah. The potato, but. Gnocchi, gnocchi is made with potato yeah. and flour. And cinnamon toast crunch. And cinnamon toast crunch. Yeah, you can throw that in there. Cinnamon toast crunch and gnocchi? <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's a weird breakfast over at the Woodring house. I mean, cinnamon toast crunch probably makes everything better, right? Uh, I haven't had it in years, so I can't here. legitimately say that. I don't know. Probably, probably I, not scrambled eggs and orange. You don't like cinnamon toast through. crunch. Our relationship's in shambles. I just went through two boxes really petty. of no cinnamon toast wondering. crunch in the past week. Mm, um, did you know they have like a, a, a seasoning now? You can actually buy cinnamon toast, like yes. the seasoning. Oh, no. Actually. I I thought you were going <laughs> to. The cinnamon toast was already a seasoning, though. So what the hell is it? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I guess you could just like yeah. crush them up. But yeah, yeah they've got exactly. like this, this sprinkle. You can, uh, you can put it on your yeah. own toast. Well, I was uh, that. Um, uh, blueberry toast crunch is like the best variation. I've never even. I never heard of it. It's French it toast thing. crunch with blueberry seasoning. We were eating it's, it during it's... Mario Mania. It, yeah, is it a, is right. it a different French toast crunch or is it just that? It's, it's French, French toast, toast crunch, crunch, but it has like blueberry speckles on it. It's so good. Okay. I don't think because I was at the market today and they had. Uh, sugar cookie toast crunch, I think it was. It's like a Christmas variation. Like, <laughs> okay, let's be real. They kind of the... they kind of lost their creativity skills with cereal. It's like, oh, uh, donut cereal, uh, not a butter cereal. No, uh, uh, wait, a pop tart cereal. Wait, I think I think what Greg is talking about. It's not sugar cookie toast crunch. I, 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 I think it's about. cookie. It's, it's sugar cookie flavor. I'm just saying it's. Uh, yeah. But um, maybe maybe that's what it is. I, I'm trying to think. I saw it today, and I'm like, uh, what? Ooh, eggnog toast crunch. Just saw that <laughs> pop up in the chat. I, I'm, I'm all not, for that. that sounds actually. really good. I'm not even joking. That sounds yeah, so I'm on that. Uh, I'm not, well, how I'm not about, an eggnog person. How, how about gingerbread I cookie crisp? That's not a bad idea. I haven't done that yet. Yeah, uh, Shiro Luna in the YouTube chat is saying the Pop Tart cereal is actually not bad. Yeah. I wouldn't. I. I got. I. I've, I've long since gave up on uh, overly sugary cereals or what I classify as overly sugary. I, I kind of have. I had that problem. I mean, like it's 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 certain cereals that I can go through spells of eating, but otherwise, sometimes I can't get through a whole bowl of it. And I sit there and I'm like, man, when I was a kid, I could eat like a whole box of this in one yeah. setting, and now and I can't something. even get through a whole yeah. bowl yeah. of it. Well, like my, 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 cer my cereal diet is mini wheats, honey nut Cheerios, and maybe Cocoa Pebbles when I'm feeling risky. <laughs> Honey Nut Cheerios is a solid one. I, I, I despise regular Cheerios. I'm a... Uh, no, regular Cheerios are boring. Regular, regular Cheerios are regular too regular mundane. Cheerios. It's Heart the same issue I have with Corn Flakes. Sugar in it. Now, now you've, got, you've got Honey Nut Cheerios and then you've got Donut Seeds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That um, is what they are. I'm more into Golden Grams and Wheat Wheaties. Donut Seeds. Wheat Thins. Oh, Clark, there are Wheat Thins in the cabinet for you. Oh, I was wondering. Yeah, I was yeah, I'll probably. I'll probably take them. Oh, God. Bit you can eat rice so checks when they're them. soggy? How the hell? No, oh, rice thank you. It, bro, soggy rice checks are lit. What? God, no. It's disgusting. Uh huh. Lit. That's good stuff. I, I talk like the young people when I hear things I like. Talk about how it's lit. No cap. Yeah. I need to let breakfast cereal back into my life. I'm one of those degenerates that just doesn't eat breakfast. It is like I, the I usually slam a coffee in the morning. 
I, I, I always think I'm going to have breakfast, and then I have the coffee, and I'm like, well, breakfast? What was I thinking? Yeah, on my way to work, <laughs> I, you know, pick your legal stimulants and uh, uh, yeah, get on with your day. Uh, I'm not 12 the, anymore. What the hell? That's not uh, we, oh, my God. <laughs> We have a $500 donation from Todd Howard. Sound <laughs> good to me. Oh, don't bring that meme back. Oh. So happy. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> if it means donating money to Kim, so Todd Howard can come here anytime he wants. So happy that the stream is able to go on virtually this year. It's your it's your friend, Todd Tower, just checking in to see if you're finally awake. You're trying to cross the border, right? Also, you're a guy going to do a stream for the 10-year anniversary of the Elder Scrolls V on the PS5. I, I don't know. Can we do an entire 24 hour stream on just Elder Scrolls Skyrim? I think it's possible, right? Totally possible. Yeah. Before I part, I'd like to ask a creative question. What title of a SpongeBob episode would you like to describe how you feel right now? Thank you again for everything you. Uh, I, definitely SB129. <laughs> That's very specific, man. That was quick. Yeah, that was really quick. That was very. Just very because quick. it's such a, a um, you know, generic episode name. But you just you just have this ready. Actually, like no, you, I, will you, um, I will describe my... He's been waiting all his life to say <laughs> ...thing as lot. pressure because I'm playing the peer pressure stage in the game. I'm just going to type uh, in the Spongebob episode in Google and see what pops up. My, my episode that describes me apparently is... Uh, looks like we went down. Leaf blower. Or reef blowers. Two episodes that come to mind to describe how I'm feeling right now is procrastination and help one. <laughs> <laughs> there's, uh, to be like a, a complete, I open with you guys, there's always a fear that, um, because I'm, I'm, I'm involved in multiple charity events throughout the year, there's always a fear of like uh, diminishing returns. You know, because we do the we do the week long thing, a uh, week and a half long thing for the charity room. And I love always doing that because that's always just a great time. But then there's also this what I do with you guys. Uh, 24 hours straight and that's, and that's only one day one. as opposed yeah that's only one day as opposed to a whole week which you know makes it easier to set up in some regards but also like a little more stressful because you have to make sure everything is working mm -hmm. uh and if things go foobar that's it that's the entire day ruined yeah. but you guys still managed to come together like and just manage to raise as much money in a short amount of time like together with like combined to our totals with like fund the charity room and the extra life stuff and i know we're like it has to be over a hundred thousand dollars at this point yeah uh, that you guys managed to like pull together, and it, it, they're, they're very similar circles, which is why I find it even more amazing because you guys just find the means to like donate for a good cause, or at least tell your friends or family or uh, your, your, anyone on social media about these events, and it really does make a difference. And we can't thank you guys enough for that. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, I also like you know, I know we're still we're not even halfway done the event yet. We're we're about an hour and a half away from the halfway point, but uh, I really do have to give it out to Ben for going out and going above and beyond for getting this event out in, in a, for a more a general audience attention because uh our interview uh for uh, with uh 95 7 ben fm uh went live this morning at around nine o'clock uh do we have a link for that that we can put uh, uh i mean do that doesn't really matter you guys are already you. here i sent it to the discord last night and like because yeah it like at 10 uh no but but Ben managed to plug it in two different radio stations. Uh, one, one for WMMR, which he interned in, so you know, that, that's kind of a given. He's got and, a vision. Yeah, no, and 95.7 Ben FM here in Philadelphia. And, you know, that's amazing. That's great. That's getting a word out to an, that's getting a word out to an audience that's uh, kind of unfamiliar with what we do. It's out of the, the circle. Yeah, that's all. Yeah, exactly. It's completely out of the circle. Not, not even just like this, but like dreaming. Oh, I forgot that. Yeah, I got the YouTube side of things and Twitter, but Ben's got the radio stuff. Mm -hmm. And though radio might be a little antiquated for some of the younger side of the audience, it's still an effective means of getting the word out there. Especially for other people that... Do you just... think Todd Howard was a radio head? <laughs> uh, and also just like, I'm to a... defend my medium, I trust me, I understand if you live somewhere else for like all you have are iHeart stations that are just generic as all hell. Yeah. But we are blessed here in Philly to have some, like, really, like, amazing radio stations. Well, those radio stations are what broke a lot of the classic rock artists of our gener uh, last generation, so. Philly what do you broke mean? A lot of, uh, Philly broke a lot of classic rock artists. Well, yeah, MMR literally saved yeah. Bruce Springsteen. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and Billy Joel. And Billy Joel, uh, had he not performed Captain Jack at Sigma Sound, he wouldn't have broke either. And then you have, uh, um... 
I think. Okay, so you mean like break in? Okay, like oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, yeah, so I, 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 I misconstrued that, that as in no, the they destroyed yeah. these artists. No, no, no. They, uh, broke the car they broke the they broke many artists because oh, break, okay, okay. Means that they broke in, they broke, they broke yeah. into. Okay, I misinterpreted. M yeah. MMR specifically too was the station that first really started playing Pearl Jam's yeah. holiday single "Last Kiss" and made it a huge radio hit, and it ended up becoming a phenomenally popular song for Pearl Jam despite the fact that it was just this like little one-off holiday thing they did and didn't really think anything of it. Initially it wasn't released to the general public and it ended up becoming huge for the band and it was it because of Philly. Make someone think Pearl Jam is good. <laughs> oh I'm God. only kidding. Wow. You, know, I, I, you know, I'm glad I brought Pearl Jam up and I didn't say anything about fish. <laughs> 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 my, my fragile heart wouldn't have been able to take that one. Fish, wow, you mentioned the band and I'm already feeling high. <laughs> <laughs> That's, uh, I, I always think like certain bands that are really like Grateful Dead, like everybody's like, oh, Grateful Dead, man, got to tour with the dead. And I'm sitting there like, yeah, you kind of have to be high to listen to that, right? Like, that's, yeah. I, I do like, I, I, like I, I would say, with... I would never put it on on my own, you know? I, I would I would actually make the the bigger argument that I think to uh, really appreciate a jam band I mean not only do you have to be you have to really be into free form music you got to kind of dig jazz and, and and understand jazz to a degree too and and a lot of people don't really vibe on jazz especially that kind of jazz so jam well, bands of, just turn people off and what I've also discovered in my time in college radio is that people hate instrumentals I don't understand why. Yeah, I don't get that. Because, like, we, I had a host that uh, Mason and I really, really love. Actually, with big air quotes, because she despises human being. But she was playing a song one time during her program, and it went to, like, an instrumental break, and she just skipped the song. Like, nah, instrumental. It's dumb. It's boring. They're not singing. I'm like, uh, wow, that's not for you to decide. Uh, that is totally not your call. <laughs> there, there have been times when a song I didn't want to hear accidentally came on because I wasn't paying attention. I was like, I'm just going to let it ride out. Did. It, it, it's yeah. just, it amazes me that people just like are like, eh, instrumental boring. I'm like, look, I will not deny there's talent in singing, but like we had a discussion about this a year ago on social media, me, Clark, and a couple of his music friends, is that we kind of came to the conclusion that great instrumental can make up for bad singing, but like, yeah, you can, it doesn't agree. work the other way around. Yeah, yeah. because you need the emotion behind the instrumentation for the lyrics to pop. The lyrics will not pop unless the instrumentation yeah. underneath. Good, yeah. Uh, and uh, I, good I vocals think, cannot oh, say bad instrumentation. Yeah, absolutely. I, I a lot of even bad realize. vocals, as long as the, the the character and the emotion is there, can be saved. It's all about the yeah. instrumentation. That's a lot of what what what's behind fish. You know, the vocals aren't really there for you to to yeah. to think tell a story because they usually don't. It's it's there to kind of drive the music they're playing, and that's why so many of their lyrics. And that's a that's actually really similar to what the Talking Heads did on Speaking in Tongues, was this notion of uh, driving the music with nonsensical lyrics, with the lyrics just following the rhythm of the music and not really having a deeper meaning or purpose. Well, that's the whole thing with um, with Loser by Beck. Oh, I'm a loser, that's baby. I'll get that fingerprint. I'm sorry, guys. And they said that uh, I think he I think he actually said in an interview that because everybody's like oh it's got deep meaning like it's so it's so profound and I think he actually admitted at one point that it, the lyrics were written uh, they it, it basically you write the lyrics to to meter out the song or something yeah yeah and they send it to the person that makes the the music so that they can make the music go with it and when they did. They just were like, oh, this is actually kind of funny with the lyrics like this. So it, it, it's not gibberish that actually has a deep meaning. It was literally written as gibberish, but it goes with the music, so it sounds great. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. That's exactly it. I mean, look at September by Earth, Wind, and Fire. They literally made it the word body ya and it's like one of the most iconic songs of the 70s. A lot of songs, I did, like you know, you get the kind of music that the, it's just like a, 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 a gibberish sort of sound that people make, and it's like, oh, it's good, it's it's great, we're all together because we sing this thing, we sing the same lyric, and it's like, okay, it, it doesn't mean anything, right? You know that, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's fine, you, you can like it. It's just, 
I don't want you to act like it's super profound, then it's not. Exactly. The old school video game king gave five dollars. Hey Johnny, been a fan since you had around two thousand subs. Especially love your Mega Man and Zelda reviews. But I must say, I think I may have to unsub after finding out your lack of cinnamon toast crunch in your life. Man, you gotta get checked out. Oh, People gotta draw a line somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. You gotta important. draw a line in the cinnamon somewhere. <laughs> really, really. Uh, Captain Gohai gave a dollar. Continuing on our talk about presidential assassinations. Oh boy! What? Did you know that the government put the brain of Garfield's assassination? In Charles J. Uh, Gerto in a what? jar to see how crazy he is. I'm guessing shooting the president wasn't enough. Oh, what that's the beautiful. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Someone's playing that. That was that was. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot I have access to my buttons. That was the funnest fact I've ever heard. Here's my question: Is what is a goal you have for future events in terms of raising the quality? Also, out. Who wants this? This way. Are yeah. you implying no, that, our events fine. aren't perfect? I think. I was just saying. I feel like that was a that was a uh, sly dig at him. Uh, it sounds like it's pretty perfect to me. Well, I mean, the thing that we could definitely work on is, you know, the fucking computer just straight up crashing. <laughs> I, mean, that's I would say that is. Yeah, uh, we'll make sure that happens more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, <laughs> like, like, more crash. Horizon system. Yeah, more at, more like, crash. Oh, please. Looks like we have a confirmed marathon next year. It's a uh, crash, right? <laughs> <laughs> good shit. Good shit. You should probably read that one. Uh, yeah. Well, Find let me it. let me see what the comment says. Uh, can you perform this multiple personality? Oh, shit. You want me to perform an entire skit from Whose Line Is It Anyway using yeah, your E one two three Omega voice for the guy's cat your Marvel? Okay, okay, I'm gonna draw a line. No. <laughs> I mean, you need the music. Uh, I do have the Whose Line music. I got stand. Well, no, no thing. But they want me to perform the entire skit with three That's different cool. voices. I'm just saying, come on, guys. Oh, was it an Irish <laughs> song or is it? A, I'm gonna. I I. A oh, we should do a hold on uh, if we want. Sure. Not yeah. remotely. In person, we could not remotely. Discord will destroy them. <laughs> like I will gr uh, like I'm more than happy to put on performers, but you gotta give me more than a dollar. <laughs> like, I'm gonna be that guy because <laughs> so yeah, that's, that, yeah, the only thing you can the only thing you can do with a dollar is make a collect phone call for about twenty minutes. Yeah. <laughs> also, stop making a collect oh, call, man. and you can get a seventy-five <laughs> cent hamburger at, at uh, McDonald's. Heisman 64 gave a hundred dollars. Well, doing the transitions, Chris. Um, ooh, man, I I've been practicing my whole life. I probably should be donating this. Shouldn't I'm assuming be donating this much since I got laid off. Oh, I'm so sorry, but screw it. I've saved enough money uh, to give to a good cause. That's so great. Thank you so much. I'm sorry you got laid off. Yeah, cool. That gets better for you. Okay. I, I, I just feel really bad. <laughs> uh, Sandbox 10 gave five dollars. This donation goes out to Ray Xander since he's broke. <laughs> and uh, Chris, Chris Fretz uh, also gave five dollars. Here's five dollars for Ray Xander's prime son. <laughs> Challenge change. It's like, yeah, hey, someone is joined in. Introduce yourself, please. Or not. It's <laughs> nobody. <laughs> it's a random Discord. Joke. Give me a minute. I just unmuted. This is Kelly from Florida. <laughs> hey, Kelly. Hey, Kelly. Nice Hi, welcome. everyone. Hello. It's also, you got some fans at the PJ Campbell Network who were happy to see you before you were announced. <laughs> that was kind of making me uncomfortable. Because like, before we even played the promo video, people in the chat were like, yeah, Kelly from Florida. I'm like, how the hell do you, like, where is that coming from? Hey. Kelly from Florida You're sounds amazing, like though. the best person. Oh, she's <laughs> no, no, I, I like I, to think I, I'm pretty nice. Yeah, when I, when, when I played the uh, the promo video, the, the, the me was Kelly from Florida was in the video. And but Clark, was, they were saying that before that part of the video played. That's why I, I, I will be that. honest. I, I was not in the writer's room for that one. Uh, oh, boy. <laughs> oh, wait, there's an actual $25 made from Ray. <laughs> Very special request for Johnny. Would you kindly reenact the entirety of the Navy Seal copy pasta in your current <laughs> drive? You can come up with some Thank you very Jesus much. Christ. I wish the very best one. Woo. <laughs> hey, 
Do you, John, I love what, this. Well, you read the, the entire the, script they're bidding for the pacifier? For, uh, yeah, I have uh, here the last copy of War and Peace. Would you reenact Fuck. this entire thing as battle I hold up. Just the first 800 pages. Just the first 800 pages. John, I'm not you, did you, did you say the whole I'm just saying, I don't mind doing, I don't mind doing impressions. I don't mind doing reenactments, but be reasonable. That's all I can ask you. Like, be reasonable. Don't ask me to read a fucking book. Just read the entire <laughs> script of the pacifier with Vin Diesel. I'm not asking that much of you. Please. He's probably not that much dialogue. He's anyway. a Navy SEAL, so like it counts. What? <laughs> um, yeah, low key, I, I kind of like that movie. Oh, I, <laughs> When it's on TV, it's I always have to watch point. it. Yeah, it's one of those movies. When he it's gives, dumb. When he gives <laughs> Brad Garrett the titty twister, it's hard not to laugh. Or no, it's the other way around, actually. Well, maybe you can do this impression. The old school video game king gave $10. Johnny, do an impression for me. I need you to combine Sean Connery and Macho Man Randy Savage. No <laughs> That's like you can, two fucking different You can do whatever things. you want. <laughs> Sean Connery Savage? and Macho Man Randy Sa That's like two radically different voices, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. Could you combine uh, uh, white uh, noise you... for me <laughs> and David Attenborough? Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Could you combine Barack Obama and, and Tina Turner? Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> I mean, uh, God. I think you can combine them. Oh, yeah. I'm the cream of the crop. There's no better just... Sky, what the fuck is he? <laughs> well, he's dead now. Dude, you, you sound like Richard there. Nixon. Yeah, I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? All right, it's canon now. Richard Nixon is just John Connery and Macho Man Fuse. Uh, hold on, let me look at a meal thing, because I think I know what he's referring to, and it's not that terribly long, so... Wow. Oh, yeah, it is this. I know what this is. Okay, so my Kermit the Frog boy? Uh, fuck. My Kermit's not very good, though. No, what the fuck did you just fucking say about me, you little bitch? I'll have you know that I graduated at the top of my class in the Navy SEALs and I've been involved in numerous secret raids on Al-Qaeda, and I have over 300 confirmed kills. I'm a trained guerrilla. I'm trained in guerrilla. I did not have and I'm the top sniper in thing. the entire armed U.S. forces. You are nothing to me but just another target. I will... I, I almost really got into my stud for us for a second. <laughs> uh, God, no, I can't do this. My Kermit is terrible. I can't do it with Kermit. I thought that was great. 10 out of 10. Johnny, you tried it. It's intimidating. That kind of matters. No, I can't. Uh, my Kermit my, my turned cool. Yeah, I know. Uh, we had uh, Ted read this out in his toad voice a couple of years ago. And can you, I want you to imagine, if you haven't heard it already, imagine someone saying this entire thing in that screechy ass shrill. <laughs> right up there with Gilbert Godfrey. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Just the awkward amount of yelling. Uh, oh. to Tara, paid $5. Hey Johnny, going back on game music, I had a similar encounter of that with my mom saying game music wasn't real music, but one day she heard me listening to number one from Sonic R and was surprised that I actually caught her singing the song the next day. Ah, caught you. <laughs> Hi, you dumb bitch. You bitch. <laughs> oh my God. Damn, ben. Wow, Ben. That is his <laughs> mother. Right. Jesus Christ. Oh. Uh, it's funny because he beat me to it. That's exactly <laughs> <laughs> it. Makes sense. Though. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's good. And you say it in a bit. <laughs> what does that game over mean? You got a game over in the game that gives you like 400 lives? Yeah. What's the GBA? Is the GBA version just as generous though? I don't know actually. You don't, yeah, I you don't know. You shut, your fucking, you shut your mouth. Oh my god, <laughs> that's right. You don't, fuck? you do go back to the beginning what of the, the GBA fuck? one. This is, oh, oh. Wait. <laughs> that is oh, so the <laughs> I like this final donation from Noah. Two by four. Hey, John, can you do the entire? How do you pronounce that? Is it, is it a Tchaikovsky? Yeah, eighteen twelve. Tchaikovsky, eighteen twelve overture. Oh my god! Man, these voice impressions are getting out of hand. Well, the eighteen twelve overture, especially the cannons. Yeah. Yeah. Symbols clashing against each other. <laughs> and I died. Uh, I Adolf uh, Hammer is asking, Clark does the air horn still chaotic. make you scared? Yeah. Does the air horn still frighten Clark? I don't know. Um, I 
No, see, because now that you, because if you mentioned it, then he can anticipate it. So I don't think he's going to be scared in this instance. It's only when he's turning. <laughs> what the fuck? Or when he just do that. <laughs> oh. There wasn't even an air horn there. Oh, there was. I didn't hit it. Wait. Oh my wait, god. Wait, did you? Oh, ears. you. Okay, so you you only played it on his head, so we didn't hear it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. I, I that, it. We didn't hit. There, yeah. Yeah. There was it that time. That one. Yeah, we heard that one. We heard the one before that. Oh, well, I turned his headphones up again. <laughs> oh, right. don't do that. Don't torture the man. Uh, the, the context of that is that some. Uh, do you remember who brought the air horn? Uh, that would be Gibby. Who did it the first time? No. Yeah, Gibby. It wasn't, uh, I didn't bring it. It was just at our house. Yeah. Well, yeah uh, so my emergency air horn. You know, I, I forget why, but do we have the uh, do we have the full clip of that? Jesus Christ! Don't you fucking do that again! What is that? I've heard this thing you've been up for 26 hours, Horn! You made me scream! Jesus Christ! Because, for record, for the record, I didn't scream like Clark did, but I was just as startled. I think we all were. And, and it pissed me off. <laughs> still playing <laughs> <laughs> so every once in a while we will we'll just play that isolated noise because yeah because so we, we had an air horn for that one it was played like two times i think total or three three Here's uh, the second yeah one? it was three times total and every time I think this okay is the go ahead play it quick it's not like you played the sound with him scared and he was still scared of it right that was last year yes, yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm sure Johnny's words are the best. Like, that's what makes it like is it's Clark screaming and Johnny just like swearing up a storm. Yeah. <laughs> Motherfucker! God damn it! Jesus! <laughs> Stop doing <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, you pieces of shit. Anyway, fifteen dollars. Are you guys a fan of uh, Brooklyn Nine Nine? He's a very relevant. Uh, here's a very relevant dialogue. I'd love to hear you guys read. I, I've uh, seen enough clips of the show. Okay. Since you're committing voice, uh, apparently, yes. uh, your choice if you want to do it. Oh, okay, okay. Um, oh, so there's two characters here. There's Charles Boyle and Rosa Diaz. Uh, so who wants to play the role of Rosa? How I'll do it. it in the, all right. So it's in the discussion channel. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, there we go. All right, I'll read uh, up. I'll, I'll, I'll head off. All right. I'm probably about halfway through. Uh, I need your help moving this old Miss Pac-Man machine I just bought. Why are you so obsessed with that game? Because it's the sexiest video game ever. She's insatiable, Rosa. Insatiable. Insati insatiable. It, I don't know Stop what the saying. Thing. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I don't know what the right. I never <laughs> watched this show, so I have no idea what the right thing From B -Boo, uh, uh, Elliot and Sabrina will be hopping in the chat soon. I don't. Is Sabrina okay? Oh, I'm assuming if they're good enough to join the voice call, I'm going to say yeah. Hey, and join and just pass away on stream. <laughs> oh, wow. Terrible. Uh, just a terrible. F, F in chat. When I was in elementary school, I thought passed away and passed out were the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> and that put me in a real I mean... situation one time. Where I was like, yeah, my grandpa <laughs> passed out. They're like, oh, you okay? I'm like, no, the funeral was tomorrow. They're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, th I thought it was going to be the opposite. Like, and I, like, well, I did uh, that too once. Yeah. Someone passed out on photo day one time. And I was, I went home and I was like, oh my God. What blah, blah, blah passed out or passed away during photo day. <laughs> that's, that's, oh, wow. Did Clark pass out? I could possibly pass out. You're a little like, over. Oh my god, there's a Miss Pac Man machine! If you, have to, if you have to head out to like nap, go ahead. Um, I'll put. Uh, if you want to skip Pac Man World 1 because that scene's already a little too crowded, you can. Because, like, I'd I, say I, I don't want you to be like asleep for Pac Man World 2. Yeah, I yeah. think I might just take a snooze and then come back for Pac Man World 2. That's cool. Yeah, uh, I mean, you're not grossed out by it. You can take a nap in my You are bed. not obligated to stay up for the entire 24 hours. No, it's okay. Never again. <laughs> I, I take a nap guys. forever. Do you want to sleep in my bed or do you want to sleep in. Um... I'll do the couch. It's all okay. Yeah. We'll pop a uh, cork in your mouth if you start snoring. Alright, so who had in their big It's not on Ben's only pants. 
Yeah, all that cork porn. Cork porn. Oh my god. Wait. I heard pork. I definitely heard pork porn. Oh, he beats it to pork. I heard pork porn. Well, think of him from um Toy Story. He has that cork that pops. He can do something. He also has a slot in his collar, and he also pops it, and he has a lot of money inside, so he's a prostitute. Chris has thought a lot about this. I'm I'm getting a lot of Toy Story lore that I didn't think I was gonna hear. We're doing a deep dive. Here we go. I've been I've been up since like. I think whatever, so um, I will be back. Yeah. I'm just gonna yeah. do whatever you gotta do, buddy. Yeah, yeah we'll get some rest, dude. I would say you would need at least 200, 300,000 subscribers just to make a living uh, with analytics and ad revenue being where they are now. Uh, but that's also assuming you don't have a Patreon or you don't have another source of only revenue. Fans. Yeah. Only fans. Yeah, only fans. You basically mean, yeah, I mean, whatever floats your boat, really. <laughs> Whatever gets their boot. Yeah, I mean, I would say at this point, you're better <laughs> off just, just take up art and become like a porn artist because you're porn, so artists, big. Make, you're porn so artists make a lot My of fucking bangs. Draw that titty. Get 350. I wanted to edit porn because the, the porn industry has a lot of money in it. Yeah, I wonder what that's like. Because being editor? editing porn? Being, yeah, being an editor for porn. Like. I How about that art. person that keeps the documentation of record at the end of the I was thinking of a similar joke. Yeah, I was like, yeah. that's a hard joke. I bet it's hard. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I bet they really push you. <laughs> but you know, I, I as long as you're happy in the ending. Oh man, my boss don't be on payday. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how, how was your paycheck? I got screwed. I, I got, got fucked. Really yeah. didn't, didn't pay pay I mean, like, like monetarily, I got fucked. <laughs> now, I was watching a uh, an adult video. I mean, my friend was watching an adult video. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> And you know how like, it has like that disclaimer where it's like the office of record for these stars is at like blah blah blah. One of them was in Center City on like Second Street. I really want to go and see what the place is like. I'm sure it's uh, just an office building with like filing stuff. You know, like a records building or something, but like I'm curious. Apparently there's like a porn thing in the city. Like I don't know if it's like a call center, like look, they used to have those. But there, I remember hearing like there was like a, a building there, but the but the security, they, they might as well have bars of gold in there. Uh, like it, it's yeah, it's so like a, it's like a Fort Knox, but the like yeah, it's all it, like it, it's 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 solid gold cock and balls. But it, because like it, it, it they can actually <laughs> like just tally lock whackers. Up. Gold and running tackle. <laughs> I mean, imagine what somebody could do with the with the porn. Well, here, here's the cock. I love it. Thank you, Mr. Professor. Thank you. And I, at first, I thought like, oh my god, what are they gonna, are they gonna get my get my sticky telephone buttons? Like, you know, what was it for? And then you realize there's actually a lot of money that goes through those things. A lot of credit card information that is in their system, and it's like, yeah, that's actually a lot of real money. Hey, listen, everybody talks about how they wouldn't do it. And, you know, I don't think I could do that sort of thing until they see a check roll in. They see what people are making. It's like, I think I can figure it out. Yeah, well, during my but time I... with Preston and Steve, I learned about a uh, club in the city called the Philly Jacks. And it's literally like a uh, yeah. golf club. Uh-huh. Really? Oh, okay. But is like it, how, is, up. how is Jacks? Is that, is that G-A-C-K or is that G-A-X? Uh, uh, I think yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. I and it's like, like yeah. <laughs> they're just playing a game of jacks, like the entire like. Oh, this is <laughs> not what I thought was going to be. <laughs> oh, the guy shows up fully clothed with jacks in his hand, like, oh, all right, different. Okay, never mind. My bad. And it's apparently just like a play, a building on Chestnut Street you can go to, and yeah. just like you meet up, and you spank it. Yeah. So like, but. Like together, like yeah. I'm kind of yeah, yeah, yeah. together, I've heard but too. not you can't like touch each it's other, but like other. you're in the it's same room. Not like that. It's like I, I don't know, mutual uh, shared no. experience, something. No, I, I'd pass on that. I can't do it while you're watching. Oh, yeah. Someone... Why did yeah, I even come here? I can only do it on camera. Why am I coming at all? Here's the frightening thing. You say that, right? Like I don't know. I can't so do that I with other people watching. To come, you probably literally never tried it. 
I can only do that with other people watching. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, why am I talking to you guys? <laughs> it turns the web down. Why am I talking to you guys? <laughs> Question for everyone. What's a game that you like at first, but grown to dislike it over time and vice versa? Well, that, that was for um, something that I played and then came to dislike later. Oh, wait, King's back uh, in the room. <laughs> yeah, I just I came in. There's, there's too I many guys friend. are like great I heard about the circle jerk that you get paid for, and I had to come. <laughs> yeah, because when, when I was, like, I really wanted Shadow the Hedgehog for my 10th birthday. That'll show you my age. Um, oh, God. <laughs> um, <laughs> I really wanted it, and I loved it when I was a kid. Nowadays, not, you know, not really. <laughs> So I guess that's what that qualifies. I don't like the... All right, we've been streaming this game for three months now. Right, who just joined in? I just, uh, that was Sabrina. Sabrina! How you feeling, Sabrina? How you feeling, Sabrina? Sabrina's dead! <laughs> <laughs> My throat also hurts, so I can't really speak that loud. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Rita sounds better. Uh, can you uh, speak a little more into the mic, Sabrina? Uh, <laughs> he said Sabrina. <laughs> that was oh, not that me. Was, oh, that was <laughs> Sabrina? Okay. <laughs> I can say more, but I'm stopping, a, uh, I'm stopping food in my face. That's fine. Oh, God, I miss food. I'm walking down some Pringles <laughs> right now because I have, like, really been eating. I'm at a, I'm, at, I'm past my cutoff point for, like, junk. So uh, to speak. Yeah. Um, I I mean, yeah. Does it count if you're not Saturday, going to bed? So it's the, uh, that's the thing. Like, so that's, I, I've made Saturdays my cheat day, where it's like, fuck the diet. Like, no, because I'll still eat. Like, well, like, well, you've got five minutes, so go for it. No, no, no. <laughs> but it's like, but the thing is that um, I, I I transitioned from the diet like like starting in June, but I've actually grown to like the meals. You know, so, which is like that's great because. Like even yeah. on days where I, I feel like you know I want a burger, I haven't had a burger in a while, yeah, or no, I, want a, I want a steak. I, I never had deep fried cabbage at all. <laughs> uh, Go ahead, take your word for it. I want some fried water. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I had a bowl oh, of steam God. and a potassium. That's what Kelly and I were talking about the other day. We were like, oh yeah, yeah. Uh, fried water, it's a thing. It yeah. is a thing. Apparently, yeah. what the hell is like, fried water? You do I have like that article the article I said last. Have you watched the YouTube show Defunctland? And if so, what are some of your favorite episodes? Oh, I so love good. Hang on, guys, real quick. 12 o'clock midnight. Hey, we are hey. halfway through hey. Pac Man Fever. Give you guys a pat in the back. Jesus Christ. Get yourself a pat on the back. Get yourself a pat on the back. Get yourself a pat on the back. You know what we're talking about? Pac Man Fever. If you've been here for that long, goddamn. Uh, it's, it's just fantastic. It is. It is just a good ass time sink it also I did give us a uh it also gave us the a powerful mouse named charles entertainment cheese line which is one of my favorite things i've ever heard <laughs> in the media uh actually and, uh, my chocolate uh, cheese closed my child on one really i'm surprised it's gone i think well, the one year uh, please tell me it was because their pizza was shit yeah. i like no people cheese pizza, Ch 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 cheese pizza. Like Chuck E. Cheese pizza is fire. Don't you ever speak like, that about hold, it again. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Let me tell you something real quick. We ordered from from Pisquale's Pizza, ah, which is a you free lunch for yeah. cheese. Oh, no, we didn't fall for it. We already knew it. about it. We, I wanted to try it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say my say right now. I wanted to try it. So it's like, you know what? Let's try Pisquale's. We got a regular cheese pizza and a pepperoni. As soon as that came in, yeah. <laughs> that's, one, that's one thing that happened. But this is when it actually arrived. When it arrived, the pieces were actually discombobulated. As in like you you know how you get a how do you get a pizza and you know it's 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 made in the oven, whereas like you can still pull it apart but it's still kind of attached. Yeah, yeah. Nope. Uh, five five dollars from the revenants of the Honor Institute. I recognize oh. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Uh <laughs> Heart it. it is we, the impregnable Art Institute of Philadelphia. Seeing as many things have occurred recently that prove beneficial for the country, you could say that we've assisted in saving it by the power of our votes. Part-time scam artists.
part-time saviors. By the way, now, <laughs> you sponsor Raycons, but have you considered sponsoring Talking Toilets? Just a thought from your friendly neighborhood art institute. Also, hi, Sabrina. That's the way. <laughs> That's the way. <laughs> I know who it is in here, too. You know who it is. <laughs> oh. I, thought, I thought we were past that. I thought we, I thought we were done. From saying Fox 10. Uh, impression request in Luigi voice. I may be a, uh, <laughs> I may be a white mage, but he cocks the gun. I get that image. <laughs> I know folks have been asking about what the future of uh, SGB is going to be since we, you know, originally we said at the beginning of this year in January this is going to be SGB's last year, and then the world was set on fire. <laughs> <laughs> You shouldn't have announced it. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> it's like, what was the catalyst, you son of a bitch? Uh, so folks are uh, wondering uh, throughout the years, like, oh, what exactly is happening? Are you going to delay it until 2021? And uh, what the, the thing is that uh, we are likely going to have what I, I dubbed the, uh, I don't know, farewell tour. <laughs> we made a custom. Uh -huh. Pretty much. That sounds right. Uh, and uh, we're just going to like focus on just doing games we really want to cover before we like end it all yeah. <laughs> just pull the trigger ouch before we take the channel to the backyard SG, the sgb gone i like that just, just look at the flowers just look yeah. at the flowers <laughs> 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 go through and i got some pretty big things happening at the beginning of next year that i can't dive into just yet but i will later um so, trying to expect them uh, yeah john i'm exactly i'm pregnant then <laughs> and, 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 <laughs> if you, you dive in, make sure you wear your swim trunks yeah <laughs> I will. Swim, swim, trunks. We well, we yeah. did pass nine thousand. I was just about oh, to say that. Oh my oh, goodness! No, oh, we, we're officially it's, it's over nine thousand. No, I'm mad because we just had nine thousand thirty-three dollars. I wanted to get a picture of that. Uh, <laughs> well, I mean, any number over nine thousand is technically over nine thousand. I know, but nine thousand oh, thirty-three would be cool to my radio people. Oh yeah, uh, it's technically ninety-three. Yeah. yeah. Three, yeah. I actually well, you know, big to $5 donation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh no, or we get to exactly $9,333. That's close. That, 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 that's as close as you're going to get. Well, if someone wants to donate $328, we can get that over with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then, you get, then you get two people that do it. Yeah. <laughs> that screws you up. Normally, how that goes. I'm just catching up on Pac Man Fever uh, images on, uh, on uh, Twitter. Uh, using the hashtag Pack of Fever, my favorite one so far is probably uh, this bad boy can fit so much pain and suffering for this marathon. Pac Man to the new invention. <laughs> Millennials aren't nostalgic for XP, they're nostalgic for 3D Space Cadet. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Ski Free. Never forget Ski Free. So I didn't have Ski Free. Really? Right, yeah. Through. I always thought Ski Free was an Apple thing because I never, I had never seen it. Oh no, it came, it came with our computers. Uh, I had that. I mean, and I Solitaire. Yeah. You had it with your, with your computer. Yeah, I don't know. With, with the uh, Windows, yeah. There wow. we go. I made it past the Yeti twice in one run. And I <laughs> the Yeti just terrified the <laughs> hell out of me. <laughs> well, the game I really liked was Minesweeper. Oh yes. <laughs> Nah, I didn't get very far in my sweeper. And does anybody oh, else remember playing, um... Uh, what's it called? I don't know, you tell me. Oh, sorry. Was, um... <laughs> playing <laughs> Hearts without having a clue how to play the damn game? No, I never, yes. I never, I, I never, I never touched Hearts or Free Cell. Oh, oh free I cell, love I Free love. Cell. Yeah. No, oh, I, I've, I've only touched Ooh, Solitaire. Lots of Solitaire cell. was the only card game that I played that, that came with the OS. Oh, it's funny. Cause free Cell is like a good version of Solitaire. Solitaire, it's too easy to get like a no-win game, which I don't like about it. Yeah. But the animation when you win where all the cards show up on the screen is cool. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's, that's, that's why I like doing it. <laughs> <laughs> and Spider Solitaire is also pretty fun. I no. didn't play too much of that. I, I, for the longest time, like, 
before I went on my emulator binge, which was like around the late 90s. No, no, it was early 2001. I remember exactly. No, no, it was a late 2001. I'm sorry. That's when I first went on my, on my first emulator binge. Before then, I was keen on getting the games that I used to play on my, my Power Max in middle school to my home computer, not realizing that some of them were just built for Macintosh specifically yeah. and not Windows because we had Windows at home. Did you have uh, Rube Goldberg's Incredible Machine? No, I did not have Rube Goldberg's no? Incredible Machine. Oh, no, it's no, the no. best. We had, like, we, we had, I mean, uh, Oregon Control you can get anywhere. But back then, I always thought it was something only for Macintosh. Uh, there was uh, Number Munchers and Super Munchers, which I fucking love. Yeah, yeah, carpet munchers. <laughs> don't ask about don't ask about the words that you're eating in that. One. But I I fucking excelled in those. Like I I want to say that Super Munchers was the first game I ever speed ran <laughs> because I used to clear rounds super fucking fast in those. Uh, it, it, it was so much fun. Uh, Prince no of Persia was the faster muncher. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and I would like just like as, as a throwback, I would love to do. Yeah, I should do a video on that. That's actually a prime. Or like a versus but I should do it sometime. like old old built in PC like games. elementary middle school games I used to play in my youth yeah I would love to revisit some of that stuff you played in the you know stuff you played in the computer lab where in the world is Carmen San Diego yeah <laughs> I, I played the dumbed down version though where Treasure in the United Island. States is Carmen San Diego <laughs> oh uh, <laughs> the uh the mysterious island of Dr. Quinn I think it was uh, I think that was the name of it. Oh my god, I used to love the fuck out of that game. Or the mysterious island, the Queen of Sansy Labs. Uh, I don't know what that is. He's a tech YouTuber. Dr. Quandry, yeah, there it is. Uh, Nathan knows. Uh, Dr. Well, Dr. Quandry, that, that sounds familiar to me. Actually. Yeah, um, yeah, there we go. There, Nathan, yeah, oh my god, this is why we're soulmates. Uh, <laughs> Nathan, Nathan knows exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, you would, um, you would, you, you go to this carnival. Oh, huh? You go to this carnival, uh, you play this midway game, and you, you, you play for one of the dolls that are on the stand. The dolls represent, like, different difficulties. Uh, and then you win the game, and then your soul gets transferred into the doll, and you're trapped on this island. In, or in order to get out of the island, you had to play a bunch of Quandry's minigames to, like, make a way to get out of the place. And it's like, it can get pretty fucking intense. But it was it's basically they're, they're all education games like that that's basically just that, that that's all they are but they were still fun to play edutainment edutainment yeah they're they're basically edutainment there was one that, that was like medical based and like i i always remember it because i used to have nightmares about it <laughs> like you had to like go and like shoot like cancer cells and shit and i literally would have nightmares of this game take this cancer what it is yeah, no. <laughs> <Pretty much. laughs> it was it was super creepy though like the levels were all like really dark and like veiny and like weird i don't know it, it, it's just funny because like they're, they're like you 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 memorize like some of the the, the the strangest shit from like edutainment games because sometimes they uh, especially for um uh is elliot sabrina still here uh, I'm still uh, here. Ellie went to the bathroom. Ellie went to the bathroom. Uh, uh, are you gonna Are you gonna mention it? Alaska, uh, Arizona, Arkansas. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> Blaster Pals. Uh, that was a game that Elliot used to play all the time as a kid, and the only reason why I remember it is because every time he booted the game up, it would play this theme song, and it was actually a really good theme. Uh, let me see if I can find it. So Ben can play it on the. Uh, Take the us to space. No, Certified uh, bang. I want to. I want to wait until Elliot gets back uh, before we uh, play this, because uh, I think he'll really appreciate this. He's never mentioned this to me, and I've never heard of this uh, game. Oh, so. he'll 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 know the song immediately, <laughs> and I might just uh, I might just sing along because I actually really like the song. Uh, <laughs> uh, question, uh, Uncle. The, 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 the stream deck that you have, is it the normal size one? Or the the regular one. It's the regular one. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, not the one. XL. Uh, yeah, and the not the mini. The mini. You bought the, the XL. Not okay. Oh, I want the XL. The XL is yeah. awesome. Yeah. I, mean, I have way too many button. buttons that I. Uh, have that's my, my, my issue. And there's that still there are so three many pages of Clark on the XL. Wait, you have three pages just dedicated to Clark? Yeah, I think so. No, I have. No, I do not only have two. Okay, I, okay. I, I, it would have been a third one if I would have yeah, isolated Donkey Kong. Does. Oh, I only have two. Oh. And Johnny has two pages. Cause like, we have, like, the big ones, but there's, like, lower key ones that are still hilarious, but you don't play them another. Here we go. Uh, I, 
Portugal is always going to be my favorite one. Puerto Rico. Only wobbly, wobbly, wobs. Wobbly, another wobbly, wobbling wobber. Which wobbly, wobber, wobber, wobber. I a warmly wobbling wobber wobbles to another warmly wobbling wobbler, which warmly wobbling wobber it wobbles warmlessly. Great, we just had a stroke. <laughs> if two witches watched two watches, which watched which would which watch watch. <laughs> Portugal. If you haven't already, please catch the, the catch the Mario Mania highlights. They, I I go back to that pr uh, pretty regularly throughout the year because it's that in the one of my favorite events that we ever did. Some stuff. Oh, Elliot's finally coming back. Oh, is he finally back here? Okay. Well, how about that guy that was pooping? Yeah, I know. Oh, God. Is Elliot hey, back? Hey guys, just pooping. Like, he doesn't in. have his headset on, but he's back. He wanted to play yeah, you something. Yeah, uh, play, put Elliot back on the headset. Well, no, don't like, mind. he's playing on the headset right now. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> bang, can you play that video that I posted in discussion? <laughs> we were talking about edutainment games having really good songs, and I immediately oh, okay. thought of this. Because I know you should probably know what this is. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> that was quick. Over here we got Spot. Over here we got Blast or Not. Over here's GC. Count them one, two, three. <laughs> Blaster pals. Blaster pals. Learn the name of Blaster pals. Take me where I wanna go. Show me something I don't know. Look what we can see. Blaster pals and me. Oh, Blaster pals. Fuck you. <laughs> that's a that's a little adorable. The uh, the, the the cycling animations are actually in my head now because of yeah. That. <laughs> yeah because the, uh, the, so the game uh, always plays that song when you boot it up for the first time, and it's the three main characters just dancing to it, but they their animations loop like after five seconds. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the reason I'm a little depressed, uh, John, remember when we did uh, Friday the Thirteenth on SGB? The the jank uh, multiplayer game. Yeah. Oh shit. He saw. Me. Oh shit! Car! No! Car! Yeah, what about years ago. Servers are shutting down. Oh really? Yep. Yeah. yeah. I'm surprised they last that long. They, they <laughs> I mean, like just announced it. Oh, I, I, I honestly, I'm surprised they lasted that long. <laughs> bad asses, badass to ever badass. That's a laugh. But thank you very much for the compliment anyway. Yeah, uh, Dollar from Chris France. Uh, F also John. Last one I swear. Can you read this with whatever voice you want? Uh, I don't know what voice should I do. Anything. <laughs> Ooh, you're whispering more to my ear, Dad. Wait, I know. Yeah, I was, you got, you got new voice? Uh, your Richard Nixon from earlier was pretty good. Uh, I was actually gonna say. I was actually gonna say if you could do Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Morgan Freeman. <laughs> well, I guess for Morgan next Freeman. year, I haven't done Morgan Freeman. Earn, earn your, earn your freckle. Like, um, I haven't done Morgan Freeman in such a long time, though. Uh, maybe I can do it. I'm not sure. Doctor Freeman. I realize this moment may not be the most convenient for a heart to heart, but I had to wait until your friends were otherwise occupied. There was a time they cared nothing for Miss Vance, when their only experience of humanity was a crowbar coming at them at Steel Corridor. When I plucked her from Black Mesa, I acted in the face of objections that she was a mere child and of no practical use to anyone. I've learned to ignore such naysayers when quelling them up was out of the question. Still, I am not one to squander my investments. And I remain confident she was worth more than the initial appraisal. That's why I must now extract from you some small repayment owed for your own survival. See her safely to White Forest, Doctor. I wish I could do more than keep an eye on you, but I have agreed to abide by a certain restrictions. Hmm, well, now uh, <laughs> that's actually written to the script. Well, now. <laughs> I it. When you see your father related these words, prepare for unforeseen consequences. I'm more than ready. <laughs> and that's how you earn a freckle. Yeah. <laughs> Scrolling through news on my phone, I don't know what I did to 
like, influence my algorithm, but Google keeps on recommending articles about salami to me. And it's... <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, we're, we're, how long has that been going on? Were you very hungry? No, it's uh, a couple weeks now. And just, it's been like, a couple you know, weeks? Homemade salami. Yeah. Oh. I don't even click on them. I just kind of look at them. 10 things you could do with a single slice of salami. Number three will shock you. Coming up on Action News, we have Tony Pearson in the salami scandal coming live to you from Camden, New Jersey. I don't know what to do. I can't read these articles. I was just hungry. Oh, oh by the way, does anyone in... Did everyone in John's... Uh, Twitch... on the internet. Did everyone in... Just in. We just found out that the mother has, has, has decided to make a comment. What were you saying, Ben? Did everyone in that's in John's um hang on. In John's Twitch Discord appreciate my Connecticut condiment conflict joke the other day? Connecticut what? The Connecticut, what? Connecticut condiment, condiment conflict. Connecticut condiment conflict. I think um uh, uh, J or uh, Blaze sent over something about he just said mayo one. And someone made a joke about ketchup. I'm like, well, this is from the Connecticut Economy Complex. No. Look for it. It was from the oh. other day. It's, like, it's funny, damn it, I swear. <laughs> I promise you guys, it's funny. Afraid that, oh. I'm afraid uh, that joke lie. doesn't I, cut the I mustard. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much <laughs> how that went. Uh, we got a one dollar donation from Agent Boomin just to make you guys feel old again. As of five days ago, Elliot's infamous switch palace death is now eight years okay, old. Okay, I got it. <laughs> so Jason wrote in Team Mayo One, and Matt was like, "Huh?" And I wrote back, "It was a side pro it was a side protest of the Irish Red Riots, the Connecticut Condiment Conflict." I have no idea. Yeah, because I, I think I did post the picture yeah, of the Condiment King the, for that. Yep. <laughs> With the picture of the guy, yeah, and it's yep. the condiment king. I was just proud for quickly coming up with that um, really good alliteration. <laughs> the <Connecticut>, Validate me. <laughs> the Connecticut condiment conflict. Coming up on Action News at 11. Sent a, sent a text to his parents like, I told you I was funny. <laughs> they, they replied. Oh, <laughs> uh, what, what's the... Uh, um, Mom, Kevin Hart liked my tweet. Does that make me a comedian? <laughs> was that Tim Allen? Yes. <laughs> that was one of his grunts. Really? Yep. Yeah, you really you didn't hear that? Oh, no, no, I didn't. <gasps> I guess it's, a, it's not... <sighs> that, that's, that's from the intro, I think. That's actually, like, I don't think he made that noise during the show. I think that's actually from the intro. It's from the no, show because no, I isolated he's, he's it from during that. The show, I I'm pretty sure. It, oh, it's, I, I guess I'm used to it being a little more guttural. That's what it I, is. I watched an 18 oh, minute compilation of it. I think I know what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, then I'm a <laughs> fucking idiot. I'm sorry. Oh Jesus God, sorry. Christ. Sorry, sorry I didn't laugh at your condiment joke, prick. Yeah, what the? <laughs> Holy crap. Hilarious. <laughs> <Hello. laughs> the Connecticut condiment conflicts. Damn it. I feel like I missed something. What? Okay, <laughs> thing? That's Tim Allen. Oh, okay. And it took me a moment. Tim Allen on cocaine. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, oh, back, no. Back jail for me. This is uh, that good shit for Columbia. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I ran over Wilson on the lawn. No, I'm back to Wilson. Well, <laughs> it's back to jail for me. <laughs> oh. it's, it's time for, it's time for me to go the ambient. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Tim Allen was in a TV special for Jimmy Neutron. He was? Yeah, uh, Win, Lose, Kaboom. He was the game show host. Oh, I do remember that. Oh, he was like yeah. the, the alien game show host, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, that was really weird. Say, he was still good at it. Uh, Meldar Prime, that was the character's name. His head, his forehead looked like a fucking nutsack. Like, I, 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 I feel that has to be highlighted. His forehead looked like a goddamn nutsack. It's like, what if, it's like, what if Megamind's, Me Me Megamind's head was like sm slightly smaller, but then you just wrinkle it? No, it's like, what if Luke Perry like squished his face? 
Who the hell is Luke Perry? Okay, yeah, that might be a little too weird. <laughs> 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 I've never wow. heard his name before. There you go. Hey, here's our family uh, guy. That's painful. <laughs> what? That's Why? Painful. Oops. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, I'm old. Hey, I'll be right back. No, you won't. Yeah, well, I gotta take a shit. But unlike mine, like, I, unlike yours, I don't take only like five minutes. I don't like being attacked like this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and for everyone, what is some hobby you do that you find relaxing? For me, editing has been both motivational and relaxing. Uh, basically, whenever I have downtime, I just play pop. It's game. If I'm playing, if I'm on 14, it's because I'm trying to escape and get away. Just to shoot the shit and all this sort of thing. Yeah. I've started building stuff on Sims. It's just like, just kind of fun. But like, no pressure, right? It's just like super yeah. easy going, relaxing. You can just make whatever you want. It's kind of yeah. nice. Uh, uh, I started I started pickling things. You guys want to try my pickle? Are you sure. being serious or? Uh... I yeah I, I I have no idea if he's being serious or not. So. I think you're just saying this at a random. Well, I'm oh. Random okay. by hitting pickles. Yeah. I I'm, I'm not interested in your pickles. Thank you. No. Uh, Linky just a uh, born. I mean, sure. You gotta, everybody relaxes. In their hey. Own way. I don't relax. I tense up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, I I. For relaxing, of uh, you know, I pop a gummy and I listen to some lo-fi hip hop, and that actually, like, I just sit there and just vibe out. I can tell you honestly, I've never listened to a lo-fi album. It's always playlists on YouTube, so it's always like random uh, artists and stuff. There isn't another playlist that's like this. It's so good. If you go to YouTube, um, look up Chill Vibes. It's like a 39 minute video somewhere around there, maybe like 32. Uh, it's actually got Homer driving. Remember when Homer got medical marijuana and he was driving? Uh, so he's like zoned out, but it's just sort of uh, uh, like if you look, if you look at it, you see the image. They did this lo-fi thing where the image is kind of distorted and all but good stuff you done so i if you guys need any help or anything in uh tomorrow with the rest of it just let me know oh will do thank you very oh, thank much you. for uh, helping and reading donations we much appreciate your company thank you very much yep good luck guys all right have a good night Bye. You too. Bye. All right. Who's gonna tell her that today is tomorrow? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we need your help with the stream. Uh, I said Monday. Uh, Linky, if you're available later during the the morning, you can hop in. Because I, honestly, I, I don't really care. So we're get, getting to that point of the stream. Uh, I don't care. I can. Uh, no, because you. Because to me, I, we, we go into this multiple times. You can tell when I'm starting to grow weird because my voice gets deep. Um, yeah, I'm a little getting, like that. Yeah, when my voice starts getting low, that's where you know uh, he's getting tired. But I'm not like dipping in and out of consciousness. I'd say I've got about like six more hours before that starts happening with me. It's on my watch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where we talk about all the spicy topics that you mm -hmm. send in and request today well, i used to do today, i used to do a late night stream like that you today's... call us at one nine hundred today's hi topic. i'm jenny today's topics sex hotlines that's it topic make of it what you will <laughs> Jenny, and I just there she goes. Yeah, there. <laughs> I'm so naughty. <laughs> How naughty are you, Jenny? Oh, I underreported for my taxes. Oh, oh, that kind of... <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, see, I was, there, Jenny. I was expecting Listen, something a little more. I'm looking for naughty, not hard and criminal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, is there any chance I, I can get the hard without naughty. the criminal? <laughs> Naughty. 
I brought 11 Freaky items to friend, a 10 man. item express lane. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I'm looking for naughty, not a bitch. Get out of here. <laughs> I crossed I the street in between your crosswalks. I jaywalk. Uh, I found myself a courageous pink fur, and I couldn't help but be feeling naughty. I make turns without putting on my blinkers. Oh, no. No, we're done. Uh, <laughs> we're done here. <laughs> we're done here. Sometimes I just like to drive in the left lane, even when I'm not passing somebody. Oh, my God. I hate you, Jenny. <laughs> Sometimes I drive in the left lane on a two-lane road. <laughs> Oh, the, the sound clip in general, if someone's asking the uh, YouTube chat, uh, the sound clip in general is just from an old, like, sex hotline that yeah. doesn't work anymore. <laughs> I know, I call yeah, we, uh... yeah. <laughs> 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 Well, I didn't want to say it out loud, but... <laughs> so this is Pac-Man World. This is the first of these uh, trilogy. Is this is a bad time to mention I haven't played this game since 2016? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even booted up for practice. All right, there you go. Super Dude, go. I go. didn't have enough time to practice. So. <laughs> okay. It's fine. It's fine. Pac-Man World 2, though, I've played like 50 times throughout my life, so I'll be fine for that. Yeah, but. folks are really hoping that we get the Pac-Man World 2. I mean, good. I mean, it's after this game, so, you know, just... This <laughs> game I played for the first time in 2016, and that was the only time. And I liked it, but it, it, 2016 is fuzzy a little bit. So uh, gonna... we're getting ready to begin our next game for Pac-Man. Let me. Um... Oh, uh, I'll go for are you... it. Are we yeah. ready? Yeah. All right. In five, four. Wait, hang on, hang on. Three. Hang on. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta tie my shoe. Wait right. for Uncle. Or... Wait. Can't get back no, to the screen. Oh, oh, go ahead. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we, gotta go the all right. we gotta go through like this. The loading, yeah. The all right. Part, like, you all, right. To, like, all right, all right. You just start. Five, four, three, two, one, start! Not everybody started. New Year's. New Year, New Year. Hey, Rob, how's it going, man? Is that Fat Boy Spider? Yeah, it's uh, Spider Knife, yeah. It's my yeah, boy. I, I don't call him Spider Knife, I, I just call him because I know his name is Rob. So I just call him yeah. it, it's yeah. the Spider Knife! Yeah. It's the homie. Hey, Rob. we're we're online. When you're online, you get to choose your name. And you went with Spider Knife, so you get Spider Knife. That's how it works. I, I asked before. <laughs> Omar, get set. I will learn that whole part. <laughs> Mrs. Teacher, what's that sticky place over there? <laughs> That's the porn area of the internet. We don't go over there yet. That's Nevada. Oh. Be sure to put this hat and sunglasses on before you go over there. We call that incognito mode. <laughs> <laughs> and like the mics picked them up for a second. I'm not sure if that was uh, in the highlight reel. It was. But yeah, it was. I'm, I'm sorry. Did he say that I heard pizza rolls rolling down the street? No. No. That's stupid. I didn't even say anything that was kind of like that. Are you sure? Really? Yeah. 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 I'm absolutely sure I did not say oh, pizza rolls. I'm not hungry. I'm just, just kind of tired. I'm probably... not hungry. Just stupid. <laughs> 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 I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not hungry. I'm just built different. <laughs> yes. Hungry. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm built the same way. I've got a similar build. Chicken. Ooh, bacon. I mean, what do you eat to, like, if you're trying to stay up longer than necessary, do you even eat anything? Air. Ooh, bacon. Just eat air. Um, that Friday. No, I, I, I drink coffee. Uh, A, because coffee has caffeine, but B, uh, the coffee actually makes my stomach feel a little more full. You're supposed to, yeah, um, uh, yeah, I think I'll, I'll, I'll drink coffee to curb my appetite. Yeah, I it, it depends. I, if I'm trying to stay up, uh, it's less about food and more about like I won't eat a whole lot, but I'll need to eat something. 
because the the hungry feeling will make me want to go to sleep so I don't feel that way anymore. Yeah. But the full feeling will make me feel tired. So I have to have something. Makes you lethargic, basically. Yeah. You if guys... I'm actively trying to stay awake. You guys ever had sleep for dinner? What was it? You guys ever had sleep for dinner? Sleep yes, for I did. dinner? Uh-huh. So if, if I feel that there's a time where I'm, I'm like, hungry, but I really don't want to eat anything, either whether for a diet or because I don't want to get into a bad spending habit, I will try and go to sleep, yeah. Yeah, that, that's it. There it is. That's sleep for dinner. Yep. Yeah. That's also a very funny song by an old group called Lords of the Underground. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard that one. Yeah, oh, it's a, it's a funny song. Did you see the picture? Who the hell sent that? It was like, uh, it's the scene of did Sephiroth do this with like the dead Midgazorum? And then it, it's a picture of Sephiroth. And he says, no, I was an electrical doing that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, Sephiroth's acting pretty sus. <laughs> Anyway, question for all. What meal always hits the spot for you? For me, it's Charlie's Chicken Philly. I don't know what that is. Uh, what meal always hits the spot for me, personally? Um, Stop the <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I went around in the chat and it made me laugh. I'm going delirious. Turkey, like I said, turkey's like chicken. It's all about how you cook it, how you season it. Yeah. Um, Not, crispy you know, Chris, I will. Oh, I will cough. I knew this Rex. I'm sorry. I knew that. <laughs> <laughs> Kilo, I thought you said for one of your Christmas dinners you had a hot dog. I'm like, that's kind of sad. Bro. <laughs> yes, but was it a sandwich? <laughs> oh my God. Not again. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, also, you... two lights to answer your question real quickly on the YouTube chat. Why is Ben the one with the game audio? Because if we had all three of them running with the audio, you it's a no, it'd be a mess. No, I think I that that's like why Ben and not one of the other ones. I yeah, because he's the Cause one. He's easiest yeah. to get mine. I'm yeah, it's well. Yeah, he's. Oh, I also the... he's, uh, he's the one hosting, and it just you don't want three different audio feeds going off at the yeah. same time. It's just the best. Yeah. Unless you do want that. No, I I, oh. I, I I will veto that right now. You know, nobody asked us when we only played Johnny's audio back when we did it that way. Only when it's Ben's audio. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like you don't One go to time? Sheets okay. for like a hoagie or like something Wawa y, but you don't go yeah. to Wawa for something like, you know, that's traditionally fried. With that said, toaster raviolis are bad. Oh, well, I never had any of those, so I don't know oh, what I'm missing out on. Raviolis are good. Is it exactly what it sounds like? The, yeah, it, it's raviolis breaded and fried well, instead not of... fried, they're baked because it's Wawa. What the fuck? Oh, are you <laughs> How many times? I thought you were going to call it. Like, how many fucking times do I got to tell you? Right they're they're not fried, they're baked. Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm not going to complain. I just came back from that. Guys are coming. <laughs> okay. I, I don't know what just happened there, but I'm not going to complain. I feel like the stream will eventually end with everyone constantly saying wah wah oh, wah. Wow. <laughs> Which eventually translates to waka waka. We, no, we've become all the adults from the Peanuts cartoons. Then one other person shows up and like, hey guys, what's going on? Why are you talking like that? Uh, one dollar from Sean uh, Gresham. I think this is my fifth donation. Sorry if it's too much. I quite apologize. Oh no, I donated too much. <laughs> what are all your guilty pleasure music bands? Uh, well, I mean, I don't know. Is it really embarrassing to say? That? I mean, I guess unless you're like Creed. <laughs> oh, right. uh, well, what was the one that earned it? Nickelback. I don't know, I really shit on Nickelback. Uh, I, I, I don't, I, I don't think I've ever listened to a Nickelback song, so I, I, I don't, I don't know what exactly is wrong with. I don't, what is, what is wrong with Nickelback? Uh, they try to be hard rock. Okay. But I don't know, they just, is that a crime? Just, like, you know, <laughs> country as shit. The dynamic is so off. Oh, I got the uh, fuck. See, to me, a guilty pleasure is an artist that I would listen in privacy, but I would never admit that I listen to. 
And no, because that wouldn't suit that I'm embarrassed. Don't come from me. Don't come from me. But you see, but yeah. Even then, it's like I that I don't know. Guilty pleasure artist? Is that what we're like, saying? Yeah, like for music, yeah. Like a yeah, song that I, you were listening to, like in your privacy, but you'd be embarrassed to play out loud. But I, I just don't care that. Yeah. Like yeah. I, I really don't either. Like if I like the song, I like the song. <laughs> Ali Moss is something from Hentai. You know what? Never mind. <laughs> because I have this. I, I mentioned this a few times in a, a couple of streams beforehand. But like, you ever have that problem where you're watching porn and? No, nope. you're listening to the opening and the ending song is like, wait a minute, this is actually really fucking good, but I can't tell anybody where it's from. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you're gonna love this. Okay. You're gonna hate it. I'm, uh, I, it, it, it's because it's 3:20 in the morning and oh, my, sure. my oh senses my are lowered. Is the sure. only reason I'm gonna say this. All right. There is a song, um, that I heard in a porn. Okay. Uh, it was in the background. Uh, I right. won't say who or the video or anything. I will say, oh, let me find the song here. Oh, yeah, there we go. You're about 20 minutes I, late I, on I, that. I, for I the yeah, right? Ah, uh, you spaced on it. Um, oh, I'm in the space level, so this makes sense. Right? Yeah. <laughs> God, I'm trying to find the song to make sure that I'm listening to the right song. Yes. It is Dave McCullen. It's called Electric Girl. Let me make sure that I'm listening to the right version over here. Oh. I like how the first comment under the video is like, I think everyone knows why we're here. <laughs> That's it. That's the song. That yeah. I heard that song uh, in, in the same video. And I remember watching it. And when I was done, I was like, that's actually kind of a good song. Let me yeah, look that up. Oh, Much amazing. like the things that are happening in this video, this song slaps. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this this song is it's called Electric Girl by uh, Dave McCullough. Dave McCullough, yeah. <laughs> uh, meta um, choke in YouTube. So Uncle was into electric stimulation. Got it. <laughs> Zap. The bolt of lightning. Uh, I barely make some people uncomfortable in the YouTube chat. Uh, deal with it. We're adults. It's over here. Um, <laughs> yeah, if you're not an adult, you should be asleep. Yeah, you should be, yeah, you should be in the morning. asleep. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, $3.50 for Rainbow Snake. This is probably going to be really late, and I swear I wouldn't donate after the 666 donation, but a very generous Loch Ness monster gave me this, and I need to correct something Elliot said, being the particular type of music nerd I am. Uh, the real problem Nickelback has is that the lyrics tend to be incredibly juvenile and sometimes just outright gross, especially considering the fact that they're sung by a guy who's over 30. They basically have the song of lyrics taken from creepy Pornhub comments. I mean, that sounds ultimately like a subjective thing and not an objective criticism. Who is she? You know, because... Uh, <laughs> I don't know what that reference is. I would say that's more of a subjective criticism than listening and not so much objective because there might be people that like that. You know? Who is she? What's her name? Oh, I would love to have her on. Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, $3 from... This someone yeah, to comment on the porn video. Oh, I don't know. Because cause they're thirsty as shit, dude. And they think that they'll probably <laughs> fucking read those comments. Yeah. Me? Uh, $5 from Hick Warrior. I'm wondering, have you guys ever had any virtual pets like Tamagotchi or Digimon? I had a Tamagotchi at one point in my life very early. This was like during the middle of the Pokemon craze because it was all over the place. Uh, I had one. It died because I didn't take care of it because, no. I uh, mean, like, they always die. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But that's that's probably why I was never really interested in, like, the Child Garden and Sonic Adventure and all that. I just, well, even though I understand that it's really no different. No, you see, the thing is that I always looked at it as Pokemon, but I didn't fight anything, and I actually had to feed the fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> well, wait, hold on. You said what always dies? Tamagotchis. Uh, like, Tamagotchis, Yeah. Well, they you don't mean like the battery dies. You mean like no, the, like the, the no, they don't always die. Did you never have one live? Like, I've had one live, but they like live? they die. <laughs> they die. No, <laughs> no. Uh, Elliot is quiet because both of them are uh, both of them are using the same mic or sharing a mic. Well, no, we had the headsets no, we had on. The headsets on. Oh, never mind then. I'm quiet because I'm tired. We that, also that would have... do it, yeah. We also have roommates that are asleep and we're yeah. in the living How room. How dare you stop? No, you should be screaming. <laughs> fucking the lungs off for my entertainment. <laughs> I'm, also, I'm also sick and have a sore throat. Mm. So yeah. I, I, I that sounds like an excuse. 
<laughs> I'm not one to be like, I don't know how the hell you guys you don't want to get too far here. You guys watching in uh, on yeah, Twitch like, and YouTube, like, like I don't understand how the hell you're like, doing it, unless like listening is background noise. Right? Yeah, it's I like suppose. 4 a.m. But listen, it's mm-hmm. it's almost eight o'clock in the UK parts. or nine o'clock. Mm-hmm. So maybe some UK. Because I'm the I'm the kind of guy though that unless I'm like watching a mutual. Or uh, just a friend in general on a, a live stream, I, I don't interact with chat. Like if I'm watching a if I'm watching a presentation on YouTube, I always hide the chat because I'm just not interested in what chat has to say for something that I don't really think they have anything to contribute. Like a live, or, like a live like, presentation, like, like, like a direct or a presentation. Oh, okay. Yeah, you know, I never have chat open for those kind of things because I. Don't it just moves to too fast. Yeah, it moves. Too, it's it's also most of the time it's just a cesspool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, and uh, and like with Twitch stuff, like unless I'm, unless I know them, like if I'm if I'm, if I'm watching uh, Linky or Ray or a uh, Trav or anybody else in my circle, then like I'll interact with chat for a bit. But if it's like for something like like a broadcast again, I I don't bother. All right, John doesn't care about chat. Yeah, there we no, go. like there absolutely. We like I like I, I don't care about I chat do. worry, in guys. other thing. I, I don't care about chat in things that are not related to me because yeah. I, I, I don't know who they are. I know who you guys are. Like I there are so many names I recognize on uh, on the Twitch side and the YouTube you can side. Kiss my ass. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> you should probably listen to John. You pay for a just some call me Johnny ASMR? Cool. Look forward to my Patreon. So I was oh, like, God. they can't be hearing the game that much. You guys wouldn't pay for a song called Majestic OnlyFans. What the fuck would I do? <laughs> watch porn and try <laughs> to figure out where you know the hey, music. You guys want to watch porn with me? Look at this. Isn't this song great? Uh-huh. <laughs> this song slaps. Rust, rust, rust. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you might want to mute this next part. <laughs> <laughs> It sounds Is like it, I'm fucking a washing I, game. Like, I, <laughs> I thought it was that Pennywise laugh again. Oh my god! <laughs> right? the, the Pennywise <laughs> laughs. Uh huh. I'm hearing the Pennywise laugh. <laughs> Sure. I mean, you donate a thousand dollars, you get a free member from the John's Holy Dance. Yeah, I can't share mm-hmm. a bed with someone in Minecraft that easily. Wait, what? what? <laughs> um, I'm confused. Oh, excuse me. You want to? Do- I think he's at that point where he's starting to fall asleep. So then there's like a half dream happening, <laughs> but he's still awake enough to comment oh, on it. Steve, no. drop the meat. Uh huh. <laughs> I, <was, laughs> I was reading. I was reading chat. Oh, okay. Sure. He, so he was reading chat, he says. Uh-huh. Who's fucking on the Minecraft bed? Uh-huh. 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 Yeah, that, this, <laughs> like, that's, definitely, that, that's definitely in the in the half asleep Elliot sort of like this is when you when you get startled awake and you go, I don't want to ride the unicorn. So uh, the Pennywise laugh reminded me of when we were talking about how the laugh fits with Ocarina of Time's Forest Temple theme. Uh, we mentioned that during the Ashley we played, and I found someone made that mix on yeah. their YouTube channel in reference to us. I'm going to play that right now. What? Oh. <laughs> Don't ask me how. When I was practicing, I beat Anubis Rex on the first try, and I think I shed a gold brick out of amazement. <laughs> hey, see? It's out of here. The thing is, like, like, I didn't even practice the bosses, because technically, I don't even think you really need to beat the bosses. Wait, is I that... think you just need to get the, the pals. No, is that the edited that version? Up. That's the edited version, yeah. Okay. You can't open up the uh, next half of the game till you beat them. Trust me, I was stuck on it forever, so. They're just fucking hard. This, he, that didn't make sense. Gosh, you're big. You're so big. <laughs> no, he said it, it's fucking hard. Not fuck me hard. <laughs> Fill me up, Chandler. Put it in. 
Oh, uh, that um, uh, Mega Trash Lord, the feeling of vertigo you get on your bed still gets me from time to time. Where you swear for an instant you're falling oh, and you're not. That. Yeah. Uh, and it's like you, you, you jolt. Yeah, there's like a video clip of a of a guy like it's it's supposed to be i guess from a gta and he like falls off a building and like he hits stuff uh like on the way down and then right before he hits the ground he wakes up on his couch but like he he startles up so much he gets up and he like does a flip yeah. <laughs> it's just the way he gets up <laughs> Wait, hold on. What's the, if it already exploded twice? Why is it still making the whistling noise? It blew up in the air. <laughs> it blew up in the air twice. You know, on YouTube, uh, when you feel the static in your hands and legs, uh, like the pins and needles. The the pins yeah. and needles, yeah. Yeah. See, uh, um, I'm not too bothered by that because I just, I just, it's, it's the same sort of like feeling with like, like it. It doesn't come out of nowhere. Basically. Yeah. It doesn't come out of nowhere. There, there's you, you can start it, you can stop it. Yeah. So. You yeah. It just means you have raging brain cancer. Okay. Yeah, basically. <laughs> and and I, mean, I hate you that probably when it's like in your leg. And yeah. yeah. That's probably the worst of that is especially if I'm trying to get somewhere. I'm like, okay, well, oh, no, I just have to kind of stand oh, in place. Yeah, and no, like, leg to leg. Exactly. <laughs> like, I want to walk, but I also don't want to fall. <laughs> and, and this is probably the most, this is probably the weird thing that I feel like people will agree with the most. Why does it feel like television static? Yeah. Why does it feel like television static? You know, you know the TV yeah, staticky yeah. when it snows. Uh, yeah. That's what, don't know what that, that is. feels like. That's right because yeah because the yeah, TVs right. don't do that nowadays anymore. Uh, so if like if anybody has ever been like exposed to like a, a, and I say exposed because it might be radiation. Who fucking knows? Uh, uh, old CRTs. When that thing was on, you knew it was yeah. on because yeah. it emitted a frequency that just enveloped the entire room. Yeah, well, we you just knew remember that when we made the, when... the, the video for the uh, stream. Yeah, exactly. The uh, it, it fuck, the you might. I mean, I, I, I doubt you'd be able to do this, but um, my Mega Man Six review on the channel. I popped out the old CRT for that specifically, and I, I turn it. I, the joke about that is like I turn it on, and because this is, this is an experience I had all the time as a kid, where you turn on the CRT, you don't know how loud the volume was though before you turned it off the last time, <laughs> and that fucking yeah, just and that's fills it. up the whole room. It's like okay, that's it. I tried to sneak in some playtime at night. My parents know I'm up, and I'm not gonna be able to play at all. Or, ow, my ears. I guess yeah. I don't have to listen to the music now. Or, and that's the, even when you get the volume low. Yeah. CRTs just emit a noise. Yeah. There's, there's a, a low white, electrical no, there's a very, hum. That's 15 yes. kilohertz. That's the sound. Yeah. The, the, it just it just does it. And uh, when we, John, when you and I raced uh, Super Metroid. Yeah. Right. I brought my PVM over. Yeah. And you plug it in, and the second you hit the power button, it's like, yeah, it just fills your, <laughs> it's just, it just it's fills noise. your ear, like it directly pierces your. And uh, Ben, what was that exactly specifically? Fifteen kilohertz. It is, fi is, it is a fifteen it? kilohertz frequency that is like entering your. And what that ear. is is that's every line being drawn, and that's how many times it happens a second. So that's the sound of the electron gun literally doing that action that makes yeah. it a second. So like when the CRT was on, you felt you that it, it was on. Like you literally felt yeah. that shit. You, Any and, stronger, and, and I'm pretty sure you can taste it. And uh, I'll be oh, honest, God, people, yeah, people like probably think TV. that we're joking or exaggerating. And no, when yeah. I used to leave my house, uh, I would stop and listen upstairs mm -hmm. because I could hear, even if the TV was just on nothing, I could tell that the TV was on. And that was part of my, all right, let me make sure I turned everything off. I would stop and I would listen at the bottom of the stairs. And if I had a TV that was on, even if it was muted or whatever, I knew it was on because yeah. I could hear it. You just know it was on. All right, Elliot. See you in a few hours. Later. <laughs> if we get that far. See you whenever I see you. <laughs> you don't take me out anymore. <laughs> what are you talking about? We went to the store the other day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was acne. 
<laughs> so right, like, you have a good night, yep. Lucky. I'll talk to you later. And uh, if I don't see you for, like for the next couple of days, best of luck with that fucking PS5 and Xbox. That's lunch because holy shit, yo, Linky. I mean, who do I have to blow to get a PS5 from you, dude? <laughs> Jeff Bezos, probably. <laughs> oh, okay, wait, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> to answer your question, probably Linky. <laughs> uh, Ten dollars from Nobutron. Uh, okay. Oh God. Uh, so the, I think they want this read in a Norwegian accent. I don't know what a Norwegian accent is off the top of my head. Yeah, where's Norwegia? Norwegia. Yeah. Norwegia. <laughs> Norwegia. <laughs> I think it. I think it means just talk like you live on a cruise ship. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to take this one? Uh, you're already doing the, the. You're already doing the Borat voice. I mean, it's not the same thing, but still. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Uh, not the same thing, not, John. Wow, wrong yeah, side of history there, I, buddy. I, I'm the one that just referenced it. The same thing. You can't um, call me. Right. <laughs> no, my. Uh, Second in the Norwegian extension. Uh, you can take it. I, I my. I don't know that I have a distinctive I'm Norwegian. going to butcher this completely so uh bear with me uh allo knowing color meg johnny uncle sova greg skumo elliot and all right this is where I'm at a loss because I have no idea how the hell this is pronounced uh Kadres Sabrina I have no fucking idea and Ben, <laughs> and Ben is just written as Ben. <laughs> I wish you all good health and fortune, and I hope next year will be at least a smidge better. And hope next year will be a smidge better. Yeah, just this year in general is fucking close. Uh, good luck with the rest of the marathon, and keep on chomping balls. Waka waka. No, seriously though. Uh, can someone in the chat? I'm going to put this on both Twitch and YouTube. Uh, tell me how that is pronounced, because I have no idea. Kiaris. Yeah, yeah. Kiaris, Kiaris, Sabrina, no uh, Kongke, Kongke, and Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that was terrible. I don't know where that came the, from. The Mike Myers cat in the hat. Oh, uh, like, Thunder! Yeah, and ben. Nobutron says KJ can be replaced with a SH sound, so like a sh sound. So that uh, would be uh, Shadist. 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 It's it's Shadist. 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 Yeah. Girlfriend. Oh. It can mean it can mean boy or girlfriend. She it's gender neutral. It's gender neutral. Oh, okay. okay. It's gender neutral. Okay. Then what the hell do they call Elliot? Uh, Kumo? Elliot was uh, Skumo. It was Skumo. 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 Scare oh, scary. Which I believe is Norwegian for furiously masturbating. <laughs> uh, school oh. is Norwegian for creepy. Okay, so it's just this moniker, for, for but it's but it's it's a it's a it's an, a Norwegian accent. My it's username came, my username changed to girlfriend Sabrina. Girlfriend Sabrina, yeah. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> what's Zelda Link lover in Norwegian? Uh, <laughs> I, I, I just like I, I like I like Kongi K. <laughs> skim. Or, uh, no. that's like uh like uh skulled uh that's the skull i think skulled maybe i'm fascinated by languages like different languages yeah yeah i'm i've i've been i'm fascinated by them because we think of language as language right we think of words as words we think of uh, speaking as speaking and really what you're doing is you're just making sounds all you're doing is making sound if i if i say you know hello or if i say Bleh, right it's just gibberish but it's only because we have assigned a meaning to those sounds and not others so i'm fascinated by the idea of why some places have some sounds that we can't even make because it, the the over time your body has the ability to make certain noises that like people always joked about the uh, uh like japanese uh the, what is it the r's is l's yeah and that's because physically they are not their mouth their mouths are not trained to make those noises 
so they can't it's not it's not as simple as saying no just say it like this r they can't yeah exactly <laughs> <laughs> oh we do have a couple more donations so let me read these out real quick uh that one guy named tyler uh donated 25 dollars to keep your spirits up after a long day, let me give you a fun fact to brighten your day. If it has anything to do with presidential assassinations, I think I want to pass. <laughs> uh, did you know another name for French toast is eggy bread? Yep. It's true, my friend. Be sure to rest and stretch well. Also, one more addition for the Nintendo Switch 2 if possible. Thank you. Yes. Eggy bread for French toast. I think I might have heard that at some point or another earlier, but I don't remember when. Eggy bread or eggy? Eggy. 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 Yeah. eggy. Yeah, because, because, I think, of... because, because the batter needed for French toast, I think, contains yeah, eggs in it. Okay. Egg. Yeah. French people just call it toast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> or freedom toast. Probably, yeah, probably just freedom. I remember, I remember that that, that yeah. tried to be a thing. First, and it, like, it was, yeah, we call them freedom fries because yeah. you know, get the get the foreign country out of the name. Yeah, we don't, we don't want to talk about Yeah, fries. because we're America. Yeah. We're nothing yeah. but foreign countries. <laughs> like, like, seriously, yeah. I, like, I don't know what the fuck that means. Like, well, it had something to do with, with the French government uh like like pulling out of some agreement or something that we, that we had and then there was this sort of blowback of like oh well if you don't want to be if you don't want to be we're cool with us we're not going to be cool with you and we're going to change everything that says french to freedom it's like you, let me let me tell you something right now if if i go out to eat and you offer me freedom toast with freedom fries and uh afterwards we go in the back and we freedom kiss I'm gonna punch you in your face. Yeah, this is like seriously. Hard, like, hard I, I, don't want, I don't want any of that immigration in my title. It's like, cool. Uh, America's a melting pot of what? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Shut cheese. the fuck up. It's cheese. Yeah, like, cool. It's, it's cheese, <laughs> idiot. <laughs> but yeah, like eggy. Uh, what you say, eggy, eggy toast? Is that what it was? Eggy bread? No, it's Arnold betrays Iggy. <laughs> Uh, Eggy Toast. Yeah, Eggy Toast. Is that a code name for Garfield's assassination by a normal? <laughs> God damn it. They be like, he fooled us. Like, I heard uh, Eggy in a Basket, which is yeah. a, uh, it's a single it's a single piece of toast with right. a sunny side up egg on it. I think that's what it is. And it's called Eggy in a Basket. It's like two eggs in a hanky. Yeah, English is just a guy in a trench coat that keeps stealing aspects from other languages and doesn't follow its own rules. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, Matt, you know what? I I'm going to be honest with you. That's my biggest problem with it. The first part is like, okay, all, I think all languages at some point borrow words from other languages. Yeah. My problem is that you have this established set of rules and then you don't follow them. I before E, except after C, except in a a bunch of words mm -hmm. that don't follow that rule. Yeah, that English that's... is bull. You can do. You can just cloud. You can just summarize it by saying English is bullshit. But the fun is discussing the nuance about it. Yeah, I think so. I think that that's what makes it. That's where uh, proficiency comes in. You can. Uh, Grizzly boar right. Einstein's got it wrong twice in his name. <laughs> 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 I think I've reached my limit. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to throw up, don't worry. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. You just be just like, man, I am done with this shit. Oh, no, like, I'm like, I'm just. What the hell was that? Chest I, got, I, I beat the Anubis Rex. Oh. oh. God. And reset. <laughs> Power out. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go. Did you get, get off? Yeah, because, yeah. uh,. My, my, my body's in pain. <laughs> yeah. oh, I'm fucking All dying, right. man. <laughs> well, here, let me put something in her face. Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't don't put yourself. Another five dollars from Nathan Ealing. How about Contra Battle Royale? Uh, every enemy you kill gets sent to another player, and never mind. That sounds like a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> I I. It sounds pretty good to me. Yeah. It sounds pretty good to me. I like it. I, I think that that's I think that this uh, battle royale format uh, I think Mario 35 specifically has proven that there are ways to make it work I mean I think Tetris kind of opened the door for that in a way but I think that a lot of people looked at Tetris 99 and said oh that's like a one off and then when they saw Mario to me it was like oh wow you could do this with a lot of games 
Because I wanted it with uh, Bomberman. Oh, that would be so good. I wanted a I wanted a hundred player Bomberman, where you start on a screen with nine other players. So what you've got going is ten screens of ten players. When when that winner uh, wins the game, they will move on to another map, and all of the winners of the ten maps will fight it out there continuously so then like when when you win your map you move to the final map if you get there first that gives you the opportunity to start collecting some power-ups so so the it's not just about getting to the end it's about trying to get there as fast as possible because if you get there last you're going to be the weakest one there or they took each other out and you're going to get there and there's only going to be two people left all right, to utilize the these right. franchises. Oh, is uh, Pac-Man World the one is over? Congrats to King Yay! Kang. I forgot we were playing again. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much, Ahmed, for your generous contribution. And with that, folks, we are officially over ten thousand dollars for Pac-Man Fever. We did Give it, ladies and gentlemen. Money. We did it. Let's go. Ten thousand dollars. <laughs> There, where's the, <laughs> where's the, uh, we don't got any, we don't got any, uh, prices right. <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> and, and because of that, I got the, I got the dollar. At the, at the 11 o'clock hour, we will be stopping everything we're doing to end it with a session of Pac-Man Fever, courtesy of Ben and Friends. God bless us. So thank you very much, guys. It is thanks to you that we're able to raise so much money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. We're, we're bound to get that Gamer X chair now. <laughs> but uh, the morning's here. Are you two ready to go? I think we should be. I think. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Quest screen. Yeah. You're going to bully me out of the water, by the way, but <laughs> It doesn't matter. As long as we're here, we're here to have fun, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. It's better than blowing you in the water. Yeah. <laughs> That's actually very difficult. Uh, 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 okay, now it sounds like a putty war. Getting, <laughs> yeah, it's like, it sounds like a putty soldier getting blown. Which is, I guess, every time, because they always sound like that. <laughs> Erotosaurus! <laughs> All right. We're good. All right, guys. Um... Guess uh, begin your game in five, four, three, two, one, go. Pac Man, settle down there. Yeah. <laughs> I, I thought he just straight up Tipo was there for a second. Yes. It says yeah. nuke you, Eastern it's Standard right, Time. Uh, the best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. They used to show that uh, Christmas commercial. Right, because like, they like they would begin with like um like it was like, the kid making the cup of coffee right like it well was like, it was it was like the I guess it was like the college daughter would come yeah. home and everybody was asleep so she would go into the kitchen and make uh set the coffee pot up yeah and then that smell would bring everybody and then they would come down and, oh god she's a home <laughs> <laughs> I heard that oh she's god. a home <laughs> Nick 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 George. George, Betty's home. <laughs> it's like, yeah, honey, I can see her. I know what to my first. Oh, the incest commercial. What? Hold on a second. <laughs> I haven't seen that commercial in so long. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Oh. Let me. Uh, did Kristen just get off? Uh, Kristen left I... like hours ago. Oh, okay. She seemed pretty happy to be here. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. She's awesome. <laughs> A Folgers coffee commercial in 2009, and it's between brother and sister. And okay, oh, yeah, there's definitely okay, yeah, there's definitely sexual tension here. Holy fuck! Oh wait, no, hold on. Oh no. What? Are you sure it wasn't? <laughs> hold on. Oh boy. Yeah, they had to know what they were doing. With it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. I refuse to believe that was an the... like Oh my! Wait, no, that you can't be it. A that's gift. that's You're a gift. yeah. Yeah, you that's we're technically be only step brother and sister <laughs> hold on because this is uh, this is like a parody commercial i think the one that i'm looking at <laughs> no uh, oh wait so hold on folgers coffee brother and sister home for christmas 2009 okay so that's a different one there's a parody version called <laughs> it the, the 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 channel is called flirting georgia and it's <laughs> it's labeled folgers incest commercial 
So I'm gonna go ahead and guess that was the parody. Yeah, the the commercial I was thinking about was the, the was the girl that that woke up and yeah, it was a Christmas commercial. I think it was anyway. And like she gets up and opens the can, and like the idea of the can opening was like. And was and she's wearing like, like a. Look, it's like like a, like a bathrobe or some of the shit. I'm not sure. Yeah, no. that was the commercial I was thinking of. The, this is the one where the guy just got home from a cab. Okay. She's wearing like a red and gray shirt. The parents smelled the coffee. Oh, they went no. downstairs. Their kids are fucking okay. <laughs> oh, no, he he got her like a gift. <laughs> oh my god. He, okay. Oh oh my god. Yeah. Hold on. I'm sorry. All right. So so he gave her a Christmas gift. She took the bow off and stuck yeah. it on his shirt and exactly. said, "You're my Christmas gift this year." Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking wow. The best part of waking up is banging near your cup. <laughs> like in football. <laughs> best part of waking up is for, oh my god, that's fucked up. <laughs> that, that, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't rhyme parents. at all. Some <laughs> parents coming downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> the best part of waking up is, oh my God. <laughs> George, look at what they're doing. I see Martha. <laughs> yeah, at least they're getting some. <laughs> I, think, I think PK is cheating. <laughs> clearly cheating. <laughs> Stop winning. You're cheating. <laughs> Uh, Peter comes home for Christmas. That's the Folgers commercial I remember. There's a longer version and there's a shorter version of it. Is there less incestual? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I feel I should ask. I feel we should ask this going in. <laughs> Peter comes home by himself, and it's like a little kid sister that's there. There's no sexual tension whatsoever. That's it's good. totally fine. <laughs> Uh, and, and and for the record, Peter is only mildly attractive. The hottest thing in the commercial is the coffee. <laughs> oh my god! Um, Hero chaos, Craig. This commercial, what the? Don't what the f at me? I didn't make the yeah, damn he, thing. He didn't make the damn thing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But, I would have been the first. Oh I would have been the first one on set. Like, are you sure this is all right? <laughs> Listen, I, I'm gonna go rub one out because I'm kind of seeing them together. It's making me feel weird things here. Uh, Clark, I make sure when you're uh, make sure you're close to the mic when you're speaking. The, the last thing I want to oh. do is drink coffee. Uh, I can at least play the audio so that everyone can hear it at the very least. That's fine. Oh, I must have the wrong house. Sister. For the record, that's how a porn begins. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, just everything about that. <laughs> he, right down to the banjo. <laughs> To the very appropriate banjo. Yeah, apparently Africa doesn't have real coffee. <laughs> it's my penis. <laughs> Just what it is. What are you doing? You're my pussy. And they, and they give each other and that they give look. her that stare yeah that look it's that look <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> that says this coffee needs some cream <laughs> <laughs> oh, my god <laughs> i brought you something from africa but i didn't get you anything oh wait i did <laughs> God. You have to imagine someone looked over that like several yeah. times. Yeah, this is fine. Yeah, that yeah. guy that looked over it probably fucks his sister. Yeah, <laughs> like, like, that, and that's why I say, like, at, at no point was anybody on the set, like, even the cameraman, the cameraman <laughs> had to slip a, a, a look at the director. And somebody <laughs> needed to look at that cameraman and say, this guy is the one paying oh the most God. attention. I am not having <laughs> Mr. Hash is like, well, zip. I guess it's only right. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're already this far. <laughs> we never see what he brought her. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's a dick in a box. <laughs> uh, we have a $100 donation from Ram 13. 
Glad to see y'all reach your goal, but didn't expect to end my night on an incest Folgers commercial. <laughs> Nobody does. So. <laughs> and uh, we got hey, a five dollar hey, donation these, from Agabula. These cups, these cups are a little close together, just like we are. <laughs> uh, Clark, do you mind uh, reading this donation comment real quick, uh, just so that we yeah. can um, make sure we don't forget about it? The sixth. Oh, the sixth sick chic sith sheep sick pad kid poured cord pork poured cold. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I was hoping he got one the, right in the middle the, there. The sixth sense <laughs> the sixth <laughs> The sixth sick uh Stella uh, uh sheeks still sheeps sick Pad kid poured. Oh, that's a curd. Curd pulled cold. Curd. Run, run, run. I, 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 I'm I, wondering how the hell you got Stella out of Sheik, but that's well, I, a discussion I'm listening. for another day. <laughs> yeah, I, well, well I, I'm, I, I don't have glasses, so. There we go, I got to check. Oh, one. okay. Do you need glasses? Uh, no. I do. I do. No, uh, like are so. you uh, nearsighted? Uh, I am. I'm some sort of sighted where I can't read things from far away. Some sort of sighted, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't fucking know. I just know I can't see really well, right? <laughs> um, hey, Greg or John, I've been writing during this entire stream, and I need a name for the princess's husband. Or I yeah, um, I'm putting you on the spot because my brain is tired. Well, I'm putting you on the spot because I'm tired. Do your fucking job. <laughs> uh, hold on. Hey, Greg, hold on. I've been I've been writing during this entire stream, and I need a name for the... Pr oh, so you're writing a story about a princess, and she's married. Oh. Yeah. Um, so the prince... What's the princess's name? Um, how about, I need the princess's name. How about Uglanda? Uh, uh, oh, I need a princess's name, and do they like each other, or do they not like each other? Yeah, is it a marriage or convenience that, or inconvenience? Yeah, like like, you know, if they if they're if they like each other, you get a cute name that goes with each other. They might be oh. brother and sister. Folgers. Oh my God, Maxwell and Folgers. <laughs> 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 there we go. Um, Brandy, 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 Brandy. Is it Brandy, Brandy? or Brand? Because sometimes uh, I'm never sure of the E. Is that's silent. the princess's name, so I think it would be Brandy, right? Or Bronde. Put a put a Maybe. put an accent over it and call it Bronde. Uh Bronde's got what plants crave. Uh uh hmm. how about Prince Ariana? Is Ariana Bronde? I uh Brandy. <laughs> yeah, like that. that was fucking bad. Von Von for Flirts beat me to it, <laughs> goddammit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I was gonna say trademark. I was gonna say Brandon like franchise, but like trademark um, works too. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it's it's <laughs> There you go. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, actually, uh, Angriest Pigeon, I think, is going to go with Brandon's trademark. <laughs> now, see, I, I would I would say that the uh, the princess never goes out because she's afraid of being noticed. Because her, her kingdom is very good with brand recognition. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the husband's name is Sponsor. That, yeah. yeah, there we give go. Me, give me brand and brand sponsor. And sponsor. Yes. I like it. Yeah, Albatross is completing a hole with three hits uh, less than par. Uh, so par five hole, par two shots, uh, or par. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's it's bogey, which is one hole, one shot over par. Uh, double bogey is two shots over par, and then three over par is either. Some people say triple bogey. Some people say albatross. That, so that always on, wait, 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 wait. Daniel yeah. Rotwin is saying albatross is three under. No, three over. Three no, over. He's par. saying. I, I don't fucking wait. play golf. I don't. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. It's like uh, Daniel. Yeah, now, Robert, I'm, now I'm lost. It's, wait, is it a double birdie is an eagle? Tri oh, a triple birdie, triple birdie is, okay, is an so albatross. It is, it is three under. Okay, am well, I fault? Are, these birds are fusing and becoming. Yeah. Uh, so different. so what is what is over? True. So tri triple bogey. What's the, is there a name for that? It's not a turkey, is it? Flamingo? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's flamingo, <laughs> baby. Let's go, let's go with flamingo. Emu. Is it emu? It's emu, isn't it? It's an emu. There you go. I think it is a turkey. No, turkey and, is. I mean, oh, it might Articuno. be. No, no, no. A, if it's a, a three over, three, strikes three over should not be Articuno. It should be Moltres. It should... <laughs> no, I like Just I like saying. emu. I like emu because uh, when you get a triple bogey, it's kind of like when you see an emu, where yeah, yeah. Uh, you can't believe what the hell is happening. 
<laughs> uh, plus three is just triple bogey. Yeah, that's what we were asking. We're not asking about three under. We're asking about three over. Yeah, three over. I, I wasn't sure. Yeah, so it's so a three over is just a triple bogey. There's not a word for it. There isn't. Yeah. A, there isn't a term for it's it. It's just bogey. Yeah, um, yeah, I mean, bogey. other than other than shitty golfer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, let's, let's face it. <laughs> You're not going to say, you're not going to go through the trouble of like, oh, oh no, a flamingo. You're going to go, God damn it. <laughs> yeah, turkey is bowling. <laughs> what, I'll play what, bowling before I play golf. So what's your handicap? Golf. Oh, with Dodo. Yeah, maybe it's a Dodo. Dodo? Like, plus 99 is a Dodo. <laughs> or a penguin. Yeah. Or a penguin. <laughs> penguin, yeah. Oh, a you know what? Bird. I was going to say, a penguin's good because that shit won't fly. Yeah, that, <laughs> that, that doesn't make sense. Uh, we got a $5 donation from Calico Plus. Lacking sleep? Me too. But that's not going to from having breakfast. What are you guys' ideal breakfast? Uh, An ideal breakfast? I mean, oh. the classic. Come on, pancakes, pancakes, bacon, yeah, pancakes, bacon, eggs. Yes. Yeah, so, I mean, my uh, ideal meth. breakfast is like an eggs benedict. I don't know how fancy you yeah. want me to get. Meth. I ain't gonna make that myself, but. <laughs> oh, yeah, because yeah, the question is ideal breakfast. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah, a uh, stack of pancakes with uh, some scrambled eggs, uh, four slices of bacon, uh, some hash browns, <laughs> and uh, some toast. Yes, yeah. four slices of bacon and then 12 more. Yeah. <laughs> we call that a plus 12 bogey. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> or, or an ostrich. Or an ostrich, will. yeah. Maybe, Maybe an somebody asked about ostrich. ostrich. I'm not sure. Salty stick, we'll call it, we'll call it that. And, oh, in a, in a tall, cold glass of orange juice, baby. Oh, yeah. yeah. We're, we're oh, my God. Minute With minute. all the pulp in it. Yeah, okay, never mind. Now you lost me. <laughs> That's why I say because okay, I, no. I'm, uh, pulp is my, uh, pulp is my pineapple on pizza. Uh, orange juice with pulp is that thing that I like, that I know that most people don't like. I'm almost there. I have zero lives and I have zero health, but I'm almost here to the end. I accidentally started a maze. So. <laughs> Meta no! What if T Rex is? What if T Rex is actually went honk? There's no scientific evidence to say that they right. didn't. Theory theater on. Ooh, that's more. Yeah. It's fucking six thirty in the morning on a Sunday. Where the hell are you going? Church. <laughs> like. <laughs> okay, I guess so. That makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> time is uh, what time is it now? It's uh, six twenty nine. Time is church. Six thirty. Jesus. <laughs> What's the most gruesome was... scene in a movie you guys remember? Uh, the well, John Carpenter's the thing immediately comes to mind. Yeah, have you guys ever seen um Pan's Labyrinth? <clears throat> uh, no, not uh, that, recently. Yeah, no. uh, oh, wait, the, Guillermo del Toro. No, they, um, there's literally one a scene where guys, thing? yeah, yeah, uh, I think, um, no, no, I remember, I'm, I'm trying to remember which, I think it was the second Fly movie. Oh. Um, with Jeff where Gordon? no, no, Jekyll was the first one. Oh. Um, the second fly movie where uh, it, it, the, the guy was more of a protagonist and rather antagonist than Jeff Goldblum's fly was. Son of uh, the fly, but I remember, was it just no, I think it was just called the fly, too. Oh, okay. Um, I think there was, I think there was a fly, too, and then there was a son of the fly. Yeah, uh, there is a scene where uh, because I think of like some, uh, some genetic mishap, he starts like transforming into the fly, but he's, he's obviously like still like. Uh, like a hero of some sort mm -hmm. uh and so like there's a scar that's i think getting in his way uh and as a defense mechanism he spits the acid on the guy's face and the guy's face just fucking melts off like it's straight out of mortal combat but it's like the detail was so gruesome like it, like it's because it, it's all visual effects like there's no cgi yeah. like it is all practical and visual effects but like the detail is fucking gruesome to the point. It's like, oh my god uh, yeah, that's I, I, probably one of the most Christian things I've ever seen. I feel like it's a meme at this point, and it's just kind of funny, but I, I honestly think it is pretty brutal. I don't know if it's the the worst, um, but it's probably one of the first things that comes to mind is uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark, when the guy got the dust oh, yeah. in his feet. Yeah. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, uh, that, that, yeah the Ark of the Covenant. Yeah, the, the way that they did it, uh, like... It, you see like how the whole scene was done and then you you see it play out and it's like 
at this point we watch it and we're like, oh, you know, it's a visual effect. It's funny. It's been memed a bunch of times. Mm -hmm. But when you think about what's actually happening, like, oh my god, some energy is is literally your your skin and your flesh is melting off of your face. Mm -hmm. I. I wanted to, first off, I want to appreciate the made up subtitles for the second fly moving in Twitch chat going on right now. Uh, there's fly two, there's another one. <laughs> fly oh two, uh, fly versus SWAT, the fly two electric zap blue, and my favorite fly two dissing your fly girl. Yeah, that's my Which favorite one. Sense in the context of that movie, because it's his girlfriend that's being attacked uh, while <laughs> he is defending himself. So that subtitle actually does make sense yeah, that works. i like fly versus swat also that's pretty good <laughs> that's for fly too there's another one yeah. i'm not sure if i have to go to the bathroom it's all good <laughs> if you have to go you gotta go no but that's the thing i'm not sure oh, okay yeah i'm sorry if you can hear him snoring i mean there's nothing we can do about that because that motherfucker <laughs> decided to sleep right next to the mic <laughs> <laughs> He's on the couch over there. I guess it's just loud. Yeah, I know. Why don't you get the air horn? Fucking freak him out. That'd be the ultimate karma. Yeah. I, I don't know why I thought you. Would, I still thought you were gonna say caramel, but you didn't. I'm oh. happy for you. <laughs> uh, yeah, but, uh, there is a, an alternate universe where I can catch up to King K because he stuck on this boss. Yeah. <laughs> good, good luck getting past the boss yourself. Watch me get it on the first try if I get that far. Uh, I'm gonna say this, and I don't mean to put you on the spot. If I am, uh, TC Chain says, guys, I don't think Clark actually likes this. Just a feeling. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, think, I, I don't think so either, but it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like that Clark's like, I don't think Clark likes this either. <laughs> Clark, have you played Pac-Man? I, I love Pac-Man World as a kid, and I I just remembered good things about it. Those things I right. remembered were not good. <laughs> it's, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> but that was a long time ago. It's all good. I remember being bad at playing this. Oh, I'm But terrible. I was good at turning it off. I think Greg and me are on the same wavelength. <laughs> I just decided to do this because, like, um, for the stream, because I guess I always do the free roaming 3D stuff for this. So, oh, my God. And my dad loved this game. I just don't know. I think it's just because I'm bad, but it's all good. It's all right. I mean, listen, you don't have to be good at video games to enjoy them. I, I, I know that that's, no, that's not weird. how it works at all. <laughs> weird take, but you need to be fucking perfect. Yes. <laughs> if you're not good, you're not having a good Shut time. Shut up, you, you piece of shit. You, you, you died. You just don't get the intricacies. That sounds like loser yeah, talk to me. <laughs> of this remarkable video game masterpiece? This game isn't stupid. You're stupid. <laughs> oh, you fucker. Damn it. Oh, man. Uh, oh, where, does, where does Silver come from? Uh, Silver's been a part of my gamer tag for... Ah. When, when was... When was... I introduced Silver, Jesus, in Warcraft, uh, World of Warcraft. My mm -hmm. character was Silver Sin. Um, before that, my char my characters were always Ben Richards, mm -hmm. uh, it's a butcher of Bakersfield. Uh, so then I that's a Running Man reference, right? That's that's Running Man. Uh, okay. He was he was Ben Richards in the movie. He was the butcher of Bakersfield. Um, part of the reason was uh, when I when I started playing Halo. Uh, I love the shotgun, and I love running around, surprising people, shooting them in the face, and continuously running. Because uh, <laughs> Halo wasn't a very stealth-oriented game, so there was a lot. You were very actively visible a lot of the time. So my plan was run around and shoot people in the face. And so it was like, oh, I got to be the running man. Uh, so I tried to name it Butcher of Bakersfield, but it didn't work. It was way too long. So I just named him Ben Richards, which is his character in the movie mm -hmm. uh, and the story. Uh, so when I went to Warcraft, I was going to do Ben Richards. And oh, I was like, no, no, let me do something a little bit different. Uh, so I wanted to have a cool, edgy name, like not super edgy and not like what was the what was the uh, we came up with an edgy name for me one time. It was like uh, XXX Blood Sin 420. Jesus XX. Christ. 
Like something stupid, right? Like oh, ridiculous. You know it's edgy when there's three X's. Yeah, right? <laughs> I and, 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 Linkin and, Park who's not in my ears right now. Uh, 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 Bob X 2005 all over the again. Middle <laughs> X has to be lowercase. Uh, the middle X has to be lowercase. Uh, blood was B L U D S Y. No, uh, yeah, uh, S Y N. So it was blood sin. Uh, no, was it was it 420 or was it 69? I think we came up with blood sin 69. Why not both? Yeah, why not both? Uh, <laughs> and then it was uh, two underscores, three more X. Uh, again, middle X, lowercase. Uh, we, if we did that, it's fun. That was, that was a goofy thing we did like last year. Uh, but I wanted to have something a little, you know, a little different. Uh, so I was going to do Silver Wing. Uh, and then but Silver Wing's actually a faction in the game. So it wouldn't let me name my character Silver Wing or somebody already had that name. Uh, so I was going through different things. I was like, Silver Sin, that sounds kind of cool. So I did Silver Sin with the Y in Sin. Uh, and that was my character for four years. Uh, and then ever since then, uh, Silver Sin usually was my character. Uh, eventually I dropped Sin and then I just started going with some variation of Silver. Uh, one, of my, one of my fantasy star characters was uh, Silver Sapphire. Uh, I was I love I love I don't cool sounding names you know it's a, not not as edgy but like that. Oh, I beat the game. You did? Uh, okay. Yeah. I usually won this, guys. Oh, the <laughs> <laughs> but my golf rules that he hit. <laughs> <laughs> already beat it. This was the second loop. Yeah, this is my second loop, y'all. Clark's free. <laughs> I'm so sorry if I sounded annoyed. I still like the game. And to a lesser extent, so are we. Yeah. <laughs> How long was I on that boss? Was like was it like an hour? I don't know. Good I've God. never beaten it. <laughs> Alright, so I should probably wake up Ben then for the next game. Yeah, please get that up. Yeah. Uh Ben. No. Uh Jack Ben World 2 is done. Uh, okay, if you've got morning wood, please don't deal with it on the uh, stream. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, no, 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 no. Hold it. <laughs> no, don't Taco. hold it at all. Taco, uh, he's just getting up. <laughs> what so, I'm saying. Uh, are the dogs people or are the people dogs? Both? <laughs> um, yeah, both. Oh, and hello. And the dogs are the only ones not wearing shoes. <laughs> no, not at all. Yeah, by the way, Kelly's back. Uh, for yeah, right. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Like, hi, oh, everyone. Hi. Nora, <laughs> because apparently every girl is Nora. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think Nora. I was just like, wow, Ben, you. This is is this like a Ronma situation? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you take a shower? Take your weird you dog with you. With no <laughs> shoes. Hit the road. <laughs> Damn, that's good content. They'll never know. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, so, so the. You want to count him in? Even though he's playing by himself? Yeah, sure. I'll do it. Uh, five. 72. Four, three, 71. Two. 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 <laughs> zero. Go. Did someone say cake? So they let Pac-Man speak in this. Is... Yeah, it's weird. I'm scared. I'm just surprised they don't have children. <laughs> that's a that's a logistics conversation we should probably not have on stream. You know, Pac-Man's Pac dialogue in this game. I don't really like this game, but his dialogue is really funny, actually. So could you imagine a, a Ghostbusters crossover where they meet Pac-Man? I mean, they are ghosts, the right? Yeah, because like, they're after the same ghosts. That would be amazing. I kind of like it. Like I, I like that idea. As as, but Pac Man is a is a spirit, mm -hmm. but he hunts other Happy ghosts. Birthday, dear. Uh, hoping that if he catches enough ghosts, he'll get into heaven. So he's kind of like Constantine, only with more smoking. That's deep. That's really. Deep. <laughs> <laughs> it's these ghosts, they change a man. Change you. I've seen things. Horrible things. I've looked under the sheet of a ghost and saw the evil stare back at me. They make you blink. They make you inky. They make you pinky. And they make you Ron. 
What, what's the other guy's name? <laughs> Ron. <laughs> <Yeah>. Ron. <laughs> I'm Blinky. Ron Pinky. Ah, Pinky. Ron. <laughs> Was their naming guy just out that day? Like, it's a, I, I, because <laughs> now I'm picturing the three ghosts Man. and then the fourth ghost, but like, he, you can see his legs under the sheet. It's clearly just a guy that needed a job, and they were like, he's like, I'm a ghost. He's doing his best. He's still in training. That what, yeah, what, yeah, what a small like what a small small universe the Star Wars universe. Yeah, everybody. <laughs> There's like eight Jedi and that's it. Over. And they're all related to each other. Yeah, yeah. everybody. So for, well, for, that's reason, I'm, for some reason, I'm just thinking of the Folgers incest commercial again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Maxi uh, Big the Force. Yeah. I didn't even believe it when I first heard it. Ancestry.com. <laughs> yeah. My ancestry. I'm a third generation Sith Lord. <laughs> Uh, five dollars from flowers, dang it. Uh, hello, Mr. Johnny and friends. I kind of feel that I kind of need to eat before I become a skeleton and melt into the floor. But before I do, could Johnny in any voice please recite, not sing, some of the lyrics to, to oh, I have, um, oh, I know what he's talking about. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, a dramatic reading. No, it is. Uh, so a couple of weeks ago. Uh, because I, I I got some plans for next year. I was I was looking up uh, to see if there was any sort of Tales doll plush I can buy for like Amazon. So I type in Tales doll on Amazon, uh, <laughs> and what I find instead is a rap album with my face on it, uh, and it was called uh, uh, Tales doll Sick Muppet by Some Call to Wan. And it was kind of like my Mr. Sparkle moment because what the hell am I doing on a rap album cover? And then I find out it's like some dude that like took <laughs> random bits of my reviews and mixed them into a rap album. Whoa. I didn't That's listen to it because I, 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 I wasn't really interested in it really. But, uh, it's kind of flattering until you realize he kept it from you. Yeah, I know. It's like he didn't pay for the licensing for my face. It's kind of it's like weird. It's kind of weird and illegal if he starts making a profit off of it. I'm just saying. <laughs> Buy Raycons or Parish. <laughs> uh, uh, so, wait, so this is transcribed. Uh, transcribed yeah, right? to the best of my ability uh, in any voice. Um, I'm, 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 this is pretty deep right now. So this is like uh, Vaporwave, but with like yeah, streamers. Exactly. Yeah. I'm going to add a little grain I to guess, it. Lo fi um, album. Guess, Yes. I guess uh, I'll do more than three. Go to <laughs> I'm going to dance like I'm Russian. Big, bad, from the sad elbow or something. What <laughs> is in the eye? <laughs> there lies the button. Pinocchio, well, Hansel, Hansel with German. Is there a button you haven't used on that soundboard yet, Ben? Right, uh, <laughs> plenty. Knives in the eye. This toy is a clutter. With filling your low ah, energy. It's a bummer. These are, I guess, these are just lyrics interpreted by the dude that's under the. Oh, way. okay. One camp would lick along with a lumber. I used to impersonate Donald Glover. Hansel <laughs> <laughs> in the clouds, because I love this lumber. I'm going to take a nap. Goodbye. But it's Tails Doll times two. Oh, I'm sorry to say that twice now. Hmm. But it's Tails Doll. Standing six <laughs> feet tall. Standing six feet tall. I uh, get that somehow. Tell me when you're done, because I uh, have, it's uh, over. You, you know that? <laughs> yeah. Is it what are what are the possibilities that the person who asked you to do this is the guy that is made the guy the album that made the album? And he yeah. Needs the lyrics for oh, new songs. Know. Yeah, I know. I just got boozled. Double creep. <laughs> Maybe I'm not sure. Uh, Seventeen dollars from uh, Neil Page. I'm trying to get home to my family for Thanksgiving and have exhausted all my funds. So I donate seventeen dollars and a hell of a nice watch. That's a cas. Uh, is it? Uh, he has two dollars and and a Casio. Casio. I've been wearing yes. the same underwear since Tuesday. <laughs> that is uh, a let me planes, that, trains, and automobiles. Planes, trains, yeah, automobiles. that is a that is my go-to Thanksgiving movie. Uh, mm -hmm. playing, that is on. the only Thanksgiving movie. Yeah, uh, I will yeah. always make sure that it's on when I'm visiting the family for the holidays. Are, uh, are there any other Thanksgiving movies? Thanksgiving like, specifically? 
Yeah, because um, I know Adam's Family Values has a Thanksgiving scene, but that's what not was a Thanksgiving that movie? movie. Maybe someone can remember this. Are, are uh, we counting technical Thanksgiving movies? <laughs> like, like, well, like Bill, Bill as this, a Thanksgiving movie. There was this when, movie with um, fucking Ed O'Neill, and he was picking up Dutch. Was it Dutch? Was it's Dutch called, Thanksgiving? It's called Dutch. He was. I don't remember was if it was Christmas Thanksgiving. Or Thanksgiving. He was. Tr- he he. The his new stepson basically. Yeah. Was supposed to come home from college, but he was one of these rich, spoiled, entitled kids. So he decided that instead of paying to have him fly home, he would go and pick him up, and then the trip back would be their chance to know each other. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. And the, and the kid was, you know, he was a shit. So. Uh, <laughs> And, and that was the movie, but but like he he was an ass, but Ed O'Neill was basically Al Bundy. Yeah. So he didn't put up with his crap. Like the kid said, he didn't want anything from him, but he had his wallet stolen or something. So when they go for breakfast, he doesn't buy the kid any food. <laughs> and like he basically just teaches them. Yeah, it was called it was called Dutch. Okay, I wasn't sure what holidays Dutch was because I, I used to watch Dutch a lot uh, growing up. Uh, but playing Strange Automobiles is still my favorite Thanksgiving movie. Uh, in terms of and other I, like movies, in and I think we're doing a thing with that this week, are we not, Clark? Uh, yeah, we're doing a commentary for that on the PJN uh, Campbell Network. Yeah, it's gonna mm. be fun. It's a Friday night. Uh, yeah, I'll, uh, more info on that soon. But yeah, cool, cool. <laughs> um, real yeah, quick, uh, there weren't uh, any Thanksgiving movies. I think. Um, we'll go back to them. Let me read yeah. uh, the Panini lyrics as I think it was the movie. Uh, yeah, in my Luigi voice. Okay, so it's a little weird. Thing. Ah, Panini. Don't you be a meanie. Thought you wanted me to go up? Why are you trying to keep me teeny? Uh, Adam's Family Values, isn't, it, it does focus on a family reunion for the Thanksgiving holiday. I suppose so, yeah. Anyway, yeah. it's a dreamy. Wished it on the genie. I got fans, finally. Uh, Ain't you wanting to see them to me? What? I thought you want this for my life. <laughs> for my life. That's what I said. Say what you wanted me to thrive. You lied. Why did you do that? Just say to me what you want from me. Just say to me what you want from me. I'm repeating myself because you're not listening to me. Hi, <laughs> Benini. Don't you be a meanie. Thought you wanted me to go up. Why? It's already repeating. <laughs> now they need me. Number one on streaming. Oh, yeah. You used to love me. So what happened? What's the meaning? I thought you wanted this for my life. For my life, <laughs> said you wanted to see me thrive. Yeah, it sounds like he's like repeating himself because the girl it's like a, says what on the phone. <laughs> now yeah, when it's all done, I get the upper hand. I need a big Benz, not another fan. But I still want you as a fan, even though I just said I don't want another fan. I still want you as a fan. I'm gonna need to sit down. Don't mean to make more demands, but I need you to. It just cuts off. <laughs> Say to me what you want from me. Just say to me. So I needed what you want to for me. come. And that's it. <laughs> All right. I got a couple things that are in chat I would like to address. So one, is Goofy Movie a Thanksgiving movie? Or did someone just bring that up for no reason? Is Goofy? Goofy no, I don't think. No, no Goofy wasn't a movie. Thanksgiving movie. It's no, Goofy it's movie? Yeah, I don't no. think so. No, no. It was just a, okay. it was just a family Next trip. Next up, a lot <laughs> yeah. of folks are mentioning Charlie Brown Thanksgiving. Well, that is my favorite of like the three holiday trio. That's more of like a TV special than a movie. Only yeah, that's not a movie. It, it's only agree. yeah, it's only like 20, 25 minutes. And on YouTube, yeah. Tat Shin Computer Monster says he wants to watch Poultry Geist for Thanksgiving. <laughs> poultry Geist. <laughs> See, I would think that's more of a Halloween going into Thanksgiving uh, movie. Ye but, uh, be not turkeys, but be ye. Um. I don't know if anybody is familiar with it. Uh, I heard Dark Forces was actually pretty good, but I never tried that out. Rebel Assault was okay. Uh, that was on Sega CD and I think P- Oh so, my god. Uh, in in my half-conscious delirium, I have canceled my save file accidentally, and I don't know what the fuck just happened. But uh, it is what? now at the beginning. Yeah, we were and wondering. I, I would, what the hell? I, I thought know. you were pause it because i am half dead right now i would pause it that we should just not do this i, I thought you were like from it. i i thought you were safe scumming 
Well, I'm, I'm like, be, okay, but I'm, he's not restarting. I'll be honest. I was like half almost falling asleep, so I couldn't even see what the menu presses were. No. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> All right, time to play some Pac Man World 3. <laughs> Let's give him yay. I'm going to need to leave because I think I'm not alive anymore. No, you're not. You died like five hours ago. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Oh God! These nerds are talking Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for Save joining me. us. KK, Save me. <laughs> yeah. Us yeah, fun. KK, you were a King. trooper, dude, and you, you are yeah, welcome man. back to any stream we do in the future. Seriously, um, uh, I, I, for so twenty-one hours. Like, yeah, uh, thank yeah. you very much, man. Yeah. Impressive. Hanging really in there. Fun time. Race and just like totally. having fun. Oh, I hope you have fun yeah. anyway. I'm not sure, yeah. <laughs> but uh. Reapers from Mass Effect. They're good. The Romulan um, episodes are good. Romulan's really good. Um, so the, and um, uh, the I forgot what season it was, but uh, what was the guy's name? The one of the Cardassians uh, that ki- uh, they 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 take uh, uh, Picard as a prisoner of war. The and, one? Like, they they torture him. They, they torture him. Uh, the the main guy. Oh, I know. There are four, four lights. lights. Yeah. That, uh, God, I don't remember who that was. I, I'll be honest, I don't remember that one. I like, I remember the episode. I don't remember the guy. No, not the Kardashians. The Kardashians. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know. I do that too. Like it. Like I. I like sort of low key think about that when oh, I hear that. We captured Captain Picard. That's <laughs> hot. Oh my god, his ship is on fleek. <laughs> Uh, they crossed the neutral zone. Not supposed oh, to do that. No. <laughs> I don't even know if that's what the Kardashians sound like. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> it's, it's, Man, when you say Kardashians, that's the voice in my head. <laughs> like the Kardashians? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is my friend. Her friend is Jim Hadar. You were supposed to cross the neutral zone. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, Joan, you ready to go? What mode are we doing? I Kanye I'll... West, his arms oh, wide. I <laughs> oh, I guess. Uh... Uh, Gotta press Four start. Uh, which, which one? Oh. Uh, five minutes or ten minutes? Five. Okay. That's the, Three, that was the two, most dramatic. One, go. That was and the most dramatic the menu countdown. Oh Look, my god, damn do it. it. All right, just do normal. Yeah, normal. Uh, uh, this is a fantastic mess. Yeah, that's all Three, good. two, one, go. Oh my god. Just a start. Why do, the, <laughs> why do the games look different? I'm a little torn here. Do what do you mean? Chat, chat. I need your help, chat. Oh, do we tell them there's no game audio coming through? <laughs> or do oh, we let it. them continue to play the game as is? Like I yeah I'm like I mean, I'm and treat like this game. treat this like some sort of dramatic reading. Uh, yeah, if like a, no a, game audio was coming. A reenactment. Oh god, oh, crap. Clark, we know there's no game audio. Uh, I we just went through that. Oh, okay. I didn't say I didn't like it. Did you say he's not eating an owl? No. We already got over the carpet munching part of the stream. <laughs> you got over it. Yeah. <laughs> Speak for yourself, <laughs> motherfucker. I'm still there. He's a vigilante, so he might be Batman in disguise. Pac-Man's a Florida man. He's just running around, taking pills, chasing ghosts, and nothing but his shoes. <laughs> <laughs> and what he sees might not necessarily be what we see. <laughs> <laughs> Quintessential Florida man. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is Florida man to a T. <laughs> Possibly wearing a T. We would hope. God, I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> with, with Florida man, that's not a guarantee. Uh, so you get a guarantee. Mmm, baby. Mmm. Oh, yeah. No. So the Clark no. Those sphinxes looks like they, um, Pac-Man or Kool-Aid Man. I still think they do. They're sphinxes. You look like Kool-Aid Man with a sphinx. Oh, well. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, oh, I beat Johnny. Wow. Uh, what would you score? Like 1.9 million. There's like 100,000 oh, nice. points to you. Good job. Cool. That's how many times we asked you where the fucking music was. <laughs> 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 fucking <laughs> 
<laughs> gonna, gonna sit here with my mic muted. You can tell <laughs> that we are close to the 24 hour mark. <laughs> you fucking piece of shit. Getting a tad slap happy. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to share on Facebook. Let me go back to the menu. No, share on Facebook. <laughs> Why is it like one of the first options in the problems in the bottom? Like Answer. share on Facebook. There we go. And like you can't... Tell all of your friends you've been playing Pac-Man for 24 hours. <laughs> well, here's the thing. It and, opened uh, it and like the link was dead because like he don't support it anymore. And uh, I don't want to get yelled at, but uh, why aren't we sharing on Facebook? <laughs> <laughs> don't yell at me. Della Clark. What's the lower one? <laughs> <laughs> oh got my no scrope, Pac Man. <laughs> the matter, Pac Man. You got no scrope. So, like, is that referring to a scrotum in the context of the movie? I guess. It's because she grabs him chicken, by the balls. Not a scrotum. Yeah, she remember she grabs him by the balls. Oh yeah, I I, I know. I love Back to the Future too. <laughs> it just seems like a very like. Risk a thing for the eighties. Hey, got you by the scrotum. them. Enjoy. Well, it's it's not the eighties. It's twenty fifteen. Exactly. They're all Vine stars. Oh, well, you know. What I mean. <laughs> the sequel that's better than the first movie is Back to the Future Two. I would no, disagree, it's not better than the but... first one, but I still love nah. two. What I thought it was. Sorry, I got my buttons now, so I'm happy again. <laughs> They're like choppy, but they are there. Yeah, they're the quality's a little weird on them. That's okay. Yeah. Ribs though. Well, thank you rib. for having the cheap stream deck. Well, I can't help it. <laughs> At least I've got music on my stream. <laughs> Should we ask him again? <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> so I have a question. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, go, yeah, go oh man. Why do you say things that you know will hurt me? <laughs> oh, I got my button back. Oh. <laughs> Daddy's got his buttons back. And let me tell you something. Daddy <laughs> is happy. Daddy has a little bit rate. Well, daddy has music. Yeah. <laughs> daddy also doesn't crash every three hours. <laughs> well, no, he just knocks out his whole computer. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to fucking get through that. Who the fuck just hit somebody? No, that was a sound clip. Oh, that That's was a sound, sound clip. clip. Okay, yeah. Uh, no, I meant like I thought that was in the game for a second. What are we like? So, how could that be? I know. Give it to me, Chandler. I want it all. <laughs> 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 Yellow. So join us. Good morning, everybody. It's the Mad Hatter Macy. Hello, hello. Any of you uh, see the 1994 Energizer Bunny Star Wars commercial? Yes, where Darth Vader gets defeated by the bunny because the lightsaber ran out of batteries. And I shit you not, his scream is <laughs> much better than. Yep, yeah. There's a, there's an Energizer Bunny like commercial series where he goes into classic movies and fucks shit up. He did it to King Kong. <laughs> he did it to Frankenstein. It's great. Uh, it was all back in 1993, and this is the one that he did with uh, Darth Vader. And uh, yeah, he fucks shit up with Vader, and Vader got a taste of that bunny. But yeah, still a better ending than the ninth. <laughs> <laughs> Peter Cottontail. Why do you say things that you know will hurt me? <laughs> <laughs> Where is that from? <laughs> okay, that is probably one of the most obscure references. It's from Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> no. That, <laughs> the, the one before it. One um, man of white attacks. From the Dilbert. 
<laughs> We've had our wife's had enough. <laughs> yeah, that's piece from, of shit. That, that's I'm sick point. of your shit, Pat. This hey, time, Vin, turn the damn letters yourself, pools. damn it. You can touch the stupid letter screens. <laughs> See? I'm sick of it. <laughs> <laughs> Are you like you piece of shit? Anna White doesn't have to take your garbage anymore. <laughs> I just make stream deck noises. Just pay Pac Man Fever for the last two hours. This is pretty much where I'm at right now. Don't make me do stuff. <laughs> Why don't you guys just play Pac Man Fever for like the last two hours? I can't hear you. The, will Pac-Man Fever last two hours? I don't know. It's like a no. Month. We're not playing that for two hours. Yeah. It's not. Well, that's not a. <laughs> There's still more games Johnny and I can play. It's just more that like we're getting burned out. Yeah. Yeah. Did you guys like, ever finish Pac-Man too? Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't make me do stuff. None of your damn business, and I'll thank you to stay I, out. Of uh, wait, oh, maybe man. give me, give me, give me a few minutes. Um, let me see if I can get Pac-Man running again. Yeah, oh running? yes. Yeah, because we never did Pac-Land. Uh, Pac-Land yeah. wasn't working with Retro Arc. Do you want to just? Get... It's Arch. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. What did you, What did you say? Who said that? Sounds like an asshole. Um, oh, no, it's Ben. Okay. Shoe furniture food. Damn, it doesn't even tell you which building has the most windows. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Thank you. Uh, C. What? The... Oh yeah, C. Meaning yeah. Oh. The problem is that A, B, I'm not sure which buttons are mapped to A, B, and C. Oh, I know. Okay. <laughs> which is the completed figure. Uh, oh, okay. okay, so A is B. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, okay. It's like I, I that think millionaire scenario they were talking about last night. What system was this out on originally? This well, is an arcade game. Oh, okay. Did that say correct? Because that literally wasn't correct. Dude, that okay, silhouette is terrifying. Look at those fucking solid finger fingers that he's rocking in that silhouette. I, I think I would want my money back if I was putting quarters in this machine. Yeah, people paid to play this. <laughs> no, you know this what? It's like an Atari game. You keep the quarter, I'll take it as a life lesson. Why is that pack running behind the hill? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's the mood. Uh, what what other games are left? I can, make, games are... I can make Clark play the 2600 version. Oh, yeah, we got the only main layouts <laughs> for that. So here's what happened. Oh, we okay, what attempted happened? to oh. mod my Atari for a composite video. Right. We could not find the schematic for my specific revision, so we did the best we could. The video works, but all the sprites are stuck in one corner of the screen. So the ghosts in the pac man never move from where they are. Yeah. It's so funny. <sighs> It's subpar smash, but one series at a time. So, what, so what's next year's thing going to be? Uh, Metal Gear, Zelda, Kirby. Hey, John, John, John. Hey, John. Ted wants to know when you're going to do the Kirby Marathon. I'm sorry. That's all I got. Uh, and so is, so is this donation. So see you next not November. November. <laughs> uh, and that put us over 10. Yes, it's 11. Days. It's that is no. Time. That is eleven thousand twenty-four dollars for no, extra no. life game yeah. day. We did. Yeah. Hi, Jim. Are you excited? <laughs> I remember way back in the day. I think it was an episode of um, Icons or something like that on like the original G Four before the Tech TV merger, where they did like a documentary on Pac Man, and this was like, covered extensively and talking about the the severe disappointment that this game was. For all the people who were so hype on on arcade on the arcade game itself and on arcade games in general, who wanted to bring that experience home, yeah. and then and then this comes up. And you get this. Yeah. this was, it's this just was a, thing a bigger Oh my god. Yeah, like this this game is struggling just to load the ghost. That's why I'm gonna assume. It's the not ghost that it's struggling. It's just a limit. No. It's a sprite limit. Yeah. I can't yeah, play it, anymore, it, but it's too. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah, because I'd imagine like if it's, if you're if you're like my eyes are literally watering. Oh my god! You all sound like you're running out of steam. I am out of steam. And I'm 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 Everybody. barely fucking awake, dude. Like all the energy drop. Oh like, yeah. Wow. That's the way. 
Uh, I'm used to being up this early, so even though I've been up all night, this is like you're within your circadian like, rhythm, tired. I guess. Yeah, I'm tired, but if if I lay down and intended to go to sleep, I would probably go to sleep for an hour and then just wake up. I haven't crashed at all. Like I have not fallen asleep at all during this whole thing. I've been up for over 24 hours. At this well, point. you can't um, complain because you did have access to your bed this time. Yeah, but uh, also you were already asleep, and you're also in charge of the stream. So if I were to fall asleep and you were asleep, and everything went foobar, who's doing what? If I'm yeah, asleep, well, I mean, so, you're fuck up. Up and who's boom. driving the car? <laughs> exactly. So I I felt I couldn't fall asleep because then who's gonna take care of the stream? So that's where uh, that takes me back. But uh, what the hell is a board game version of Pac-Man? You never seen it? No. I think they sell it, it now at Target. Yeah, I, I was gonna probably pick it up, and I'm like, nah, because I gotta get rid of my board games anyway, so. I'm yeah, just trying to figure like out how cool I'm gonna have around, but like, they never get played. I, I mean, they're never gonna get played with me. I don't have anybody to play them with. Sorry, sorry for the sad. Sad, sad story. <laughs> uh, man, I need like a sitcom. Aww, on the soundboard. Uh, okay. oh, the, incre I, I, uh, the Incredible I Hulk theme. Bounce together yet? Do, 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 do. Oh wait, there you go. <laughs> I yeah. heard half of it. Yeah, I have a bunch of stuff, but just like I look at it. No. So, solo ticket to ride probably isn't the most fun game. Okay, that's Miss Pac Man for the Atari 2600. I don't even know if Solo Settlers of Catan is even worth it. Or even possible. Like a shooter to ride. I've got Mousetrap. That's just fun to build the board. Yeah, I never actually played the game. <laughs> Did anyone kind of, actually play the game? I never. I don't think I've ever played the game. I just built the contraption and yeah, like, like watching it move. I gonna... played it like once or twice as a kid, just just to say that I played it for my volunteer ship. Can I get a voice request for Johnny doing Luigi telling Mario to go to the store after eating all the snacks? Is it a fetish? Uh, do you want to do that or? I need you to say this specifically. Come on, go please. Laugh, please. I'm already, I'm already fucking stiff. Uh, uh, can I get voice requests for Johnny? For Johnny? Wait, some people are saying Wonder Bread guy. I have no idea what that is. I like, don't know what Wonder Bread guy is. I know what Wonder Bread is. Uh, Sink Weaver donates twenty five dollars. It says, "Congrats on making your goal and playing nothing but Pac Man for over twenty hours. Make sure you all get some rest after this." No, I won't. This is I you. don't think they have a choice. I'm pretty. Yeah. Don't make me do stuff. <laughs> You're all gonna crash. Uh, Fifty dollars from Hawk Goggles. I don't think I'm buying a game this month, so take this donation. Question. How much packs could a Pac-Man pack if a Pac-Man could pack packs? Waka waka. <laughs> uh -huh, that's not an answer. <laughs> uh, I'll have Clark read that. Yeah, Clark passed away on the couch. You passed away? You mean... <laughs> <laughs> I love money. I mean, I get what you're referencing, but it's like, yeah. <laughs> okay, so Wonder Bread Guy is a guy on the on DeviantArt Commission who commissions tons of white... Oh, I know what this is. <laughs> yeah, he's known as Wonder Bread Guy. No, <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. Who... I have seen this before. Okay. Oh, All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was this uh it was this dude's fetish about getting fucking commissions about rich white ladies buying Wonder Bread and cutting down for why cutting down forces? I don't get that fucking part. <laughs> but uh no, let's never speak of it again. <laughs> I this is like this is like the third time like in my life that this is brought up. Yeah, I know, like, but it's like best way to forget. But then he's brought up again. Yeah, he's just, like he just keeps sneaking back. It's like a fucking herpes. <laughs> he just doesn't God. leave. This looks like... Here, I only play. knew because it's not the first time I've heard of it. And right, I'll play this. I don't know. I got really weird friends. This must be one of those things that's funny when you're younger. Maybe. 
as I'm looking at pictures and it's like, uh, I, okay. I just like, I'm listen, I've, I, I've seen many specific fetishes in my life. I've been well, like drawn art yourself. of those fetishes. Like, well, no, it's more like, like I, I, I went into this before, but I went back, especially back in college. I used to draw some of that shit just to make money uh, because I had no job. I was a broke college student, but women buying wonder bread. I don't fucking see it. Like, I'm sorry. Like, and I'm not even sure if I'm kink shaming. I just don't fucking understand it. Oh, hey, crap. Damn right. I can. I can <laughs> Where'd all the Wonder Bread go? I can glean some sort of logic out of it, but what sort of logic? The the logic is that they are rich, okay. so they are like slumming it by buying a cheap product. I mean, first of all, they're they're shopping themselves, right? Like, like yes rich rich woman like that probably has people that do that stuff so the fact that she's at the supermarket buying it herself she's like slumming it there, there's this there's this uh there's this fetish not see i don't know if i call it a fetish because fetish is always uh sexual uh but this this concept about seeing rich people do poor things. normal people things you know what i mean like like the the idea of like the the rich guy you know like the generic rich guy he's got the vest and and he's got the monocle <laughs> right? he's super rich but he's sitting at jiffy lube getting his oil changed yeah. right <laughs> weird sort of aesthetic about it where it, it's just it it sort of chews the scenery in a way if that's the right term like it's it's completely uh, awkward to to what you would normally see uh so maybe there is a sexual component behind seeing a woman do it uh, like a rich woman at the supermarket, you know, for a guy to look at that, like, oh, that's, that's, for gold. you know, maybe. Uh, it's all, if you had to ask whether or not you leave this moment in, I think the, I think we're answering the question for you, but yeah, leave it in. Yeah. Uh, you know, may, you know, maybe she needs help. Maybe she's never shopped. No, because I remember the image being, I remember the image itself being just like her shopping cart is literally a bursting with Wonder Bread. Yeah, like, I see a bunch of it. Well, think about it. She probably has no idea how to buy groceries. <laughs> but, and I'm being totally legit. Like you're you're born, you grow up with you know a, a, a butler and a maid and a nutritionist that does all of that stuff. At some point in your life, for whatever reason, you become curious about how quote unquote the other half lives. So what do you do? You get in your Porsche, you drive to whatever you think is a supermarket. You grab a cart and then you think, I like sandwiches. And you have no idea how to buy food. <laughs> so what do you do? You grab a – these are the people that leave the supermarket and think, oh, I can put different things in the same cart. Like they're so entitled. Like, oh, my God, I, I would need a different cart. I this. love how there are people on both the Twitch and YouTube chat who are just tuning in and know exactly what we're fucking right. talking about. <laughs> and and, and as, as stupid as it sounds, it makes sense. There's this idea of – and maybe the maybe there's a fetish of, oh, maybe she needs help if I go and <laughs> talk to her. I'll show her how to buy bread, and she'll be thankful to me. Mm -hmm. That's creepy. What? <laughs> yep. Yep. Sounds crazy, doesn't it? I just don't get it. Well, I didn't say I get also, it. Also, you spent about like four I don't know if we're supposed to understand it. I, yeah. You just also said there was some sort of logic chain. You definitely said words for the last four minutes, but I because certainly I wasn't paying attention. That. Sorry. Listen, I'm sorry that you're new to streaming and you don't know how to talk to the crowd. Some of us here have been doing this for years. Hey, uh, this is this is what I wonder. As as stupid as it sounds, as ridiculous as it sounds, if I had a billion dollars, how would I spend my day? I like to think that I'd sit around playing video games, streaming, and donating money to people, and that's all well and good. But realistically, as the years go on, my hobbies would probably get more stupid as I went on. Including filling shopping carts full of Wonder Bread. Filling shopping carts full of Wonder Bread for no other reason than to see people's confused looks on their faces and know that when I go home, they've all got a weird story to tell everybody. Or maybe a Y boner at the very least, because again, I don't understand who the hell jerks off to that. If, if, if they're jerking off, because I just looked at some of this artwork 
and not all of it actually most of it is not lewd Boner. it looks like it looks like mundane <laughs> pictures it is like there's a clark just, sounds for everything it's like literally it really is, yeah. exactly what it sounds like it's literally just women buying loaves of bread at the supermarket imagine getting to the tail end of no no november and you fucking lose to wonder bread like <laughs> hey soft low key comes oh, in its own protective bag i mean a hey, everything about it scream slice oh yeah put some slice. butter on the bread Gosh, you're big. <laughs> oh yeah oh, yeah, yeah. Awkward. Put some butter on it. We get some mayonnaise you, too. Oh, yeah. You underestimate <laughs> my ability to talk. Yes. <laughs> Christ, this is such a strange conversation to come into. Three hours, <laughs> and I guarantee you, with a with a, a water, I could talk this into the ground for the last hour. I'm good at it. My brain is an overactive mess. Well, I gotta kill ten more minutes. So I'm just playing. I'm playing Pac Man 256, which is pretty neat. Have we have we gone so far into the live stream that everyone is horny on main? Hey, Sandox, I'm not horny on main, but <laughs> I am horny. <laughs> according to an uh, according to an interview, it was just because Wonder Bread made them fat, and the advertising lied about that, and apparently that effed up his brain. That sounds like you're, you know. That's the that's a cat. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> that's a that's new that's new young slang. I'm sorry, I, I lost you in the slang here. Yes, that's new young slang to say that you're not lying. Basically, oh, so okay. if, I say, like, if I say, "Oh, that's a cat," uh, that's me BSing. Like I'm the best Call of Duty Warzone player there is. Uh, I'm cat. Your cap? Capping. Yeah. Capping. Oh, cat. Like like uh, I I forget what the I forget what the breakdown of it is. What the uh, fuck does that mean? I'm, it, it, the elements is like, what the hell are you talking about? I'm not making this up. This is uh, this is legit slang. Uh, uh, this is it's, it's like the like I know of busting a cap. Hearing this, capping is like I get the idea of like putting a cap on something, but capping. Chat, am I crazy? It, it is cap is slang. I'm not crazy. Can confirm it is slang. Thank you. Cap is slang for lying. I'm not crazy. This is how I operate. This is where this is this is where my brain is at peak performance because Can't you I don't just have speak fucking English. Huh? That... Come on. What? Hey, uh, th this is English. No cap. <laughs> what is cap? This is literally the first I'm ever hearing of cap. Cap is slang. slang. Cap is slang. Capping is slang for lying. I think you're lying about capping. <laughs> you think I'm cap? No, no cap. No cap. That is the slang. I don't know where it came from. I don't. What know is the correlation? Is. What is cap? What are you capping? Yeah, Greg is with it. He's cool. He's hip. Yo, keep. No, it. I don't get it. This is this is this is about as stupid as Glizzy's. Like, oh, cap is basically the same as the word tripping. So, if, oh, you tripping? No, but you see, I tell no, me. See, okay, I never understood that, but but you know what it is. I know what it is. Yes, that cap. Same thing, same thing. What? Similar. Thing. I don't know where it came from. Well, here, here's the thing. Your name is John, right? Right. Where'd it come from? Not from your father. What's the origin of the word? Oh, you mean like toilet? Well, I mean slang, but you don't know, right? No. Someone made the sound that sounded like John. You decided from now on you're going to respond to it. That's mm -hmm. how the language works. Okay, cool. You make sounds. They call them words. You respond to them. But you only gain knowledge by questioning shit. And I'm That's questioning what? what the hey. fuck is the correlation between capping and lying? I don't know. All I'm telling you is what it means. Then until I get a straight answer, I'm invalidating the meaning of capping as right. a it's slang right. word for lying because I don't buy it. And until I get a straight answer on your name, I'm not calling I mean, I wear caps. Lying. Caps are what I wear. <laughs> no cap. English slang is stupid. <laughs> You, you mean stupid like dope and cool, like fresh? Or is it stupid? Like, <laughs> like I ain't buying it yet. I'm the, yeah, I'm not buying it either. <laughs> I think you're all I think you're all full of shit. <laughs> no, no, cat. no cat. When you get some sleep, you're gonna wake up, you're gonna be like, man, that's stupid. Stop that. I understood what you were saying. 
English is BS. Yes, it is. It, man, this conversation is based. That's it. Hashtag based. Bet you never heard that one either. I don't know what capping means. Do you know what based is? Based? Based, B-A-S-D. Ba- oh, B-A-S-D. Oh, yeah, I, know, I'm people, I know people use that. See, that, that, that yeah, that's that oh. slang I guess I'm a little more familiar with, but oh. I, I don't get what it means, but I understand what it means, but like, oh. I don't get it. That's that's it that's the origin of slang you don't know why it is you don't know where it comes from you just know what it means it's it's just one of them jarring i do <laughs> no ah, yeah this is a losing argument like <laughs> i'm yeah, literally fucking yeah. talking to a you wall here. you have lost groovy what are you out. capping uh, <laughs> what are you capping <laughs> uh, I am I am capping this comment by saying uh, it's the truth and it's lit. Hold on, but you see, but you just used capping in a more I, sensical I, meaning there. That's not the same capping. I wanted to make you laugh. No, that's the wrong cap. Uh, great. <laughs> <laughs> ah! It's lit. No cap. <laughs> you think I'm crazy? <laughs> <laughs> no, but see, I know lit. I know what lit means. Uh, and what's the origin of it? Like, it's lit on fire, because that shit's fire. Ah, yeah. you figured out some meaning to it. So if I can... If I can if I no, can, because that shit is hot. If I can generate some sort of... Fault, see, now, hot doesn't really work either now, right? Because if it's, if it's lit, it's, it's probably an LED light bulb, which means they're cool. Oh, fuck you. you like, <laughs> now you're just running circles <laughs> around the thing. So yeah. you know what's you know what's uh you know what the circle is right you know the circle's round right yeah I would hope so you know what else is round what up caps I can't yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay it doesn't one does not one equal the other equal the other so it doesn't mean anything like you just, you're, you're you're literally doing everything in your power to refuse to answer why the hell fuck <laughs> capping is slang for lying and you and you know why I'm doing all of that. You know why I'm doing all of that? Yeah. Because Ben said he needed 10 extra minutes. No cap. <laughs> well, there's still two minutes left, though. So you got to stretch for a little longer. Yeah, right. but let's let's go for another slang. Uh, what the what, fuck what, what, am I getting myself slang? into here? I was tired like 10 minutes ago. That cool. And friend. now I'm fucking engaged because now I want to know. No cap. I feel like no cap. Not limiting what I'm about to say, but oh. that see, I don't see. I uh, next, I wouldn't take that immediately as lying. More like speaking without a filter, which is not the same thing. New slag, a bop. New. That's new slag. That's that's a slang. Oh, this is gonna fuck me for the rest of the year. You realize that, right? Yeah. Like people are just going to keep yeah. mentioning this on Twitch streams from now on, and I'm not gonna yeah. get it. And they know, and I'll know. No cap. This is the truth. I'm telling you. Turn me up. You why are you selling like my weed dealer? A lot of people are just put a super shit like uh bush on YouTube chat. John yeah. is missing the drip. Exactly. <laughs> and by the way, Greg has never said this on stream. I think we're ready to go with Oh thank god. Fever, Someone which... please press start. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> So playing here is going to be myself, Clark, and my partner Helena. Nah, still not. Yeah, Helena it. like does not play video games, so like this will probably be extra entertaining. Cool. No cat. Oh goodness. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what well, that sounds like. You're just making it sound like another no John. So like, that's no excuses. Right, I, 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 I also I also don't understand what the hell that means. Like. What? I, guess I just don't cat understand, cat. like, in terms of like slang, and, like, because to me, I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm more about the correlation between certain words, like, because I know, like, in, like, especially like in the fighting game community, like, no Johns, like, means no excuses, but I, like, I've heard of that, but, but why though? Like, what, what is the correlation between yeah. no excuses and no Johns? Was like the biggest bullshitter in the fighting game community just named John, and he would tell he was like maybe he was a whiny piece of shit. Maybe. I, I, uh, I mean, that, uh, that's chat. Game, but... Do we play tropical, space, or medieval? First response is what I do. Oh, fuck. I was spot on. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> medieval uh, is. Uh, Ali Mala says no Johns comes from some player who kept making excuses and it became a joke that became no Johns. Right. So, yeah. So okay, cool. That's exactly uh, what I said. That was spot I mean, on. Holy I fuck. Mean, here's the thing, though. Hmm. Do you know that? Okay. 
-hmm. Is that a verifiable fact? Or did you read it on a Twitch chat and say, that's good enough for me? Oh, man. We're getting to, like, oh, deep state fake news media here. Holy shit. <laughs> mm. I love it. deep state fake news media. Damn right. It. Google it. I'm thinking Cap is something from QAnon. Yeah, hold on. Let's see if I can let's see if I can actually find. But um, you know, we're 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 beyond those times for now, anyway. Sleep with one eye open. <laughs> okay. Uh, was popularized in Atlanta, Georgia, uh, when Young Thug and Feature released the track called No Cap. Uh, the expression "cap" is slang meaning lie or BS. <laughs> Pre-order a rap dictionary. I don't. <laughs> 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 oh, no. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> They're trying to sell me shit. Oh my god. Pac-Man was clearly mo for this game, and it's really obvious. What was it? What? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Pac-Man was what? <laughs> what? what? <laughs> For the record, I'd like to point out that John said that Pac-Man was no cap. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you so goddamn quick with that? Like, I literally just said both cameras. I, and propane I accessories. You because I am at my prime right now. This is this is when I am at my most dangerous. Uh, I am I am as quick witted as ever, but I don't have that filter in me that says don't so say something. You're probably annoying this. people. <laughs> no, John. I heard what you said. This is, this is... <laughs> Brain is too <laughs> uh, we have hold on we have a couple of more donations a toast ghost donated two dollars i really screwed up by not being more specific the voice request was meant to be luigi getting angry over a very mundane thing since i find absurd things like that funny but since i wasn't specific i have started a cursed conversation so here's two dollars as an apology i think you're the red <laughs> icky the squishy uh, donated five dollars. Hey John, just tuned in to hear the Wonder Bread Baby Booner conversation as if we reached the ten thousand dollar goal. Phenomenal work, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, to be perfectly honest, uh, five dollars from oh Joseph Robinette Biden Jr. Okay, let me see. Uh, my fellow Americans and those beyond our shores, it is my pleasure to donate to this most noblest causes for the Maybe sake the of the Philadelphia era. I must say that I do not understand these interactive visual experiences. <laughs> He's got his own fucking gold. But one thing I do understand is to heal and to show the world the power of our example. Can Mr. Ortiz please sing some of the lyrics to the Star Spangled Banner with an entire loaf of Wonder Bread jammed down his mouth? <laughs> oh Jill doesn't know my fetishes. So keep his secret. <laughs> Uh, Duskus Catball uh, donated two dollars and said about yes. the Wonder Bread stuff. Don't forget about the mass deforestation part. <laughs> um, That's what Nora said. You gotta hold the A button to activate your mag. I know they're not like telling you what you do to do things. It's like, all right, uh, this is what you gotta do. Good luck. This game just makes me want to play Mario Party. <laughs> Why do Mario Party clones not copy the part of Mario Party that makes it fun? <laughs> I'm just going into this blind. I don't know. Mario Party ruins friendships. That's kind of like the whole thing, right? So is it really fun if it ruins friendships? I mean, this, maybe. This this helps friendships if everybody hates it together. I thought you guys were going to do like the vending machine game from Sonic Shuffle. I was like, wow, what a fucking thing to reference. <laughs> Uh, that vending machine minigame is art. Um, yeah, maybe add an S and H to the word art there, and you got my opinion on it. <laughs> <laughs> well, hold on. Peter Hoffman, Sonic Shuffle okay, is the thinking man's Mario Spider Party, as in I'm thinking this is a waste of time. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I, 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 I can't agree. I think this is probably somebody's magnum opus. This is the, it's not a minigame. It's foosball. Like, what the fuck's happening here? <laughs> it looks more like a magnum opus to me. <laughs> I got a high score apparently. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Fifteen dollars from Justin. Uh, figure I donate some money since I always miss these streams. But I have a question for all of you. Have you ever had a rare collectible that you always wanted but you could never get? Oh, okay. Okay. Have you ever had a rare collectible that you always wanted but could never get due to funds? Mine personally is the tenth anniversary Sonic statue that was given to Sega employees. Uh, the, the comic cuts off. I don't know. No, it does not cut off. You finish reading that. No, no, no. What does it say? 
Oh, it really it really does cut off. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it cuts oh off my head. Oh, my God. What does it say? I'm going to read the rest of it. It says, mine sure. personally is the 10th anniversary Sonic statue that was given to Sega employees. You're capping if you think I'm paying $1,000. Anyway, uh, you all have a good one. I want to show you that I'm not bullshitting <laughs> just to show that I refuse to read capping. I'm going to screen cap. Oh, my God. I said it again. Uh, I'm going to screen grab. I'm going to screen grab. But somebody said, hold on, I want to find this comment. Reminds me of the time when Uncle called out John for saying smack dab back in sunshine. Now he no longer says dab anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, the power I wield is too great. Mega Man 6 uh, was September of that year, but it was that was still like sort of like tail end of summer. It was sweltering in the room when I was recording that script. Oh, okay. This is back when I was still living with my parents and uh, I had an AC unit to my wall. I couldn't have that on while I was recording the script. Otherwise, you hear everything. I would have to turn that off. <laughs> so, for that recording process, it was just ball bustingly hot. And it was so, I when I'm, when I'm hot, I am so uncomfortable. Oh, and yeah. When I'm uncomfortable, I flum, I, I, flum, I fumbled through the script big time, and I, there were so many retakes for so many lines in that script. The I, same, I, the same can yeah. be said for Sonic Mania. For, uh, for uh, some of the, I love that review, but recording it was a fucking nightmare. I've had when I was doing video essays, there were some times where, like for whatever reason, uh, I was just flubbing out every line, mm -hmm. and I would just put it away. Like, yeah, keep, keep the yeah. I need to step away for a bit because I'm getting flustered. Cause, yeah, because I know what's gonna happen. I'm so gonna, to read it's too. gonna become. It's yeah. gonna become. Oh, yeah, that's weird. So when this game start, okay. So when this game start, so when this game, whoa! yeah, exactly. And when it starts getting like that, you're never gonna get it right, or you're no. gonna make a mistake, or the worst thing that's going to happen is you're gonna do one that's good enough, and you're gonna say that's good enough. And later you're gonna you're gonna do all of the work. You're gonna finish the video. You're gonna watch it back, and you're gonna say, "I really shouldn't have done that." Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I don't like. I should have made another take. Yeah, yeah, I don't like what I put on the screen. And and I I got dangerously close to that, which is why I started like, okay, I'm just gonna whatever. I'll I'll take a break. I'll come back later. We'll do a live. No, it makes sense. It's just I know it, the the over thing the, didn't. The, the is where weird. is even the fast forward? That's not fast forward. It's not it's fast forward. Right. It's over. On, I, I, it How took was me, I supposed to know? I, it's I just figured direction. that out. <laughs> this game gave me so much shit when I was a kid. I don't think it cares about you being a kid. I think it'll give you shit now too. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> Elena is not happy. I'm not happy. That was ridiculous. <laughs> this isn't making us happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh, I get it. You're all getting heated. Yeah. Pac-Man fever. It's a very Pac-Man fever. I will pose a question to everyone here in the voice room. What is your favorite video from Johnny? Wait, in this, in the, in the room specifically? That assumes everybody watches my stuff. Um. I assume we all do. You, you, for for reference, you can pick uh, Pac-Man fever. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny, did, you ever, did you ever like do reviews know. of like fast food restaurants and stuff? Like no, no, Johnny no. versus like KFC? That'd be cool. No. <laughs> oh, thank you. It's just, it's just John standing <laughs> He's on a, a diet, you insensitive ass. Oh, no, I didn't mean that. It starts with the letter K. Oh, Kentucky God. Fried Chicken. No. <laughs> oh. It's John standing outside, posturing, throwing hands, <laughs> waiting for somebody to come out. <laughs> Get out here and fight me with y'all chicken. I don't really fight anybody in the family. Watch my show. Like it's cool. It's not in that way. Not oh, with, okay. like, I get I, you. I played Goldeneye, right? I, I, me and my yeah. friends played Goldeneye. No, no, no question there. Uh, but we got together and played Goldeneye. I had Mario Kart 64, and we still played Goldeneye. Yeah, right. It, it, that's okay. sort of, and that's sort of the overall thing, you know, uh, of. Not win back. Um, what the hell was the other one that everybody liked? Um, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. which one? It, it was um, 
what's the shooter? The other shooter that everybody used to like? Uh, Pokemon Perfect Snap. Perfect Dark? Perfect Dark. Uh, Perfect Dark. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, Same thing. Perfect Dark. <laughs> yeah. So, like, you know, that, like, multiplayer stuff. But, like, beyond that, uh, Jet Force Gemini, um, Mischief Makers. <laughs> I like how people respond to the other shooter is Pokemon Snap. <laughs> I, I that's like on an all rail. He's not wrong. It is a shooter. Not it's wrong. just not what you would consider to be a shooter. We call it Street Pictures. First person shooter. I, I like it. What was it called? Pokemon Cap. I like it. Uh, <laughs> Pokemon Cap. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a, it's a rail shooter. And Johnny, and uh, I'm sorry, and Clark here is okay oh. with the PlayStation. Oh, uh, yeah. For PlayStation. Oh god. I forgot it's I would have a PlayStation because the slot is a little bit bigger. Oh my god. I don't remember fucking saying that. <laughs> I, I oh, what was like the a, fucking context? It sounds like a fuck Mary kill between PlayStation, oh. Sega, and Nintendo. Oh, I would totally fuck a PlayStation, yeah. And he says it again. Oh my I would god. fuck a PlayStation. Console oh. fucking. Oh. You were talking about console fucking. <laughs> well, of course you would rather have sex it has a dick drive everyone get the fact that fever hashtag oh yeah triforce is uh that one good rpg are you talking about over now stop uh favorite moment of sgb oh without a doubt without a doubt it's Cole Phelps getting hit by the car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I no. Yeah, you, there's nothing you're gonna convince uh, me. Um, um, I will. I I, I see oh, your f your Phelps. That's one of my favorites too. By the uh, way, and raise yeah. your and raise um. So one of the last let's plays that we did before SGB went on indefinite hiatus was Spider-Man Two, uh, the one the moon based on the movie. <laughs> Well, that's awesome. And there's a sequence where you remember the, in in the movie where the fusion generator the first time was going haywire and it ends up killing like Otto Octavius' wife. Yeah. Well, I that's remember. a game. Yeah, they make it a gameplay scene in the in the um, in in the game itself, mm -hmm. and you have to stop the generator. But the thing is that the the reactor is constantly pulsating energy and it shrinks and enlarges. But the thing is, is that you have fucking. Hang on, hang on. Still so fucking far. You picked the long We're board. We're not even halfway there yet. You picked the you long board. Only, you did. The game not only has ragdoll physics, but it has pinball physics, is what I could describe it as. Yeah. He got like flung across the room. He got flung across the room multiple times, and he's just ragdolling across the entire fucking I am losing my shit just watching him go fling around all over the damn room and. Like it's 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 very it's similar slapstick compared to the Phelps getting hit by the car, but it's like times ten in my eyes. And what was the game? Was it it was was it a Mario game where he was trying to get the thing to go right? It was 3D World. Uh, <laughs> Mario 3D World. Right. Yeah. <laughs> right. Matt and I are just like fucking with each other, and it's like, and Elliot wants to get a move on. <laughs> No, th that channel is never going down. Like those videos are going to be there forever. So by all means, if you want to relive the memory, the channel is always going to be there. What's the, what's better than playing games with your friends? Uh, recording it. I don't know. A million dollars and maybe <laughs> awesome. maybe a refrigerator full of Wonder Bread. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. That sounds <laughs> delicious. A refrigerator full of Wonder Bread. <laughs> I'm gonna invite my friends over to hang out, play video games, and eat bread and record it. So, uh, Wonder Bread, I never had it. Is it good? It's okay. Yeah, it's, it's white bread. What do you expect? Oh, it's white bread. I thought it was like some sort of instant bread. I've always wondered that. Like... Blue Dino says, Sex with someone you genuinely love. You clearly never had Wonder Bread. Yeah. <laughs> You'd had Wonder Head. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that good. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> the way. <laughs> Wait, hold on, fuck it. Is that you talking to the bread, or is that the bread talking to you? <laughs> no, that's the uh, sexual wings force. Yeah, watch oh, the yeast okay. rise. <laughs> <laughs> the CPU is number one. I'm number two. Helena's number three, and Clark is in fourth place. Oh, you know what? I'm in first place. You're fucking liar. What's right? You're not the Afro dude, are you? 
No, oh, no, I'm the guy. Oh, I am in fourth place. <laughs> okay. Say <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Oh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Uh, more oh, God. <laughs> and Knight donates $2 and just says, it's my face. Well, technically it says uh, colon close parentheses, but it looks like it's mighty face. What are your thoughts on parentheses? Uh, I mean, they're not my favorite punctuation, yeah, but they I don't do know the job. why I decided to make this the conversation <laughs> right what now. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, I think my favorite punctuation is like a really well placed semicolon. God, I hate a really well placed semicolon. Yeah, stupid semicolon. I can't that. I never know which one I'm supposed to use. I know. You know a stream is ending when punctuation becomes a conversation. <laughs> you, you, oh god, it's noon. Twenty-four hours later. <laughs> oh, I cannot believe we lasted 24 minutes. Thank we you are guys. past 24 hours for Extra Lives Game Day. We're done. We're fucking finished. Yeah. Remember uh, so 24 hours ago yeah. when you started the stream and you didn't know what tap meant? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Act 2, 24 more hours. Man, Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> yes, we started off with the delicious helping of pack and cheese. <laughs> Fuck, I wasn't about to make like 20 different like cutaway scenes and say, no, one, I would, act two, no, act no, it's three. all cool, it's all cool. That'd be great. <laughs> Our goal for year one was $2,000, and we raised $6,325. Yeah, because it's Sonic, of course. <laughs> so, and that was just us going in, like having no idea what to expect. And like a few hours in, someone donated $1,000. I was like, oh, Shit, oh, we have something on our okay. hands here. We're halfway done. <laughs> <laughs> and we just, and I just remember we kept piling on and sent it's like, oh crap. Um, all right, uh, I guess we'll do the other part of Sonic 06, and Ben won't get to any of it, and then we'll play <laughs> Sonic 2 for the Game Gear, which Ben also won't get to because his MacBook doesn't want to cooperate with John's computer like it did the day on Tech Day. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just all and now we're kept, like running out of ideas. And now we're at a point where we uh, we've been consistently for the past couple of years like starting with uh, I want to say the Pokemon Master Race and beyond raised over $10,000 at least consistently every yeah, every awesome. year in a span of 24 hours thanks to you guys and I mean again I, I, I don't want to repeat like 65k I, now yeah, I, we're over 65 something dollars right? total raised and, and that's like Christ just a few more of these and we're going to get to 100,000 that's some that's oh my god I'm going to fucking cry again like, this is gonna be a repeat of Mega Maniacs. Overall team rank eighty. Eighty, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Do you see when how I check, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, in terms of uh, money raised for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, we came in third place. Uh, once again, yeah, behind Potato MBM hey. and uh, Amy Lim Zero. Uh, I'm gonna assume the D is silent on that. Uh, we managed to beat the beast, NJ, who I think we said is uh, a <laughs> the NJ actually just stands for something else, not exactly New Jersey. <laughs> and we're also number three for the state of Pennsylvania. So, apps. Oh, yeah, uh, wait, yeah, is that so true? Think, yeah, that's what it says. Yeah. Uh, one second here. Our, let me, yeah, let me, can we, our, yeah, we're also. Yeah, we are also. Yeah, absolutely right. We're third in Pittsburgh, the state of Pennsylvania. Set up the game, baby. Yeah, seriously, like, come on, on Pittsburgh. What's going on there? But thank you very much, guys. Yeah, we beat New Jersey. <laughs> the whole fucking thing. <laughs> we beat New Jersey. The whole fucking thing. We. What up with that? What up with that? What up with that? Okay, that's so bad. Yeah, this thing gets hilarious. Yeah, I know. Seriously, uh, but uh, Cherry the Beast, not Mr. Beast. Is there anything else anybody wants to say? You know what? I'm gonna give a chance to the chat. What sound did I not get to hit that you want me to do? You have 30 seconds. All right, air horn. We're going to we'll do all three. All right, we want bust a nut. I got you. Bust a nut, bust a nut. Grab a bag of corn nuts and bust a nut. And lightly toast it and hard as well. Cool. Can I get a, uh... All right.
Can I get um, a Smithers? Give, give me a Smithers. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> and let's do it in the B <laughs> formation. The Sonic Hacker Contest. <laughs> the B attack. That's right. <laughs> or uh, oh, it was a B attack, and uh, I think someone in Sonic Hacker Contest, someone left their car idling. <laughs> oh, car alarm. I got that. Uh, <laughs> or the Amazon Prime truck backing up. Oh, yeah. That's not on my board. Oh, that's supposed to be, yeah, that's, okay. that's, 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 uh, that's something to be Stu, what are you doing? <laughs> making chocolate pudding. It's four o'clock in the morning. I think Why we forgot to play this at 4 a.m. too. Because I've lost control of my life. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and someone request the action new steam the box pro. Oh, yeah, we have, let's, let, uh, wait, we should play that as we're wrapping up, I feel. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, I feel we should replay that as wrapping up. That, that said, though, because I, I do want to get the fucking sleep. I'm tired. Uh, uh, Uncle, is there anything that you want to say? Does anybody want to say anything um, before we wrap up? Uh, thank you, everybody, uh, for stopping in and for hanging out. Uh, we uh, very, very much appreciate all of the support that you've given us. Uh, uh, I don't know if there are any of you hardcore warriors out there that stayed with us through the entire 24 hours. I cannot imagine uh that anybody nope. stop, stop, stop. Stop. every second of it um so i saw some people asking where did we actually go uh you can non-stop. uh the stream shut off a couple of times uh which was not a big deal we didn't go anywhere it wasn't like we shut it off and then took a half an hour break uh yeah. so, so we were here all 24 hours uh johnny and i didn't sleep no uh, not at all we've been here the entire time i i think everybody else took a nap I took uh a nap. Yeah, you took a nap. Yeah, like uh, literally everybody else took yeah, a nap. Fine. I'm not. I'm not calling you out. I'm just saying. But yeah, I'm just saying that we're the Iron Man of the group. Uh, I <laughs> I'm not saying you're bad. I'm just saying. Yeah, no, you guys uh, are Superman no, mixed I, with like Iron Man. You guys are great. No, I I, just, I wanted to say that because I want to make sure that people understand that uh, we love uh, being able to do this stuff, and we love uh you know the fact that if we sit down and we call attention to to get everybody to help uh you guys help and we want to make sure that you understand that this is not bs you know when we say 24 hours uh we mean it we we mean that we're going to be sitting here we're yeah. going to be trying to entertain you for 24 hours we want you to go to sleep at night and wake up in the morning and turn the stream back on and uh donate a little bit more money uh for those that uh need more of a helping hand than we may be able to give them you know uh so for anybody who donated uh thank you so much and understand yeah. that you are you are tens, hundreds, thousands of miles away, and you are still able to uh, put a little light into somebody's lives uh, because this will go to people who are in situations that we cannot fathom, even in this unfathomable time. <laughs> Double so, yeah. The, the, these people have it worse. So thank you yeah. so much for Amen your support. Unfathomable. And, uh, it, it, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that wasn't me. <laughs> No, I, I said bad because I know uh, Pezzle that pushed the button. Uh, <laughs> I, I I couldn't put it better myself, so I'm not going to attempt to uh, say anything else. But we're done. We're absolutely done, guys. That is Pac-Man Fever for Extra Life's game day 24-hour uh, charity marathon. Where's my action news? All right, hang on. Let me, do, let me do yeah. a little thing here. Okay, sure. Pac-Man Fever, the Delaware Valley's leading extra light charity stream, benefiting the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, starring Johnny Ortiz, Benjamin Woodring, Chris Clark, Uncle Silver, the other members of SGB, and Ben's friends, live in Philadelphia. And... You guys are all lovely bunch of people, lovely bunch of company, lovely donators, just love all around. Hearts across the chat for both Twitch and YouTube all across the board you guys are absolute troopers for sticking uh by with it i'm going to sleep i will see you guys later this week with a new video have a good day everybody have a good night